Good morning, hoodies. What's happening here? Sheesh. Thank you for the gifted sub. Uh, J Chill, you absolute champ. Morning, everyone. Welcome in. Bravo Alpha Swaljo, A Pop, J Chill, Ace. What's up, Ace? Lady Proxy, GGO and claiming first. Ace Cat, GGO claiming not first. Well done, winners. Kawa with the 120 stream streak. Kawa. That is insane, dude. Thank you so much for the support, bro. ASAP, let's go. What's up, dude? Long time no see. Welcome, welcome. I didn't get my. Uh, fix of 76 today because it came to my parents so i'm excited are you busy playing the game dude i'm happy to hear that i'm absolutely loving fallout 76 right now lady proxy what's up dude welcome welcome smarty how you doing uh darkest what's up darkest welcome in this music's great it makes me want to make out with a distant cousin if only my distant cousin was dead was dead or wasn't dead? Good morning, all you sexy peoples. Good morning, Darkest. It's strange, but you are strange, so I understand. I uh, didn't think uh, YouTube is live. Thank you for it. I actually saw that, and then I pushed live just before I went live. Thank you, thank you. Salty, morning, Hurdies. How you doing, Salty? Welcome in. Good to see you, bro. Singularity, what's up, dude? Hey, Pop. Thank you so much for the seven stream streak, bro. Appreciate it. Blame Stu. Welcome in, Stu, baby. And Sing, thank you for that 15 stream streak. Ace Cat with 30 stream streak. Let's go, guys. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Trainee Tanker, good morning. How you doing, Tanker? Welcome in. Look at all these smexy hoodies. So many of them, bro. It's a beautiful sight to see. Kale and Pace, morning, hoodies. How you doing, Pacey? Welcome in. Silent Storm with 100 stream streak. Gib, absolutely, sir. I will give. I owe you a, a steam key. Just, I'll send it to you later. Thank you so much, Silent, you absolute champ, bro. Mr. Chrome, how you doing, buddy? Welcome, welcome. Darkest, um, C, Fora, I buy two tickets for Wheel, but both are for Twaki Plus. And thank you. Wow, Darkest, that's a very kind thing to do. Hey, this guy. So very kind. Uh, you can buy tickets, I think. Is the tickets not on sale? Is it still off? I'll just sit here standing too. You'll just sit here standing. Stu, you got to make up your mind, bro. You're sitting and standing. Acceptable Aura, thank you so much for the seven stream streak. And welcome in, Aura. Good to see you. Good morning, everyone. Happy Thursday. Thirsty Thursday, Puzzle Thursday, or Sober Thursday, depending on your style. Wacko Mernin, sir. How are you doing, Wacko? Welcome in. Good morning. Since it's not available, but you were just streaming. I know, I was just streaming 12 hours ago. Oh yeah, let me try and fix the channel point redemption now. Unavailable. Sober Thurs. Awesome. Pause your pause redemption reward for this type is not currently available to viewers. How the hell did I how's it paused? Redemptions are paused. Oh. Dude, that was fast. I feel like I just unpaused that and then you got that ticket. We got our first ticket. We got our third ticket. We got fourth ticket. Hey, Pop, you got a ticket. Oh, there we go. People be buying tickets left, right, and center. 25,000 channel point buys you a ticket. I never get to catch a stream, so I'm excited that I did. I'm also excited that you're here, ASAP. Bear, it's good to see you, man. I haven't seen you in a while. Uh, Dead Rx, oh, I'm sitting. Just something else is standing, too. Wait, what? May your day be blessed with good coffee and lots of love. Uh, right back at you, cat. Thank you so much, dude. I'm going to grab a coffee in a little bit. I haven't had my coffee this morning. Can you hand out channel points? Unfortunately, it doesn't work like that. What is the ticket thing? So we sell the tickets today, Aura. 25,000 channel points ticket. And then tomorrow, you can buy up to two tickets if you want. Um, and then on Friday, which is tomorrow, I take all these names of everyone that bought a ticket and we put it into a wheel. And then we spin that wheel. And if, as it lands on names, we pull the names out. So every hour, I spin the wheel for 10 names to be removed from the wheel. 
And then we it's just a fun game that we play. It's a way for me to get all those channel points that you guys are saving up out of your wallets and into my wallet. And then I'll part with a, a thousand rand Steam voucher to the winner. So you got a very um, slim chance of winning. Well, slim. Usually there's about 50 or 60 names in the wheel. If you got two tickets, you got a, twice the chance of getting um, your winnings. But yeah, it's just a fun little battle royale wheel. You can essentially call last man standing wins the cash and it's a lot of fun because it gets like exciting if your name is in the wheel and you know after the end of the stream we've got 10 people left uh sometimes you do a buy-in round so last uh, 10 people will do a marble race and one of the winners from the marble race will be put back into the wheel so it gives you another chance so it's just fun it's fun that we have once a month we do it we've been doing it for the last year about now maybe a year or eight months we've been doing it um, but yeah, we always try and change it up a little bit. Just a cool way to get rid of all those channel points that you guys are holding on to. Because I don't want you guys to be sitting with 200,000 channel points in your wallet. You need to get rid of that shit, bro. If you're not saving for VIP. Everyone's buying tickets. Let's go. Uh, good morning from beautiful herdies and absolutely handsome Diddy host. How you doing, Papa T? Welcome in, bro. It's good to see you. Uh, good morning, peeps. Lexi. What's up, Lexi? Welcome in, dude. Too busy uh, watching your your like a house plant. Your like a house plant. What is the the winnings of the ticket? A thousand rand voucher. Hailstorm. I see you there, dude. How you doing? Welcome in, Vamp Al. Hello, Vamp Al. Stormy. Hey, what's up, Stormy? Bro, I feel like I haven't seen you live in the longest time, Stormy. Am I just missing your streams, or are you not live? Uh, Mr. Graham, don't worry, you will have enough points for the next wheel. Yeah, if you don't have enough for this wheel, just save up for the next one. Um, you can either buy one ticket or you can buy up to two tickets. And Bob Alpha says that we tell the people to GTFO, best part of the wheel. Yeah, we get a little bit toxic with the wheel. People are like, get the fuck out of the wheel. But it's all fun and games. If you are if you are buying tickets for someone else, just disclose if you win because the tickets are automated. It's too much admin to change all the names. Yes, please, Darkest. Um, <clears throat> it's not fun. He's lying. It's better to be nailed in the beginning so your anxiety and pain and torment is ended early. That's also true. So it is probably better to. Why does my music keep stopping? I'm not stopping this stuff. It's doing it on its own for some reason. Anyway. Good morning, Mr. Starix and Hurdies. How are you doing, Lars Phoenix? Good morning, bro. Welcome in. But Lars Phoenix, the code, I know you said you tried it on the... Mi Did you try it on the Microsoft store? Not the Xbox Game Pass store. The Microsoft actual store. You have to do it from there. If it still doesn't work on that store, um, I'll try and find out if there's another key that someone wants to part with. Um, Hailstorm, you got to sell two tickets. Let's go, Haley. Uh, you can have my points in like four months. Understandable, modest. Modest be saving. You sure, modest? thousand rand bro you can buy yourself a new game uh stormy now i think i haven't streamed for like three weeks why stormy where have you been dude if i win i want daddy to take me on a date to the value of a thousand rand j chill we can go get sushi or something a couple of beers let's do that wolf wizard good morning smexy smexies how's you all doing doing fantastic wolf how are you bro welcome in no wheel for me i'm saving for that vip if I can't take your cash from you, that's understandable, but the temptation is there. Eldrin Stormblade, morning all. How are you doing, Eldrin? Welcome and good morning. Vamp Al, don't buy a ticket if you are sensitive or suffer from anxiety disorder. Yes, that's also, please. It gets very anxiety driven. The intensity is quite a lot, especially if you survive the rounds, because <laughs> every time that wheel comes past your name and then it just misses it, then you're like, oh, let's freaking go. But it's a lot of fun. A lot of fun. I'm sitting back on 472k Obux again. Wild. That is very wild. You see, because you crooked the system, Darkest. You crooked the system. Replace the needle on the record player should help with... Should I try that, Modest? Let me see if that will work. Dude, it's keep stopping. What the hell? Am I pushing a button or something that I don't know I'm pushing? Needle's broken, Modest. 
Vince has it. How you doing, Vince? Uh, as soon as I see Vince, you got me like a Pavlov dog, bro. As soon as I see your name in here, then I look there to see if I see you. Thank you, Bianca, Vince. Thank you so much. Kawa, Proxy, Apop, I appreciate you guys being in YouTube. Thank you, thank you so much. Uh, the Spawn, good morning, Oryx. How are you doing today? Spawn, I'm doing very well, thank you, bud. How are you doing? Welcome in. JC, I feel like dead should just take you on a date anyways for a thousand rand. Why do you need to win a date with him? He's not the bachelor plus. So I must just take him on a random thousand rand date darkest. Who's stopping my music? I'm not even touching anything. I love the stream. Everyone is amazing and funny. Bro, it's the best stream in the whole wide world. I'm biased though, but it is. Even if I wasn't the streamer, just this community enough for me. That's why I come back here is because all you legends make me laugh and just... I don't want to miss a second of this. I know you didn't. I know you did another rear shot on your intro pick just for me. Yeah, that was for you, Vince. Absolutely, it was, bro. I try and change it up as much as I can, make it a little different, bro. I've, I've like, I've made like a hundred images of that chick to try and get the ones that you guys are seeing on the um, intro screen. I've got like lots of them. Some of them come out so bad, bro. So weird, like the heads all just twisted and. But yeah, they look so good. I love them. Think of that's not even a real person. It's just made up by AI, man. If Corrupt could get her VIP from doing sexy times with the mod, I don't see why I couldn't do the sexy times with the person who also earned it. You got yours. F oh, that's why you bought for Twaki Kaki. You are such a ledge. Oh, Twaki's going to... We'll tell Twaki about it later. So then if he buys two tickets, that means Twaki has a four times chance of winning. He just upped his odds of getting the W in the wheel. But still, the wheel's ruthless, man. When it comes down to the last two, it's always 50-50. Yes, Dead, let's start a poll for Dead to take JC on a date. It doesn't have to be a thousand rand, though, because that's expensive. Like, just buy him chicken nuggies and a soda. I'm going to go on a date with him tonight anyway. So, I'll see you later, baby, for that date. The stream has been getting me through 12 plus hour uh, work days. Aura, it is my pleasure to be here, dude. I love hearing that. Thank you so much for helping me get through my 12 hour days. Lies, I know that is you in the art, but you got me, Vince. Just don't tell anyone, please, sir. I'm embarrassed. I've got a nice figure, hey? Vega, what happened to Vega? How's it, Vega? How you doing, buddy? Welcome, welcome. Uh, I just upped the odds of anxiety plus. You did. Twacky Kaki. GG on claiming two tickets. Pro, how you doing, Tux? Welcome in. Oryx, can we refund Stu's ticket? I uh, was trolling. You can refund it. Oh, what? What? Ha if you refund it, then I'll refund it on this side. Well, what happened? <laughs> You can refund it in the um, channel points and I'll just need to remember to remove his name because all the names have been placed into a word document. So I just take that document and put it in the wheel. I've been uh, learning Korean, bro. Have you really? Stormy, that's exciting, man. I just miss your streams. When are you streaming again? Or is it, uh, you don't want to talk about it? Good morning, Mr. Oryx. How are you doing, Sigma? Welcome and good morning. I'm all good, thanks. And you, Diddy? I'm fantastic. Thank you, Vega. Hey, Cozy Corner, Sal, how you doing, bro? Good morning, y'all. Good morning, Sal. Welcome in, Mr. Chrome. You got yourself a ticket. What game we starting with today? Oh, Fallout 76. Why, Dan? Why are you asking, bro? Strife just uh, got on. What's the ticket for? How you doing, Strife? Welcome in. The ticket is for the anxiety wheel, dude. We're doing it tomorrow. So buy the tickets today. We'll do the wheel tomorrow. How you doing, Strife? Good to see you, bro. Uh, Derek's, I bought a second ticket for Bravo. That's fine. No, you don't refund it then. It'll keep it. I just your name stays in there. If you win it, Stu, then you can give it to Bravo. Um, what did you try and say there, Wolf? Y T R S T D Z. Interesting. I agree with you. Seeing as we can buy more than one, yeah, you can buy more than one. Guess you don't believe in democracy. 
I do believe in democracy with all my heart. With all my heart. How many can I purchase? Up to two, Strife. Two tickets. Oaks, but I told them I only have 2k points. Oh, <laughs> oh Bravo Alpha. Silly goose. Stu, didn't you want to buy two? Well, Stu just got two for himself then. I must just remember to add all the mods. Mods get a free ticket. I was cleaning my keyboard during my stream, sir. I thought you were having a stroke, maybe. Doesn't feel like it. Well, if you can find Lycan and Mommy Corrupt, then yes. Then we can do some diving into democracy. Two tickets done. Hey, let's go, Strife. Yeah, I got your tickets, bro. How are you doing, man? It's good to see you, Strife. For the Empire. Democracy is for the weak. For the Empire. I bought two tickets for Mr. Chrome. Hey, let's go. Did you... Yeah, I see you got one there. Are they, all the tickets are being placed in a Word document. Just for backup. We got two ways of recording the tickets because... If one system fails, we got another system as a backup. Because once we had a bad instance with the, we lost the the record of like the last few people that bought tickets a few months ago, and that was super stressful. So never again. We've got a backup system now, so there's no ways it can fail us. The system needs to work. I'm good and busy. Hope you're well, my friend. I'm very well. Thank you, dude. I'm glad you're busy, man. It's good to be busy. There. Are you busy with the plumbing company still? You're still working there? Uh, Stu, uh, Dead Rx, one ticket was for acceptable. Looks like it's two now. Who's Bravo again? Okay, um, it's still going to be your name in the wheel. Just If you win, just give it to Aura then. But that's very kind of you, Stu. Aura, you got yourself into the wheel. Just look out for not blame Stu's name. Don't scratch your balls on stream. Why? Don't tell me what to do, Vince. Yaku the bonus, you got yourself a ticket, sir. Oh, it's this old man again. It's me, sir. Yes. In the flesh and blood. Welcome into my bar. How's it, OMC? Did you receive my tickets? Did you give me a ticket, bro? If you bought one, absolutely we did, sir. Absolutely. We got a foolproof system. I see your name even on this side. Hemoglobin Slayer. How you doing, Hemo? It's good to see you, buddy. Zero, I can't get a ticket. I'm short, lol. How short are you, bro? Don't worry, we do it once a month, Zero. So if you can't get one this month, you'll definitely be able to get two next month. GT. Why are you buying tickets, bro? You confused the system, man. If you're a mod, don't buy a ticket. Don't no, you confuse. I can't. I confu it's too confusing. As soon as we're changing names, it's like the system. You must just, just. Um, I'll keep. No, 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 no. My brain. No, you can't buy. And mods can't buy anyone tickets either. So you, sorry, GT. You can't buy anyone a ticket, but you don't have to pay for your tickets. That was the other rule. I remember mods can't buy any. Otherwise, you get free tickets and you just buy other people tickets, right? So, can we refund GT? GT, can you refund yourself? Plus. Plus. You're using your outside voice with me, Dick. <laughs> Vince, you're funny, bro. I was. I'm so sorry. I'll go back to my inside voice. Time to win the wheel of... For my birthday, Buggy. You but when's your birthday again? I hope I never forget don't forget your birthday, because I've asked you for your birthday like three times. Yeah, GT Plus man, tell her bravo. 
Bless, sorry guys, I tried. I know you tried. But just stop. Jesus, GT. You're making a goddamn mess of the system here. When did this rules get implemented? It got implemented long time ago. I don't know. <laughs> oh, whoops, it's fine. You don't know? I don't, does someone know how to do the refund? Vora knows how to do it. If Vora is here, can you just remove any mods? Um, return their funds, please, to them. The little shits. Done. Thank you, Vora. I just need to remove the mods off of the, the document. I just cracked open a beer. Let's go zero. It is Pooza Thursday, so why not? I just asked if it was adorable. Jesus, bro. Stop it, Vince. You stop it. No, please don't ever stop being so fucking hilarious. It's good for your channel, OMC. Just remove my name twice when the real happens. We'll do that. But we sent your points back, GT. How you doing, GT? JP Sweek, what up, what up, Herdies? How you doing, JP? Happy Turd's Day. Well, I'm seeing a happy Turd's Day to you, JP. I don't mind. I know you don't. Did you read the terms? Yes, GT. Did you even read the terms and conditions? It's Oh, yes, yeah, 420. How could I forget? Do you want to know how I can forget, Buggy? I can tell you. That is, bro, on Saturday. We're not even going to be live on Saturday, buggy. You let oh shit. Silent Storm's birthday is also 420. No, no, May the 4th. Who else's birthday is 420? There's another person on 420. Darkest Pussy Thursday. I thought it was Thirsty Thursday. That's why I tried to flirt with the OMC and ended horribly so i won't be trying that shit again no you must never stop trying keep trying no one ever read the t's and c's you should read the t's and c's it's very important gt i always read the t's and c's always That's a lie, GT. We've established that Spurk does. That's his hobby. Yeah, we did establish that. I was literally thinking when you said T's and C's. I was like, no, you must chat to Smurf. That guy always reads the T's and C's. Sorry, Zero. GT just... Never mind. Yo, that Juicy Pickle, what's up? Hey, Oryx. Hey, Juicy. Welcome in, bro. Welcome back. Thank you for popping back in. Don't burn out those Obux, bro. Save those things. We do Because next month, you can get yourself into the wheel of anxiety. Win yourself a $50 Steam card voucher. Like Alex. Hello, folks. How you doing, Lex? Welcome in. How you doing? Diddy and Hoodies, I must go adult. Unfortunately, I'll be back later. Good luck with that. Understandable, bro. You're an adult. You got a life. Go and take care of the things. And I'll be right here when you get back, sir. Um, to, oh, I see the scam will purchase is active. Are you going to get one? You better. You know, I will be here, bro. Ready to receive you. T's and C's, we're using your data. Thanks. Pretty much. They're just a long winded document to tell them that your data now belongs to them and they can do what they want with it they can even sell it and make money off it and you've got no right to it so that's like how facebook was like if you actually read the t's and c's like any photo that you put on facebook it's like or instagram like belongs to him now you are no longer the owner of that property or some shit like that it's like but not like they really implement it but if they wanted to they can be like that's our photo now that photo of your grandma belongs to facebook well, see, I'm going to get a hoodie made. If you find me relatable, seek help. So people know I'm doing my parts. That would be a very good hoodie. I think you should do it. The band. What? They banned, they banned him? I don't know what you're trying to say, GT. I 
I want to understand what you're trying to say. But I just can't. You said photos belong to him. The band? Him? Is there... Oh, okay. So there's a band called Him. Alright. Now I get it. I didn't know that there was a band called Him. Took me... What's Him? Him is a Finnish gothic rock band from Helsinki. First formed in 1991 by vocalist Val uh, Valo. Val, Val, Val Valo. I know this guy. Oh, that's the guy that's saying. Oh, he's, I know him. I know him. I didn't know he was part of a band. I thought he just had that one hit wonder. You know? He sang that Frank Sinatra song. Rip that joke. Yeah, that joke was an epic fail, bro. But even if I understood the band, him, probably would have been a little bit of a fail anyway. Him was so good. I'm sure you would like that. I know you guys like your heavy rock and rolls. I wasn't a very big, like, what's it, metal band guy. Gothic. Finnish gothic rock band. But I'm sure it was good. Did he only listen to old people's music? Well, I am old, vamp. So I listen to music, the music of my time. Oh, we used to party to this song back in the 40s, man. Good times, those good times. How are you doing, Vamp? Welcome in. Sherrod, good evening. Pleasant surprise to see you on. That was fun yesterday. Thanks for letting me come along. Uh, absolutely, bro. It was a lot of fun yesterday. We'll do it again today if you want to join. Uh, His Eternal Majesty. Are you talking to me? Okie dokie. <laughs> Modest, thank you for the look, bro. Appreciate it, man. All right. Are we going to get this fallout started? Yo. I went to bed late last night, eh? Uh, get me a drink, Oryx. What would you like? A new Coca-Cola, eh? Would you like... We just got in a whole lot of stock of Sunset Sarsaparilla. That juice pickle, if you want one of those. They taste good. They're fresh. Only got like 5% 5, 5 radiation in them. Might burn your the top of your lip, but tastes good. Yeah, but they aren't all that heavy, did he? Actually, quite chilled. Oh, is it? Yeah, I saw it wasn't a heavy metal band. It's a rock band. And I actually liked the one cover he did, that Val Valo cover. Um, what was it? It was a cover of a, a Nancy Sinatra song, I think. Oh, I'll play it for you. You'll know it when you when you hear it. Follower, Johnny Walker. Fuck, I've been waiting for you to follow me for a long time, Johnny Walker. Step right in. Summer Wine is the song. Bucket's a good song, this, eh? This is, uh, Vil Valo. Sup, bro? Sup, Johnny Walker? Ew, who listens to young people trash music? Derox, we need this on a new hoodie hoodie. Yes. I like that. What episode you on OMC? Um, for Fallout, I'm, I'm still on you on 5th one. So yesterday I watched the uh, newest episode of Shogun. I went to bed at like 1 in the morning. He's got a good voice, eh? Hey? This full fellow. Get that man of bells. Well, we got Johnny Walker in our presence. It has to be Johnny Walker. Nuclear Flood, thank you so much for the lurk, buddy. And you got yourself a ticket. No, this is itchy. Sherrod, I might need a hand with the Deathclaw mission if you have time. I need to make it a friend or something, but be Friday if you're on. Yeah, absolutely, Sherrod. I'll be on on Friday. Mm, let me know. I'll help you out. Damn, you must be tired. No, no, I'm good. I ain't tired. I was built for this, Johnny Walker. How did you go to sleep so late, but no fallout? Because I finished my stream at 7 o'clock last night. And then I um, spoke to Sing and um, Multi the Northman for half an hour. Went for run and exercise, which takes an hour and a half. So then that's like 9 o'clock. 
Then I did some work till 10 o'clock. Then Furious came home and was like, let's watch an episode of Shogun. 11 o'clock, we finished that. Then I tried to go to sleep and I couldn't get to sleep. I just lay in my bed for two hours. Well, it wasn't one o'clock. It was like maybe half 12. No, it was closer to one. Because I even went to go and get some Biltong out the cupboard at half 12, 12.30. Yeah, it was just one of those days where I didn't get much sleep. Did I tell you a story about Johnny Walker Green? Mm -mm, no, you didn't. Sign me up. What's up, Flailing? You got yourself a ticket, bro. Welcome in. It's good to see you, Banana. Good morning, OMPC Deadox. Zuma, good morning. Welcome in. Remember when JW was removed from uh, the shelves? What? No, why was it removed from the shelves? I don't remember that. Well, I think your bar might need a new coat of paint or some uh, rustelium. What are you trying to say, J Chill? Say my bar's rusty. It's the, it's the apocalypse, dude. We're surrounded in radiation. It's been 200 years. Where are we going to get a fresh coat of paint from? We're in this wasteland, sir. Jack's paint closed down 200 years ago. Vinegar removed rust. Well, we can find some vinegar. We definitely got vinegar somewhere in the wasteland. Zuma, good morning, all you beautiful herdies. Morning, Zuma. How are you doing, buddy? Welcome in. I don't remember that either. Yeah, I don't. When was Johnny Walker taken off the shelves? Can I have a shot of your best malt? My best malt. I've got to go get it around the back, bro. I've got to go through a couple of safe doors. We keep that under lock and key. All the good stuff. But I'll sort you out, Johnny. You don't want a Johnny Walker? I can get you a fresh Johnny Walker over here. It's been in the bottle for about 200 years. But. Tastes like it was brewed yesterday. Well, it came out of the barrel of casks yesterday. Is there a reason for the uh, zero, 007 music in the background? 007 music? What music do you hear? This is just a playlist from... This doesn't sound like 007 music. Are you talking about the Val Valo song? Sorry, I was just playing a Val Valo song for everyone. We're, we're talking about Val Valo earlier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know this? It's a good song, eh? I love that song. That song's from the early 2000s. It's a cover of the um, Nancy Sinatra song. Buggy Wugsy, it's not rusty. It's just dookie for flavor for your next meal. Exactly. It's not much I can do about this bar, guys. It's not like you guys have got a better bar at home, do you? So when I left my job in Cape Town, my boss gifted me a bottle of Johnny Walker Green. I only opened it when I moved into my new place and my one housemate mixed it with coke. I was so upset. Sis. Yeah, it's fine. How you hit me up then? Also sweet. Coming right up, sir. Another hero. Lol morning. Good morning, another hero. Welcome in, dude. Did you know Oppenheimer and Barbie are both banned from playing in Russia? Really? I can believe that. I definitely can believe that. I don't think the Russians like to consume um, American media. The same as the Chinese. They don't like to consume it that much. Although they do get the movies. They have heavily um, um, edited to fit the, you know, what the Chinese Communist Party want the people to see. That's why there's no YouTube, there's no Google, like in China, it was like a censored version of those things. In Russia, I don't even know, maybe. Maybe also censored. I'm loving the Diamond City Radio. Let's go, it's such a vibe, Crackling Clown. It's an absolute vibe, bro. I love this, the Fallout music is a treat. It really is. And what's cool is, 
you can there's some songs that like fit with the the, the fallout 76 so you can i've been adding songs to the playlist to change it up a little bit but still within the um the sort of sound of 76 so you won't even notice that it's not a song from one of the fallout games uh, are you supposed to drink it on the rocks game of tunny whiskey's always meant to be drunk neat without actually any um, ice or anything it's just straight and it's like not even cold like a room temperature but then from that anyone i guess can do how drink it how they want some people like to add a block of ice because it dilutes the flavor and adds some other notes to it maybe but yeah i'm not much of a whiskey drinker i do enjoy a whiskey but i'm not like you know some whiskey drinkers are so set in like how they drink their whiskey how it must be served how it must be kept have a cigar with it it's not like you have a better bar at home either. Oh, wait. This is my bar, bro. What are you talking about? You're looking at it. Ding, ding, ding. Did you hear? Made out of solid steel. <coughs> Johnny Walker Green. That time was so rare because it wasn't in stores anymore. It was highly priced uh, when you find someone who sold it. I kind of maybe remember that. It sounds familiar. So you know my uncle. <laughs> Johnny Walker, where are you from, bro? Can I find this playlist somewhere? Do you have Spotify? Spotify is also free if you want to listen to it with ads. I pay, so I don't have any of the ads, but I will share the, it with you right now. So this is the playlist. So this is just a playlist from Spotify. It's called Fallout Radio. There's 150 songs in it. And like I said, some of the songs aren't... I didn't put this playlist together, but I add songs like as I'm, I'm streaming. But not all of them, like I said, are, are from Fallout. But they're part of the Fallout-esque. And listen to it. It's lovely. All the songs are good. Wait, what did I miss now? You didn't miss anything. Don't tell him what he missed, guys. I'm from South Africa, Worm. Uh, let's go. I know that place. My mom and my dad are actually both South African. It only recently came back, OMC. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Because I do remember like something like that. There's no Johnny Green. Diego discontinued Green Label globally in 2012. Okay, yes, there we go. Like three years back now, I think. What did I miss as well? Just me, Zumo, you sweet man. And have you bought your tickets for the Wheel of Anxiety, Zumo? Oh, you have. I see two tickets for Zumo there. Sweet, sweet Zumo. The bar is built from 100% American Adam Dreams. You know it. Full of radiation, this thing. If you scratch the paint... You release some more of that radiation. It's stuck into this thing, bro. Thank you, thank you. Do you use... I do use Spotify. It's great for expanding your taste in music and would recommend to everyone. Not sponsored. Me too, bro. I've found so many good songs through Spotify. That I love that Spotify radio feature where you take any song, right-click and go listen to radio. It takes that one song and it creates you a list of songs that are compatible with that song. It's like the best, bro. I love it. So do you get my rage now? Why I was so tilted when he added coke to it? Yo, I'm angry all over again. <laughs> GT, calm down. It was a long time ago. Times have changed. You can still get, you can get Green Walker. Oh my gosh, you can get Green Walker. Viper Death Angel, Coke and Clippies, GT, it's always a winner. Viper Death Angel, good morning, you amazing legend, and to all the herdies. Hello, my friends. Hope you all have a splendid Thursday. I love all the herdies, and may this day, this day's content make you have all the good emotions. We'll be lurking and working, so enjoy. And Daddy, once again, thank you for also putting a smile on my face. Viper Death Angel, I can say the goddamn same thing about you, sir. Thank you for putting a smile on my face and thank you for the kind words. Appreciate it so much. He's too kind, dude. Or R&R. &R. I love me an R&R, &R, but I need an authentic one, Johnny. I need R&R &R and it must be the raspberry. Not the, ra the, um, the raspberry, but it's the... What's the name of it? The one from Mozambique. Not the one that you get here in um, the spas. 
This, the tip, yeah, the tip of Tinta one, the, the one that it's called, um, what's the name? It's on the tip of my tongue now. Um, Moringa, Moringa. Moringa is the one. Not Sparberry, Moringa. That's news to me uh, with the radio feature. I mainly use the weekly Discover and Smart Shuffle. The crackling Clown, bro, the radio feature. If you find a song that you like, right click that song, go to radio. It's going to build you a playlist of music compatible to that song. It's a beautiful feature. I don't even use Discover Weekly anymore. I like this song, Mr. Sandman. Remember back in the day having to buy all your music and store it on your PC? Spotify has changed my life. Yeah, Winamp, Winamp. It really whips the llama's ass. That's who had Winamp. I used to have Winamp and I had like thousands of songs and it was legit like a treasure to me. Like I, Winamp, I cuddled in my arms with all my fucking music. Like I was so protective over my Winamp library. I think I had it backed up on different hard drives. Because I had like songs on there that are gone. I'm telling you, I had like such interesting music on my Winamp. You remember going to lands and the first first few hours of a land is like copying music amongst each other, copying uh, videos. Fuz, hola dead, hello Fuz, how you doing? Welcome in. So lovely to see you. You weren't live this morning. My mornings, Fuz, without you are just the worst. I feel I don't have the energy to keep going on days where you're not streaming. Please stream every single day, Fuz. Every day. Winamp had some sick skins. It did. Oh, yeah. I remember the skins too, man. I did. You were just up late. Really? You did stream, but I was... Oh... No, no, I'm sad. Were you really? Oh, you're, you make, don't say things like that. When I'm, it really whips the llama's ass. Yes, it does. How's your day going? How was your day today, Fuse? Did you enjoy your day off from streaming? Guys, if you haven't, I'm going to, sorry, I don't. Ooze. I'm giving a shout out, but I, don't anyone follow this woman. Otherwise, you won't ever watch my streams. You'll all just go and watch her streams. Don't follow her, please. The last thing I need you to do is follow this woman over here right there at twitch.tv forward slash foozpoozy. Don't do it. I promise you, you will regret it. She's awful. She'll swear at you. No, I'm just kidding. Please go and hit the follow button. She's the best content creator out there. Best vibes. My very first OC LAN, I copied a 10 gig music video folder from someone back then. 10 gigs was Matt. 10 gigs was huge, bro. I remember my neighbor's father got a 20 gig hard drive when I was in high school and he paid 20,000 Rand for it. He paid a thousand Rand a gig. And it was like, I had a, I had a one gig hard drive. I've been late to OMC stream plenty because of Foo's. Bro, I've been late to my own stream because of Foo's stream. She's got this magnetic personality. When you start watching, you just don't stop. She's so real on the screen. Like, I love that about you, Foo's, is there's no... It's, it's all real. It's all real. What you see is what you get. There's no bullshit behind it. It's a beautiful sight to see. You guys should go and do it. You should go do it. I've been late. Oh, I read that already. And don't tell me that, Jay Chill. You're breaking my heart, bro. Breaking my fucking hearts. How many nerds here went to the Mayhem Lands in the East Rand? That place was wild. Somehow always smelt like sweaty people. What's on the agenda today? I'm going to play some Fallout. As you can see, I'm in my Fallout bar. So I thought I'd jump back into the Fallout. I'm loving it, eh? I'm all about that fallout. Yeah, I went to the Mayhem uh, lands, darkest, but I went to like the Thousand Man land in uh, Vatikloff Air Force Base. 
And there was uh, another land. It was at Kailami. Also, uh, Mayhem, Thousand Man Land, Nag, sponsored and all that crap. I went to there. Did you ever, did anyone go to the Vatikloff Air Force Base land where they try to beat the record for the biggest land in the Southern Hemisphere? And we did beat the record. I mean, McGuinness were even there walking around with clipboards. And they, they went, came behind me. I was on my computer busy watching a movie. And they were like, sorry, sir, would you mind opening a game? So I'm like, oh, okay. And then they were like, just open up Solitaire. So I was like, open up Solitaire, and then they ticked off. Okay, next. And they went, and then we actually broke the world record for the biggest LAN in the Southern Hemisphere. Before that, it, it got entered into the Guinness Book of World Records. Australia hosted one, and they beat our record. So they, Australia got their name put into the record book. I remember that was the situation. But yeah, that was a man LAN. Fuck a miss, uh, Naglang. Naglang was power, bro. But that was before the internet. We didn't even have internet back then. Those Windows XP days when uh, the 80 gig was pretty much the standard. Bro, I had a 1 gig. Bro, I used to have a 286 computer. with I didn't even know the size of the hardware. I was probably like a meg. Do you fall out in this game? Do you fall out? Did you just ask me if I fall out in Fallout Fuse? I'm gonna, I'm gonna pretend I didn't read that. <laughs> I got no words. I just miss lands. We should have a land. Why not? I'll see myself out. No, don't leave though. Don't leave. Don't leave me, Buzz. Please. Daddy falls in, I fall out. Thought it was fall in. It's, not, it's fall out. I only ever went to the Mayhem land in Boxburg, but only somewhere. We should have our own Mayhem land. It's just, he is crazy son of a gun that asks you that word. Right? Crazy. The people here. Third con win. I don't know. We need to speak to Wolfie, bro. When we got Wolfie, can organize herd con, land con, herd land, I mean, herdy land. <laughs> oh, God. Um, what you looking at, Buzz? Who's. He kicked the bucket in, old man. Nah. Old man Moses dead. Some of this music is quite hectic, eh? Like the butcher, he went a hacking and a slashing. Like it's old school music, but some of it must have been like your parents being like, don't listen to that music. But we are some crazy people in here, I think. Um, no, Johnny Walker, we 100% are. 100%. It takes a crazy to know a crazy. We're all a little bit nuts. But it makes life more fun like that. Who wants to be boring when you can be a little bit crazy? Hey? It's way more fun. When Wolf stops uh, talking dead and furious, what, what stops taking dead and furious for a ride and charging them for doing crazy things like quizzes and pooping at their house? It's exactly it, bro. Facts, Fuse. Exactly. You know it. Because this woman's absolutely insane. Oh, okay, Worm. Boring means no drama. I'll out? take boring. Aww. No. Aww. Is that a prank? Is he in the house? Blanky, thank you so much for the bit. He's salty. No. Crazy means no drama, bro. Because crazy people don't have time for drama. We're too busy being crazy. It's the normal people that cause the drama. We know there ain't no drama here. Shush. I don't have time for drama. Too busy being crazy, bro. Fuse Pusey. <laughs> Why didn't the placky thing uh, pop up? What plucky thing? Plucky, thank you for the biddy, sweetie. 
How you doing? Good morning, dead and hoodies. God, you look so normal today. Stop it with your drama, you llama. Hashtag stuff your scam wheel. But I can see you gorgeous human being. There we go. Get a ticket for that scam wheel, Plucky. Yo, you make me laugh. You bring a tear to my eye, literally. Oof, you guys. That's why I come here every day. It's because you guys are so f funny. You bring a smile to my face. Boring is best. Hitman's bodyguard. Boring is best. No, Zero. Why do you want to... Why do you want to be boring? You're not boring. You're a fun guy. GT, what are you doing? Why are you burning all the bucks? Like, I appreciate you burning the bucks. Yeah, she flexing, Jonesy. I can see that now. Look at GT. You think you're so cool with all your O bucks, eh? GT's fancy. What else should I do with it? I will find something for you to do with it. Yeah, I guess so. You're a mod. You kind of get everything for free anyway. What else are you going to do with the burners? I'll find something else. Actually, I must make a... You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to make a, a, a giveaway for the mods. And then they have to pay 30,000 channel points for the giveaway. How about this for a giveaway for the mods? I will buy the mods this thing. You're going to... Maybe it's not for GT. I don't know. Look at this thing, bro. I'll buy this, and then you mods, if you win it, I'll, I'll take your channel points then. We'll make an exclusive wheel for the mods to win a Fallout little Funko Pop. Doesn't this guy so goddamn cute? Check, he's even got a little wine for you, GT. No, you're not bad. You're going to buy another wheel. Eh? So I was thinking of buying this little shit. Funko 5 star Fallout Boy. It's weird that it's in a bigger box. But I want one. I'll spend 30k. Hey, how cool that juicy pickle. Well, you add it. Can you discount VIP too? Thanks. How much you got there, Fuse? Oh, I also want to redeem. I've got something I need to redeem in your channel, Fuse. My own letter. But how are you going to send it to me? Are you going to post me a letter all the way to South Africa? I would love that. It would be like a dream come true. I'll put it on my on my wall. It'll go, it goes straight onto the fridge. Cleric's up, Oryx in chat. What's up, Cleric? How you doing? Look, GT, baby pucks, pup suck. It will hurt Brian's teeth or MC. Oh, yo, what it does, bro. <laughs> yo, GT funny, man. That is super cool Funko 5 star. It's cool, eh? I want to get one. So, APOP, there's actually... I don't want to tell you, Oaks, because you guys are going to buy it. No, I'm just kidding. You must go and buy it. Um, comic Warehouse. I think it's Comic Warehouse. Check this, bro. Hundred and twelve brands, bro. Add to cart. Check. They on sale. Fifty five percent off. Hundred and twelve rand for this Funko. I'm buying it. I might even buy all three of them actually. I, or the definitely the gas one. Maybe not. Oh, maybe this one. Now I want all of them. You see, I can't fucking do this shit, bro. I can't buy stuff. Otherwise, I buy all of it. But there is is on sale. Of course, if there is a mailing man, there is a way. That's the that's the problem. Make her courier. The post office in South Africa is a little bit dodgy. There's a there's a good chance you're not going to get your stuff. But if it's a letter, it should be fine. As long as you don't put any money in there, Fuse. And I know you will. But look, I'm just kidding. Yeah, as long, I think as long as there's no money in it. For some reason. When money comes through the South African post office, your letters get opened and the money gets taken out. It gets taxed right away and it gets resealed, eh? 
has anyone had money sent overseas and then like i remember like my girlfriend back in the day her gran used to send her a letter with money for her birthday and christmas and every time it would arrive it would arrive resealed with red tape but the money was always gone too much trust uh in south african postal service uh, Comic Warehouse is dope. Well, there's a sale, bro. I'm going to get it. Alberton is a great place. I'm going to order it too for delivery. I'm not going to go to Alberton. Is there Yu-Gi-Oh? I don't know. Check the check Comic Book Warehouse. They've got some cool stuff. Hashtag not sponsored. Uh, go to Comic-Con. You can pick them up. It's all the way in Cape Town. You should actually go to the store, Diddy. It's a really fun experience. Are you going to pick me up this weekend and take me? Well, next weekend, this weekend, I'm busy. Retail therapy, Dead Oryx. I need to do some retail therapy. Sometimes you just need to buy something like shit, you know? Because you always have to, you know, paying bills, rent, and, you know, car payments, insurance. Every now and again, you need to buy yourself a little toy to relive that inner child, you know? Just buy something frivolous. Can't be just... Respond if you're one of those people that are just responsible. If you're not responsible with your money, then don't go and buy these Funko Pops. Save your money. But if you're responsible with your money and you don't ever buy anything frivolous, then sometimes it's good to get some retail therapy and then buy something silly like a Funko Pop. The only Funko Pop I want is the Dead Oryx one. Do you remember those Dead Oryx Funkos? Well, see, I'll be back now. Johnny, don't take long, eh? Be safe out there. I went to buy a new bingo yesterday and left with a bag of goodies. What did you buy? Post office can't read, so it's fine. They can only see money. I don't know how they see the money through the letters. Do they scan it? Or do they just take a chance and open it? Well, Comic Book Warehouse is by me. I know the one. There's one in Ramburg, right? I've been to that one several times. If I go to the Comic Book Warehouse, I will go there. I wouldn't mind going to Comic Book Warehouse, bro. I'll buy myself some Pokemon cards. Some Funkos. And maybe a, a shirt. I want to get a Fallout onesie for winter. That's what I really want. Sometimes you need to buy some beers. Exactly. No, beers are... No, that's not a frivolous experience though, Zero. That's part of the bills and the car payments and things. That's beers are included in that. That's not frivolous. Frivolous. Bong, cleaning gear, oh, papers, blunts, uh, backwards, trays, pipes, gummies, buds, stickers, and a cap. Hey, you went all out, Plucky. Hey, let's go. You must send a picture of your winnings if you do a purchase like that. OMC, Oryx, hoodie, plus. You've already got one. Not the one in Randburg. Go to the one in Alberton. Is it better than the one in Randburg? I'm going to be eBaying for Fallout 76 Collector's Edition. Uh, that is a life-size helmet. It's been in storage since 2015. Thanks goodness for the show. Yippee! -yay. There was also a Pit Boy with Fallout 4, I think. Smallville Comics. Let me check. I remember Smallville Comics. Where is this place? Online store. Oh, small full comics doesn't have any forks, fallout um, loot. Nada. Just comic books. Yeah, I'm selling that too. It's sealed. It's still sealed. 2015 was bad. Yeah, my wife got sick, and so all my toys was put in uh, the back burner.
So wait, you're selling the things, Sherrod? You're selling the pit boy and the helmets on eBay? Surely you should be able to get a good uh, amount for it because of the show, yeah. Smallville is in uh, Alberton. I wouldn't mind going out to a comic store one of these days. Tomorrow, I mean Saturday, I'm going to go get my driver's license renewed. DC or Marvel? Um, I DC. I, I prefer, you know why? Because Batman. Batman is the only, like, I like Batman. DC, unfollow. Why? Batman is just better, exactly. Unfollow. It is. I used to be in Albertson City until they opened a new store. Go back to the bar scene. Batman beats everything. Yeah, he's got money, bro. He's rich. I don't think I can watch the stream anymore. Do you read comics, Vince? Batman is a worse Iron Man. Mizuki. Why are you guys hating on Batman so much? I thought everyone loved Batman. You guys don't like Batman? Batman was so good. Did you guys watch the Nolan movies of Batman? Flip. You know when a movie is good is when my dad can watch a, a movie like Batman and be like in awe because it's so good. And he's old and he's older than me. Imagine how he old old he is. Uh sh Shroud, that is awful, bro. That is very, very sad. I'm sorry to hear that, dude. Sheesh. DC is dark in general. Yeah, it is dark in general, right? Thanks for my shot, OMC. Absolutely, Johnny Walker. You enjoy. You enjoy. Uh, I'm out, Um and groupies. Johnny, it was good seeing you, bro. We'll hopefully see you again soon, buddy. Don't be a stranger. Don't run. Just walk. Keep on walking. I had all of them, and then I borrowed some out now. I don't have them all anymore. Anyone heard of Comic Chew? No, I've never. Is that what you're talking about? Zero Comic Chew? I've never heard about that. I won't run. Good man. Don't tell him what to do, Vince. Listen, bro. I'm getting sick and tired of your attitude around this this place, buddy. You need to be. You need to be yeah, I can't English. God damn it. I was trying to say something. You need to be knocked down a peg, sir. But first, I need to have a cup of coffee because I can't brain, Vince. Please, can you go get me a coffee, Vince? With two scoops of mayonnaise. Thank you. Do you guys like one teaspoon of mayonnaise with your coffee or two teaspoons of mayonnaise? I always find, like, so many people go for one teaspoon of mayonnaise. I always, I've always had two teaspoons of mayonnaise in my coffee. Just one just doesn't cut it. doesn't elevate the, the flavonoids anymore. And also, I only go for, um, only go for um, cross and back, black wool mayonnaise with your coffee. Um... If you guys enjoy superhero things, uh, you should watch Invincibles on Prime. Okay, sweet. I, I'm busy watching Fallout at the moment, bro. Hooked. And then after Fallout, there's something else I need to start watching. I'm s I need to catch up with shows. Just time, life, stream. Shows that just take a back seat. I'm trying to register an account Comic Warehouse to get Funkos, but the site's so poo. Maybe go and message him and say, them, hey, sorry. Your sight's poo. Love Keaton Batman. Uh, saw that in the theater. I did too. I did too, Sherrod. Keaton Batman in theater. Back when I was young. The fuck, bruh? What? Mizuki? Tangy, you, zero, you do the tangy mayonnaise in your coffee? Yeah, it tastes much better. I like that tang that it gets. You have teaspoons of mayonnaise. I just chuck the whole... You do the whole... No, you love it in your coffee, bro. So you just put the coffee inside the mayo, eh? JP, you one of those guys. Mayo is uh, for 10 ply soft betches. Yeah, I prefer Tabasco in my coffee. The best human was George Clooney. Those bat nips. George... Oh, George Clooney. What a gentleman. Mensa, I stay right by a comic book warehouse. Happy to go pick up any item. Jachel, really, can you pick up the Funkos for me? 
Can you buy me um, just the one with the kitty and the wine bottle and the one with the gas? I'll see it. I'll see you later. Two Funkos. And then I will... Maybe I'll pay you for them. I'll think about it. No, I'm just going to, of course, I'll give you the money for them. I can even EFT you now so that you got the, if you got time otherwise another time there's no stress invincible is a great comic isn't there a game called invincible as well but it's not based on that though man stream is buffering for me oh god th i thought it was me that was maybe buffering not sound ignorant but does mayonnaise mean the same here as in the u.s like stuff put on a sandwich yes no it is you never have to worry about being ignorant here, bro. Ask any question you want. If you're not sure about something, ask away. There's no such thing as a stupid question, only a stupid answer. Mayonnaise is exactly the same that you'll have in the States. I'm only joking about the mayonnaise and the coffee, though. I don't put mayonnaise in coffee, and I know it, no does, nor does anyone else. Um, I was just trolling. Another reason for him to play Stardew so you can drink mayo. Yeah, happy to him. I got time. If you do, dude, flip. Thank you. They're on sale for 112. I don't know if that's a website price only. Bostick, thank you so much for the 10 stream streak. How are you doing, Bostick? Welcome in, bro. Maybe I'll pay you for them, this man. I will. I will maybe pay you. Maybe I put mayo in my coffee. You don't know. <laughs> Mizuki, if you do put mayo in your coffee, you need to talk to someone. I sent you a DM here on Twitch, JC. Okay, so call me Mr. Gullible, hey? Went right over my head. No, bro. Um, I wouldn't... I said it with a straight face. Send me the links during my lunch break. I'll send you the links right now, bro. Oh, Shannon Doe. I love your daughter. This is a good song. That's the link. What do you... Can you drink mayonnaise in Stardew Valley? Is that a thing? Stream today... Stream is fine today on my side. It's been... So Wolfie set up my stream so it automatically restarts at 5 in the morning. So it resets the cache and everything. So my stream's been f perfect ever since then. I don't even need to restart my PC. It does it all for me. Because of that sweet man. That sweet, sweet Wolfie. I actually do uh, put condensed milk in my coffee. That shit slaps. No, Mizuki, that, I do that too. I do that too. That's good. Good morning to you, Daddy and Pritzi. It is so late this morning. You are very late, Kelly, actually. Wow. 11 minutes past 9. 9.11. <laughs> Interesting time to arrive, Kelly. Interesting. Uh, how you doing, Kelly? Welcome in. So good to see you. Rather late than never. The one with the cats, the one with the cats, and then the one maybe, and any other one. The one that's burning, or even get me all three up. I'll buy all three even. I don't care. I'm crazy like that, bro. I might have three Funko, I might have two Funko Pops tomorrow for you guys to look at. I'm excited. Unlurk, welcome back, Modest. The only reason you unlurked is because you saw Kelly here. And you had to say good morning to Kelly. I don't blame you. Did you hear what Kelly has? Uh, flipping Bugsy is hilarious, bro. She said she's going to get... Did you see what she said in the general page yesterday? It's your biggest fan, Bugsy. Yo, it makes me laugh so much. What did she say here? When I get my nails done, I'm putting Kelly's name on them. She just wanted to tell everyone that. Just send exact links for each one you want. All right. Ew. Ew. Brother, uh, what's that? What's that, brother?
I just came back from a meeting. How's the meeting, Modest? Was it good? And I don't even get a good morning from him. Modest, come on, man. Say good morning to Kelly. Did I miss her? She, no, she she will be back. She hasn't gone to bed yet. No. Not yet. If I tried to tell 15-year-old me back in the 80s that in 2024 I'm talking to people like in South Africa, like they are next door, I'd be looking for a UFO or he was nuts, bro. Hey, Sherrod. As well, dude. There's no ways. I would have believed you if you told me. I remember when I was in school and I got my first cell phone. Not my first cell phone. I had a, I had a, I got a 5110 Nokia and it had snake on it. And I was, I thought then, I was like, I wonder if I, you will ever be able to play Doom on a cell phone. Doom. I was like, I wonder if it will ever be possible. Fuck, bro, you can play any game on a cell phone now that you pretty much can get on a PC. Yeah, you can play it on a goddamn printer now, Mizuki. NEC gang, my first phone was an Alcatel One Touch Easy. But I was a hustler when I was in school. Me and my neighbor were like best friends and we were like two little hustlers, bro. So we wrestled us up some cell phones. I bought myself a secondhand Alcatel One Touch Easy. Like no one had a cell phone back in these days in high school. And I remember my brother came over with all his friends and I took my cell phone and I put it inside the lounge where they're all sitting, like put it on top of the TV and I went into my room and I phoned it from the, the house phone and then it rang and I went into the room to go and fit. I was like, sorry, my, and then my, I, they were like, your brother has a cell phone? <laughs> hey, what's up? Still uh, no RTS on phones, unfortunately. Please tell me it was yellow with the sliding plastic thing on the front. It wasn't yellow, it was a black one, but it had the sliding plastic thing in the front. It was the one touch easy with, yeah, you slid that plastic down. It was badass, bro. Badass, that phone. It had like a few ringtones and it had like a calculated screen. There wasn't much you can do with it. Would like to order an extra big stack of pancakes and a side dish of Greek yogurt and strawberries. A big coffee as well, thanks. Coming right up, Amelia. I'll put this one on your tab, ma'am. How you doing, Amelia? Welcome and good to see you. Who here is a part of the Blackberry crew back in the day? Me. I had, like, so I remember I had a, I had a Nokia with a black and white screen because I was working overseas in the, at the time when Blackberry was like popular, I was working in the Congo and there was not much happening in the Congo, but I just, when I was back in South Africa, I just had a small little like Nokia cell phone that I would buy from Clicks, And then um, I had it for like years. I just kept buying the same cell phone because I'd lose them. And then I'd just go to back to Clicks and be like, can I have another? It was like 200 Rand for a cell phone. I'd literally just buy another one. I can have another cell phone, please. I'd buy them like they were chips. And then one day my girlfriend, I came home and there was a, there was a Blackberry on my bed and I was so annoyed. I was like, I don't want this thing. She's like, no, you got to have a Blackberry. Everyone's got it. That's how we talk, BBM. I remember I didn't. I, I put it in my cupboard for the longest time. And then eventually, she literally took my SIM card and put it in the Blackberry. And then from then on, I always had smartphones. Oh, she got me onto that smartphone life, man. BBM, brother. It was all about the BBM back then. I actually miss flip phones. I think the design should have uh, lived on. Called them start. Yeah, also, I had a, I had a Ericsson. Uh, what's it? T28. Ericsson T28. I was still in uh, Breakfast Suit Thoughts, so when you talked about blackberries, you thought about pancakes. Understandable. I love me some blueberries with some crepes. Ping back. Oh yes, you could ping. That was because if someone wasn't responding to a message, you're like, ping, their phone. Was it like, do you remember in Facebook, you could poke someone and then you'd get like random pokes from people, like log on to your um, Facebook, you got a poke from Julia. BBM brother, yo, Ether, how you doing, buddy? Welcome in, it's good to see you. Long time no see, Ether. I mean, long time, when it's been a week, then I'm like, where's Ether been? I hope you're well, buddy. 
I think it's scary to think we were all also part of the Facebook poke era. Yeah, we were, and the Farmville era. I still have my Blackberry somewhere. Hold on to that thing, will be a relic. My first phone was the E250. It had, I had it for six days and then I was, I was mugged. Shame, bro. E250, what is the E250? Sounds like a BMW. Oh, the Samsung. Bro, I remember these phones. They were also quite popular. I had an E250 at one stage. Yes, I definitely had this phone at some point in my life. Unless it's a false memory. But I'm pretty confident I had this. Or at least very similar. I'm sure it was this exact phone. Do you remember the Sony Ericsson T2... Uh, T28. That thing was a freaking. Oh, I love this. Check this phone, bro. T28, dog. It was tiny. Check out if it's in your hand. Who remembers the T28? Oh, you can't see it. I'm an idiot. There we go. I love my Sony Walkman. That was fun. Also, I used to have a Sony Walkman back in the day. My first phone was a Sony Ericsson Z310A. Lekker flip phone, broski. This guy. This is a lekker flip phone. Sure, worm. I can't seem to sleep. I had a shit night. But what's the... Why are you going to sleep now? Did you not sleep the whole night, bro? Hey, bro. I also didn't get much sleep last night. I'm sorry to hear that, dude. Why didn't you sleep well, Johnny? Is your mind spinning? Bombville and Mafia Wars. Nokia 6110 was legendary. Rock snake on that bad boy. I remember the 6110. Ah, I had a 6110. Mizuki, pick a pancake in Hearties. Always had the best pancakes. Is that the place next to the windmill? Yes, I've been there a few times for pancakes. That's I love that little restaurant there. What's it, is it called? Pick a pancake. But yeah, I've been there a few times. I used to go to that Yasmin to go and buy groceries. And then I would always stop and have a pancake over there at the pancake shop. Yeah, that thing was high tech when I got it. Oh, for sure. I remember the first, like, I worked for an IT company called Nerds on Site, where I was did like uh, call outs and stuff, just like general, you know, SLA contracts with companies, and I'd go and fix service PCs at home computers and stuff, even. But I had a smartphone then. Uh, not a smartphone, it was a PDA. Do you remember that before smartphones, you could get a PDA? And it had Windows Mobile on it or something. But it was legit, like it had a pen. And it was a cell phone with a computer. It wasn't a smartphone like we get today. Do you remember them? PDAs was a SIM card pretty much. Gotta love SLA uh, contracts for sure. I hated IT. Like after a while, just to suck. I mean, it was fine. What I didn't like is and I stopped doing was home clients, bro. You just do companies because home clients are the fucking worst, bro. Companies are just much better. They're so chill. You just fix the thing and you leave. Like home clients were so weird, bro. Like creepy, man. Some people, you go into the house and they're just like weird. It was always so weird going to a random person's house. And then you're behind their computer. You see all their shit, bro. You can see what the websites are going to because as soon as you go to the internet to go and Google something, you www dot and Pornhub comes up first. You know, like, ah, this man, he's got a wife. She's probably the one looking at it, though. Or is it a place called Chameleon Village? Not sure if it's still there, though. I haven't been there since I was a kid. No, Chameleon Village is still there. I was there. I literally was there two weeks ago by accident. We, we were meant to go to another restaurant, but we ended up going to Chameleon Village. Okay, yeah, I know Chameleon Village. I've been to a few places there too. I used to go to Chameleon Village a lot back in the day. I used to meet someone there once a week. 
veg by the trolley load from Yasmane when I was juicing. Yeah, it's they have the best and their price is so good and their veg is so cheap. A lot of it they they uh, source from local farmers in the area. Anyway, much love Oryx. Have a lacquer day now. Much love everyone in chat. Treat Oryx well. Thank you, Ether. You take care, buddies. Appreciate it. It's good to see you again, dude. HTC phones had the pen. It was an HTC, I think. I think it was an HTC. I feel like it was... I can't remember. It was orange and then white. I remember that. So it was thick. Like a brick. Who here remembers Netscape? Talk about Flash and our internet history. Yeah, Netscape. Yes, I do remember Netscape. But what was Netscape for? Oh, it was the browser, wasn't it? Netscape was a browser. That pick up. Oh, is that gone? Yeah. Oh, sorry, Mizuki. The pick a pan place, pan cake place is gone, but Chameleon Village is still there. Dead Oryx companies are a pain in the ass as well, especially in title ones that keep on taking advantage. No, you can get bad companies. You're right. You're right. And, and actually, you do get good home clients too. You know, the best one was, is like SMEs, small to medium sized enterprises, where you could have like, le not such big offices. Like, I found those to be better. And you just have to put your foot down at a point. But I know, dude, even though you, it's so... I didn't like it because of that. People take such advantage of you when you're in IT. Sometimes they'll call you out, like, to fix one problem. And then you'll go home. They'll call you be like, no, but this isn't fixed. And you're like, no, but you said, I just need to fix this. They're like, no. And then you go like, no, no we said no, this other thing. You're like, bro... Ciao, Oryx. Enjoy your day. Johnny Walker, are you going to try to get some sleep now or are you going to carry on with today? Good luck, dude. Have a good one. I'll see you soon, buddy. Windows before Windows. Windows 11. Alrighty. Should I go get my coffee now? I feel like I need a coffee. This day is... Uh... Who's in Fallout? Ashnar is in Fallout. Who's jumping in Fallout today? Who's playing Fallout? Guys, if you're on Xbox, there are people with Xbox that I got that juicy. Blames to Papa T. I think you guys are on Xbox. You guys need a you can hook up a little session. I'm playing. Are you playing now, Bravo? After work. Uh, yeah, of course. You got to get work. You know, I read a quote yesterday that was quite interesting, Bravo. It said, um, "If you want to appreciate your job, imagine not having a job on Monday morning." And I thought that was quite funny. You always like, everyone's like, oh, you got a job. But then imagine yourself without a job. Then you're like, oh, fuck, no, no. <laughs> yeah, I'm happy that I'm working. Uh, that's why uh, you have a call out and support fee. Deters most from wasting your time. For sure. For sure. But, uh, Taki, I'm a softie, you know. That was my problem as I was a softie. And people always like, they took advantage of me in those. Not everyone, but I could see companies that would like... Take advantage of me. I'd cut them off quickly, bro. Fool me once. Shame on you. Fool me twice. When I don't uh, do work, I actually feel less useless. Like, restless. I, I actually feel useless. Yeah, like, re me too, bro. Oh, also, I hate it. It's like, you, you like cursed to produce. And if you don't produce, then you feel guilty. You're like, oh, I didn't work today. Like, I don't like taking a day off, bro. I, you know, I don't like ever miss streams. It's because I get literal depression if I miss a stream, bro. I'm like, we'll be like, I can't do anything. I get anxiety. I'm like, I should be producing. I should be working. So I'm like, cool. That's why I'll leave the weekends to chill. Because I'm very stubborn and I'll work during the week. Come rain, sunshine, or snow, I'll be here. Or well, not snow because then it cuts the solar off and then we probably won't have electricity. So as long as the sun is shining, I'll be here. Guys, don't forget that. Wheel of Anxiety is tomorrow. Jeez, did that wake you up? 
plays pole dancer. <laughs> okay, let's go pole dancer. Dude, it shows you the record holders for the game. Stucker, your name is up here, bro. And then third is second. Bostick is nine. So this is a top three in uh, this fight 1v1 game. It actually keeps the the flipping score. That is so cool. Your noise. Kelly plays pole dancer. No, actually, that's fine. <laughs> right. It is your character, Kelly. Okay. I'm going to quickly go get a coffee. Let's see who can break the record this time. Can you get your name into the top three? Are you going to sit up there with the legends like Stucker? You think you can? Maybe. So how to play the game? Just do exclamation mark kukuru. Then you go into the game. You see exclamation mark stats and then you got four letters from the alphabet. From A to Z. You mix those letters up. Each letter means... First, so the first letter is attack. Second letter you use is defense. Third is uh, SP. Which, what does that mean? And then the last one is HP. So... Get in there. You have to get nine, more than nine kills to be in the top three. So, more than nine kills, you make your na your name is immortalized in the top three until someone takes it. Bravo Alpha, I like it. You got the PUBG guy. And then the next one is from... What's this? The Simpsons. These little characters are so cute because they're actually like little pop culture references. All right, I'm quickly going to go get a coffee. Don't miss me too much.
Yo, we got Kelly Serenity kicking ass here. She is going to be second place on the record bo books if she can beat 19. Then she'll be the leader. 20. Heal up. Ah, uh, fork. Oh my god. Heal. Exclamation mark. Okay. <laughs> Kelly OP bro Cozy Corner Deadox Pro tip Don't say that you have depression If you don't have it in real life It's depreciating for people Who really suffer from depression And the same is about Other mental health issues Like people who are uh, saying sorry for being distracted i have my adhd or day or i need to clean up my inventory i'm game because of my ocd when they don't have those conditions and they're just saying that because they think it's cool and fancy yeah well i i don't say i've got anything even if i do have something i won't even say it because it's not my job to come and tell you that i've got something my job here as a stream is to entertain you so i can't sit here and talk about any any, any illness or anything it's not my room to speak i i agree with you so i agree with you 100 percent, bro let's go kelly T 23 no she you no one can beat kelly now now she's too op Omen, good morning, young man. Just coming to check in and see what you're up to. I'm just hanging out here, having a good time. This is cheating. She clearly using a wall hack and aimbot. Omen, how you doing, bud? I don't know why my music keeps stopping on Spotify. It's awkward. Yo. Does Kelly just now stay... <laughs> You gotta change up your um your abilities here, bro. Kelly for the mega win. How do you play this? Exclamation mark Kukuru. I don't know, I even copied the stats she used and it's still lost hard. I think she's now OP. Like, I think there is a stat that will destroy her. I don't know, yeah, I don't know how it works either. But I'm, there we go. Kelly down. But that's the record. Tato Beans, good morning, Tato. How you doing, dude? Welcome in. How's your morning going, Toto? Kukuru, get in there, Toto Beans. Krab, good mornings. Good mornings, Krapticals. I Who found it? Welcome in. How's the Haldava doing this morning? Serpent Globalist, Dedorix, life is so confusing. What do you think happens if one uh, conjured twin commits a crime? Conjoined twin commits a crime. Do they both have to go to jail? Life is confusing. They, I didn't, bro, Serpent Globalist, why do you have to come here with the difficult questions, bro? I don't know. What will happen in that situation, dude? They will both go to jail because the other one will be an accomplice to the crime. Right? Unless they like, I don't know, that's... Uh, law is never black and white, Serpent Globalist. It's never black and white. It's always gray. You can never... One case never is like 
similar to any other case. It's always so complicated. That's why, you know, court cases take so long, some of them, because they're so complicated, you know. There was a, a, a thought experiment that I must try and find for you, which was essentially similar to what you're asking here. Uh, it was a very complicated crime, and they asked you in thought experiment to give your analysis and you decide who's guilty and who's innocent in the situation. It was very difficult to give a... Um, a verdict on it but i'll try and find the thought experiment if i can i'll post it in discord it was something to do with the guy is like going to murder someone but then the, the person like moves out of the way and he shoots but someone is committing suicide out of the building above him or jumping out of the building above him and he shoots that guy by accident it was a long complicated court case um but very interesting i mean crime but very interesting Am I there? I'm not wearing my glasses and can't see. You are there. Tato Beans, you're going in off. Now you're going in, Tato. It's all you now. Yeah, dang that. It's very... Yeah, sorry, I've got nothing that I can... Uh, like, I don't really remember the story, but it was something like that. It was very complicated. And then there was like a net below. I don't know. It was very uh, interesting. I'll try and find it. Let me actually look now while we're playing this. Drink your coffee and hanging out. Oh, it's going to be tough to find this. Oh, wow. Yo, Omen, what the flip, bro? Ten gifted subs, what's going on here, Omen? Holy smokes, bro. Sheesh. Thank you so much, sir, for the ten gifted. Wow, wow, we were. I appreciate that, Omen. Thank you so much, dude. Thank you, thank you. Why you spoil me like this, Omen? Big Apex, Kelly Serenity dead said we're doing lunchtime hennies. I can't do lunchtime hennies, bro. I'm over here. Speak to um, Kelly. She's going to tell you about later tonight if you want to join us, bro. Your Kelly Serenity is back in the hot seat. Can anyone take her out now before she gets to 30 plus kills? So, Derek, sorry for being a, a criminous. But you earlier said that you have depression when you're not streaming. That's why I put, oh, that message. I understand that this became a common thing last year, as I don't know why. Some people think it's cool to say stuff like that. I'm not saying you did this on purpose, but I would appreciate it if you would pay attention to this in future. Absolutely, bro. But uh, it is an actual fact. So I, I would have to divulge into this if we wanted to go further. But I literally do get a very high sense of that when I don't, I'm not... Um, doing what I'm meant to be doing. I suffered with it for a long time. I don't feel like I should be talking about it. Like, I agree, I, sh I won't talk about it in stream if you don't want me to say the word anymore. But I would never undermine anyone that ha is suffering from depression or anything like that. But I'm sorry that you took offense and I'm sorry that I said that. I'll be better next time. It said it causes me depression and it does not because I've suffered from depression since I was a teenager. Not nice to make assumptions about other people and their journeys. I'm sorry to hear that, Mizuki. Yeah, I would never. I'm very sympathetic to people and their, their conditions if they do have that. How do you play this game? Exclamation mark kukuru. It's okay if you can't find it. I'll look it up and find it in throw it in discord if you do it was a it was actually a youtube video serpent globalist that i looked at
Yo, shave Maddox raid. No ways, bro. Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in Raiders. My name is Dead Oryx. I'm a variety streamer outside of South Africa. We just I'm just hiding myself from the camera because I'm drinking a coffee and having myself a little vape here in the corner. How are you doing, Shave? What were you playing today? Oh, you're still in the Final Fantasy? Nice, dude. I still a game that I want to play at some point. Lol Rex, how are you doing, Lol Rex? Welcome in, man. Welcome, welcome. How many kills did Kelly get before she died? Okay, I'm going to turn off respawning. In a bit of pain now. That's numbing. The numbing is wearing off. How are you doing? I'm sorry you're in pain. Have you taken a Lisa Painkiller, eh? Lol rings to help out. Yeah, it's pretty great. Uh, but so much to do in the mini games or something else. How have you been? I've been fantastic, bro. I've been getting stuck in Fallout, you know. The show has been extremely, um, I'm enjoying the show and it's got me in the whole zeitgeist of playing the game, you know. So, really loving it. Aren't you also a fan, don't you like Fallout? I don't know why, Shave, but I've got a feeling that you're also a fan of Fallout. I can't remember why. Thank you, Kelly. I appreciate that. Yeah, for sure. I don't have any bad intentions. It's all about intention, right? I have no ma uh, malice intent. But also, you know, it's we have to also try and learn to be more resilient in certain situations and learn to like not try and take offense by things, you know. Offense is never given. It's only taken. But yeah, I would never ever try and offend someone on purpose like that. We have fun here and we banter, but we won't banter about that. Yeah, I had some paracetamol, had a tooth pulled. Oh, an hour or so ago. You did tell me that you were going to go get a tooth pulled, man. I hope that you're okay, lol rings. That's always, it's never a good thing to get a tooth pulled, right? No one gets excited for that. I uh, wish I'd play Fallout, but unfortunately, only one I've played is Fallout uh, Shelter. Dude, you got to try and give Fallout a go, like the proper game, man. It is. I am in love with it. Well done. I think we've got a new record holder. Let's see. Kelly Serenity with 31. Stucker with 21. And Lekker Lex is third place with 15 kills. GG. Top three. You guys rock. I see a psychiatrist once every few months for my mental health. And that's never a bad thing, bro. It's always good to seek uh, someone that can help with that. I've never been to one, but I, I would actually one day try. The people say the greatest things about psychiatrists and stuff. I feel like they do work. Good night, everyone. Are you going to sleep, Buggy? Sleep's hot, my friend. Thank you for hanging with us. I hope you, hope you have the sweetest of dreams. Okay, I go now. For real this time. All right. Corrupt? What? Mommy Corrupt. Would you please help... Uh, furious oryx with his visa appointment too i told him last night i'm like no mommy helped me he's like how did mommy do it i'm like no well she's just good at these kinds of things you gotta just chat to her so i said he needs to come in i told him to come into stream today he, he's at home he's not here now he's gone out but when he comes back oh uh, he's i asked him to please come into stream so that you can actually talk to him and help him thank you so much Well, it's well past my bedtime again, but figured I should stop in since it's been a while. Good to see you. Have a great stream. Shave, thank you so much, dude. I appreciate the raid. It's always good to see you, dude. And try and play some Fallout. The game is free with Prime. So if you've got Amazon Prime, you get a free code. Just letting you know, there's a free code for PC on Amazon Prime. And they give you a key for Xbox. And it's a good game. I definitely recommend. Just let Kelly Serenity win Dead Oryx. She won. 
You didn't, you couldn't, you, she won. Yeah, the thing is here in this group, Johnny, we all kind of mature, we all mature people here, and we're all here to help each other. We don't mind chatting about problems in here. If you got something, we'll always, we'll, we'll welcome you to talk about it. You know, we'll try and lift you up. We're not going to go down. We're going to try and lift you up. You know, that's our job over here is try and have, make you have a better day. This is a great collection of people. Okay, when he comes back, I'll get, go on call with him on Discord. Thank you, mommy. I appreciate that so very much, dude. The Fallout games on Game Pass as well. I think, yes, Mizuki is right. The, all the games are on Game Pass for you to play. Uh, I've had issues myself. Nothing worked until I started studying psych at college and then therapy turned out to be a vital tool not only to rid myself of conditions but help others as well. Bro, that has been my journey, Lackalex. It's been the best for me. It's actually... I've become obsessed with psychology. I read psychology books. I watch videos about psychology almost daily. I listen to like Mindset Mentor. Can I, I'm going to do a quick plug for a guy that I really, if you're not listening to him or if you don't know about him, he's such a good content creator. His name is um, Dale, what's it? Rob Dial. Rob Dial. Do you know about Rob Dial? Do yourself a favor. This guy releases a podcast every single day on mental health. He's every podcast is literally like a treasure bro he's so intelligent and his approach to things are otherworldly he's helped me so much with uh, different like sometimes i'll just listen to a podcast even if it's something that's not because you'll have different topics every podcast yes you love his work rob dial got his facebook hacked did he oh no we would hack rob dial's facebook that guy's such a legend bro he's helping everyone and literally if you can go and listen to his podcast It'll make a difference in your life. Yeah, I actually claimed them, lol, and think I need to make sure I actually use the codes before the end of the month. Yes, don't forget to use the codes. You don't want to lose them. Don't use it. Lose it. Studying psych was a game changer for me as well. It's 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 a great idea. Like, if you have any, like, things that you're dealing with mentally, take a look at how your brain works. Start learning how the thing works. It's, it's a wonderful way to help you understand what's happening upstairs because we've got complicated brains bro this thing is the greatest thing on earth is this brain inside your head there's nothing better than it no, the nature has never made anything like this it is so complicated uh, but the better you understand it the better you can deal with things it is also like i agree with everyone that says learning psychology has been the best also the smexiest people sheesh I know, bro. Lol, it's wild right now for his Facebook. Yeah, I, I listen to him on um, Spotify. So you can get him on Spotify. I'm actually going to drop a link for you guys. So you can go. Please, do. next time you go for a walk or you go to the gym, take one of Rob Dahl's episodes. Look through one that you think, hey, this sounds like something I'm going through right now. Pop the ears in and listen to what he has to say. Absorb it. And I did study. See, it's like, that's why he's so goddamn smart, mommy corrupt. Because you studied psychology. So Rob Dahl, the mindset mentor. I'm going to share his copy show link. Here is the link to all of his podcasts. It's a great place to start. There's also, if you want to talk to me about it, I've got a lot of books that you can read that are really good for you. Like... What's the name? Rob Dahl. There's the link. Yo, go listen to, like, every time I listen to his podcast, I'm like, God, this information is so good. So flipping good. Hopefully it helps someone else like he helped me. And share it with your friends and your family. The more the people know about Rob Dahl, the better the world will be. Where did JC go? Dead. Do you think we can order those things for collection on Comic Warehouse, place them, and then send him the details for collection? I think you can do that. I didn't think of doing it that way. I just told him to go pick it up for me. And then I'll pay him when I see him later, because he'll. I'm going to see him tonight. You're going to see him tonight as well. Um, yeah. I think... Try that. If it works, then let me know.
Game Pass members can get it for free or subscribe to your favorite Fallout 76 Twitch streamer for a code. Did you know, guys, that I didn't know this, that if you got the Xbox Game Pass, you get the backpack code. So you don't even have to subscribe. My gosh, dude. I did not know that. Let me see if I've got a code. Then I'll give you the code, man. Oh, I don't know how this is going to work. Anywho, this is the best game right now. Fallout 76. We got some free stuff in the shop. Don't forget to pick up your free things in the Atomic Store, guys. Wait, be gone. Drink this and you'll gain plus 50 carry weight for half an hour. Gosh, I need that. I feel like I'm always... over encumbered in this game. I want to build a nice shelter. Haven't built... Yeah, I haven't built anything either. I'm still gonna get there. I'm just doing missions and collecting tons of resources. So that at some point... Uh, can I whisper you? Um, of course you can. Uh, j join the Discord. And then just whisper me on Discord. I, I, I struggle with the Twitch whisper. Discord is where I like to communicate. It's my communication tool. So if you don't mind joining the Discord, yeah, of course you can always welcome to message me. Building stream today? I don't know, Aura. I don't know. I, I, I want to maybe see if I can get more... more um resources i've been collecting a lot but we should make a little village a little herdy village somewhere whose camp is this should i start my own i'm gonna do a private server right we can do that let's do that rather We can do our own world. Oaks, I've been listening to Rob Dahl. Did not even know it's the same guy you're talking about. Are you... Okay. You see, he's good, hey, bravo. No, I think everyone should be listening to your Rob Dahl. Even if you not... You know, there's always something there for you, you know. He's got podcasts for everything. Really cool. Private adventure. Why is this locked? But I've got it. I got the trial. Wait. I'll play a rock and roll. No. What happened to my 15 day trial in this game? Hey. Time for me. I have to go for now, but we'll be back on PC as soon as I'm up. Can we just have a shout out for Tato Beans, please? This amazing content creator, please go give her a follow and say what's up. She's so much fun. She's so lively and she's busy trying to hit that partnership goal right now. And she's so flipping close. She's literally uh, like that. So any help, if you can lurk, that's the biggest thing is just having a lurk in her channel. Just help her hit those goals. It's a nice little goal to hit. And she's so close. Maybe glitch from last night's resets. She's, al she's hilarious. Lex. Lex is not a liar. Last night. Did they reset it? Hey, Killing Fields. And thank you for that 15 stream streak. You know what? I'm just going to pay for it for the month. Because I'm going to be playing this for like a while. So if we can do private servers, then then everyone can join. We can have up to eight people. And everyone in the server is, is part of the herd. So I'm, I'm actually keen to try and do this.
anyone wants to join, please join on me. And you can do your own thing. We got our own server now. But only when I'm playing. I just bought it. No, what's going on here, bro? I literally just paid for it now and it's still not giving it to me. Piece of shit. Must have closed the game and started again, maybe. <clears throat> Do the refreshing. Yeah. Snakey Casagorix. How you doing, Snakes? Welcome in, bro. So good to see you. I don't know, that juicy pickle. I don't know. I gotta get some work moving. I shall be back in a few. Lack of legs. Sweet bro. Good luck with the work, dude. You're on midnight. They reset. Right, thanks for the heads up, bro. I, I don't know. I don't know why I didn't get... I thought you should have got it. The 15 days free. Sucks. Because now I'm paying for it. And I could have got it a month and a half. Scammed. Snakey. Agreed. Absolutely scam. Need to buy it twice. <laughs> Well, it's 50% off, so. Free. Check it all this. Oh, look. You see, now my Fallout first is working. All right. Now we got some free stuff. Check it this. Got a little lizard tank. Got a scrap box. Got this thing there. I don't know what it is. Vault lobby shelter. Okay, so that's all the free stuff. Done. Collected. Play. Private server. Cool. If anyone would like to join me on my private server, you're more than welcome to. Unfortunately, that juicy pickle doesn't have a PC. So you can't join us. All over again. Hmm. I just got a WhatsApp message from a weird number. It just said hi. It says from Canada. Should I say hi back? I don't want to say hi back. Next, they empty my bank accounts or something like that. Maybe you didn't have enough money. That's also a possibility. Cozy Corner, by the way, what are the benefits of that paid subscription in Fallout 76 besides being able to play solo? Uh, there are... I'll tell you the benefits now. They're actually on the... Um, it's not... It's not a whole lot, to be honest. I think the main perk is the fact that you get the... Um, where's that benefits tier list for the first? We have to cut ourselves free from America to rebuild America. Take the old, forge it anew. Oh my gosh, why is this such a mission? One day I'll make money, and I'll show you again. Membership benefits. This is from 
So you get a scrap box, you get custom worlds. A scrap box, a scrap box holds unlimited storage for crafting components as opposed to storing them in my stash box during normal gameplay. The player will keep all those even if the Fallout first expires. However, they cannot deposit more inside. You get an ammo storage box, you get a survival tent, which you can take anywhere. You get atoms, you get 1,600 atoms per month to spend on the atom shop. You actually get a decent amount of stuff, bro. Here is the link to read all of the benefits that you get. Good morning, Daddy Coco. How are you doing? Good morning, Novel Allure. Lovely to see you. Finally, freaking Thursday. So close to another weekend. I hope you're well and having fun. I'm having so much fun. Thank you so much for asking. Welcome in, Novel. Verbal 4, hello, mister. Good morning. How's your beginning of the day? 10.05 in my country. It's the same in mine, so we're on the same time zone. I'm also five minutes, six minutes past 10 now. Woke up at 3 a.m. this morning in solidarity with Novel. Did you really, Snakey? You just saying that sound cool. I don't believe you, Snakey. What did you do at 3 o'clock this morning? Sal, uh, Sal, that link over there, go check that link. That gives you a detailed description of what you get. I was busy at that time. Simon Moose. Good morning, Daddy and Nerdy. Sorry. Oh, did I not read that? I read that message earlier and I went to just read it again and you typed it again. Simon Moy, you beautiful human being, you. How are you doing this morning? I'm doing very well. Thank you for asking. Thank. Of course, it's my pleasure, Sal. Uh, Vega Daddy, I'm installing 76 now, 28 minutes. Okay, then come and join us as soon as it's installed. Why are you t installing it now, Vega? You should have done this yesterday. But rather late than ever, Vega. That's what we always say. Yeah, went back to bed. <laughs> Did you even get out of bed? Did you just wake up and roll back over again, Snakey? Fallout with benefits. WF, uh, F, W, B. All right. Please, can I control my character? Any news to share? Mates, oh yeah, space, it's a big game, eh? Turning on Fallout, mates, sweet. We got our own personal server now, no one else here but us. Is my camp. And you can go wander the wasteland and go and find all the things not that it makes a big difference that it's only us but i guess let's just try it right coffee time yeah go get your coffee i'm gonna hide for a second while i quickly pick my nose don't look don't judge eh i'm back i found a web extension to do my work for me thank you youtube wait what GT, what are you saying? You got an app to do your work for you. So you don't have to work anymore. You can chill. Killing goals for a roof over the download house. begins. I'll be on in two hours, folks. Well, I'll still be here. I'm going to end stream a little bit early today. I'm going to finish at about five, maybe six o'clock. But I will pay you back tomorrow. I'll do another 12 hour on Friday. Friday, 12 hour stream. Orion's Pants, Daddy, my guy, I went to sleep while you were streaming and I've just woken up to find you streaming. Something tells me I need a better sleep schedule. Orion's Pants, yes, you need a better sleep schedule, bro. I know that you go right through the night. You know why I know? Because you guys hang out here with me and I love having you here. And if it was up to me, I would choose you to have no sleep schedule and just hang out with me all the time. But sleep is important and... It's something that you can work on. But right now, what's the time? It's afternoon now. Do you have a good day, Orion's Pants? So we saw the nose picking. Oh, you saw it. Damn it. Busted. What's your Discord handle? Uh, Dead Oryx. You'll see me on the Discord there. Just uh, search me. I'll have to accept your a message but i'll accept it later when i see lol rings don't tempt us with that daddy i already did lol rings i already did just like the old army eh join up defend yourself and see the world while you're at it it's um yeah eight hours so you are you are eight hours ahead of us all right perfect 
I just woke up, so my day's been wonderful. Dude, so your day, you wake up now, so the night shift begins. Are you going to work tonight, hey, Orion Spence? Are you doing uh, Uber? Uber? Uber Booba? Really not thinking about joining up. Getting in on the ground Yo, floor. that Juicy Pickle, I'm annoyed that it's not crossplay, bro. It's so ridiculous that it's not. How can this game not be crossplay? It's on every system. It's an MMO. It should be crossplay. Someone get on the phone with Bethesda. Did someone say Booba? Darkest. Classic darkest. Do we expect anything else, Snakey? No. Yeah, bro. It's actually like... It feels like a bad dream that this game is not crossplay. It's the worst. I feel like I'm just gonna wake up from this bad dream and Fallout's gonna be crossplay. I'm glad it's not crossplay. I knew you'd be glad it's not crossplay, Snakey. Classic Snakey. I don't wanna play with console noobs. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, I'll probably Uber tonight if anyone wants Maccas. Hit me up. Bro, I want Maccas. Would you mind driving all the way to South Africa? Does your car have floaty wheels? Imagine if it was crossplay, the Sony peeps would just be shooting you the whole time. People like Bravo Alpha, dude. Oh, God. Not Bravo. Imagine, bro. Imagine sharing the same gifts. The worst, Snakey. Come on, Lucy. We've got a wasteland to save. Watch your mouth, Oryx. <laughs> no, I love console noobs. I actually want to get my... I'm actually in the market for an Xbox One. The reason why I want an Xbox One is because I pay for Xbox Game Pass, right? So I may as well have an Xbox to share the Game Pass with so I get another library of games that I wouldn't otherwise be able to play on my PC that I can play on an Xbox One. So I don't want the Xbox Series S, I just want the One. Because you can actually play a lot of games still on the One that are on the Game Pass that you don't get on PC. So I've been looking around, dude, you can get an Xbox One on Facebook for like 2,000 Rand. It might be a scam though, but... I'm gonna take the risk. I really hope that Dodgy Oryx doesn't show up. Dude never wears any clothes. Stuck it's damn putting clothes on, bro. And also Stuckies, I have some news to to share with you. You are no longer the record holder in Kukuru. You've been knocked down to second place, sir. Kelly Serenity took your spot. You had 21 kills. I think Kelly had like 30 odd kills, bro. So. You lost the top spot there, Top G. Okay. Let's do this. Good. Our initiates held. And the barricade's still standing. It looks like they I think this chick likes me. Is this the last of the attackers? Unlikely. Hostiles have been hitting in waves for hours now. Our scouts. It's the ones who return. Reported the tunnels crawling with mutants. This threat won't take care of itself. We'll go on the offensive, take the fight to them. The community in Fallout's good though. You, like, it, I think it should be crossplay. But I don't know the secret to the game now. Do you? We'll play a game later then. When I do my next coffee break, we'll play a game. Let's see if you know the secret. I think Kelly knows the secret too. No, no, Dead Orcs. Kelly Serenity had the magic number. Kills. 69. People, don't people look funny in the power armor without the helmet? They do. I don't, I like the power armor, it's cool, but I want to try and, I don't, I like just r running around in my, my vault suits. Okay, we can barely hold a position of strength. Engage superior numbers head on would be suicide. Ryan's Pants with the five stream streak. Thank you, Ryan's Pants. I appreciate that. Guys, don't forget if you've got 25,000 channel points, we're selling tickets to the wheel today. You can buy one now if you have 25k. And then we'll spin the wheel tomorrow. 
$50 up for grabs. $50 US. That's a thousand rand for South Africans and like $60 for Australians. Yeah, there are tickets available, but you don't buy tickets, Snakey, for some reason. Buy a ticket, bro. Let me buy you a game if you win. We need to fight, Shin. We can't just stand around waiting to die. That's why they'll never see it coming. Right, Shin is right. Paladin, we can't hope to kill them all on our own. I think we got this. Really buy into this plan? After what she pulled at the transmitter? If we don't strike now, we'll just be worn down over time. You should know better, Shin. Clearly the initiative is. I know. What's gotten into all of you? Everyone's no fighting. Look, I think there's a way we can make the plan. Bustic, you got your soft ticket, sir. I was waiting to plant them as our last line of defense, but maybe we can... Nah, it's not worth it. If we go into the tunnels and find their points of entry, we can destroy them and prevent any more mutants from... Snaking by those wings you wanted with $50. What wings does he want? Oh, it'll work, Shin. We have to take a chance in this. As much as I hate to admit it, he hates to admit it, it, but it is the best option. Johnny the Walker, thank you for the posture the check. Despite Bell Death will stay behind and command a barricade in case we don't make it. Very well, Shin. If that's the price of your cooperation, then I'll pay it. If only to hold our brotherhood together a little longer. A little longer? What? Never mind. Hear the box. I'll stay here and do what I can for the wounded. Good luck. I believe in you. All of you. All right, is anyone coming with me into this battle? How can I join the server? No. <laughs> Stream elements. Just join on me, Killing Fields. Have you added me? My name is uh, Dead Oryx with no spaces. Look on the top. Oh, there, I've got you, bro. What are you talking about? Accept friend invites. Let's go, bro. Now I just need to make a team. Whoops. What am I doing now? I'm pushing buttons. Create a new team. You're gonna put me in the movies. They're gonna make a big star out of me. It's Thursday, peepos. It is. I might not be the sharpest tool in the shed, but I'm resourceful. Just did something. That would have taken me days and did it in five minutes. Evil laugh. Chee chee GT. Well done. Nice Slimey Moose, thank you so much for the water redemption. How are you doing, Slime Way? You are a sharp tool, GT. How many have we lost so far? Alright. So well. <laughs> In the movies. Now I don't know. Paladin Romani herself? No. Let me just let me do my favorites here. I need to get some grenades. The cavalry's arrived, and not a moment too soon. Mm -hmm. Sad and lonely. Um, favorites of frag grenade. We're holding them for now, but how much baseball grenade? Drop this. Maybe did that. Buff out. Psycho buff. All right. 
happen eventually, but so soon. Okay, I'm going in. Alex is also non-profit. <laughs> You're gonna make me cry, Snakey, goddammit, Pless. Why can't I select this? I'm trying to figure out how to use it. I think I threw a grenade at my own people. Maybe. Oh, another grenade. Guy's got a mini nuke. Oh fuck. No. Shoot him, bro. Look in this guy. Oh my god. Victory for the scrolls. Hey, I'm non profit too. In fact, so are you. Lol, this guy corrupt, eh? He's going for the jugular, man. Uh, Simon Moose, all right, been busy, be working, currently working on a logo for a non profit. Hey, nice, dude. That sounds like fun. It's good to get creative. So, is that what you do, Simon? You do uh, graphic design as well? Oh, yes, I think I'd, you did also the. Um, artwork for Kylo stream. A pop. Oh, by the way, Daddy took up the mid journey subscription. It's wild. Still need to mess around with some images of myself. But wow, it's so impressive compared to some others. It's super impressive, dude. Like, I love it. Uh, look at the image I made for the stream today. This took about like 20 A pop. It took about 20 um, images recycling to try to try and get it but this is the image i got so i'm trying to like obviously make something that looks similar to my character in the game so i came up with this, Let's settle this i enjoy doing it. it's a lot of fun run forest run it didn't work johnny i ran he's on a roll today just let him you know let him have fun crap let him have fun all right i am the complete non-profit my credit card bill is triple my money <laughs> Oh, Snakey, it's a problem, dude. It's a problem. You need a, you need a financial advisor. Oh, there's a lot of nades in this place. We're holding them. We're holding them for now. Yeah, I died. I don't know. Not very long. Mine's transitioned. <laughs> Thank you, Modest. Legit was thinking about you when I got that one. I was like, oh, Modest is going to have something to say about this one. I realized my mistake now. Thank you for keeping me accountable, Modest. You got to love recession. Recession is the best, bro. South Africa lives in a recession. We don't know anything but recession here in South Africa, bro. I love it when the rest of the world is like, we're going into a recession. And South Africa's like, <laughs> we're already here, dude. We live here. This is our home. Recession. America goes into recession and unemployment goes from 3% to 5% and the world loses their mind. South Africa's unemployment's like 40 something percent, bro. We'll survive this one with this that guy exploded. Victory is one through willpower. We've chosen a path. Yeah, I can give you some prompt tips, perhaps. So, yeah, for sure. I usually also that um you can actually get a couple of them from the website, a lot of them. Yay, yeah, I'm a graphic designer and web developer. What are you developing? What software do you use? I love seeing your creations on Insta. Thank you, Slimey. I love making them. It's, a, it's so much fun. It's not, it's not like anything like I'm doing any actual 
graphic design work. I'm just using prompts to, to generate an image. It's the lazy graphic designer's way of doing things. I mean, I could, you can make them nicer if I spend time on them and put like some extra, like, you know, putting my logo in them, superimposing logos and stuff would make it like just that much better. But I just, I do just quick and easy because I do them every day, so I can't spend too much time on them. I just, but I still enjoy doing the, the generating of the images. Do you use any AI? WordPress, I also developed in WordPress for the longest time. That's when I did like web development. It was all with WordPress. It's a very powerful platform to build in. The only recession South Africa is having is Dead's hairline. Sheesh. Yara, bro. This one's for the bully bank for later because I feel like you're going to say, oh, look, Darkest. This school looks like you. Damn it, Darkest. You know me too well, sir. It's fine. I'll take it. Bro, I saw there's a streamer. How's this, dude? I was on Twitter and then this there was some post about a streamer, but he also wears a headband like me. And he did something, he was like accused of doing something like bad. I think he was made a bad comment or something on social media. And he was being like hung up to dry. And he had he he wears a headband. And the first comment was like, ah, he wears a headband to hide his receding hairline. Fuck bro, I was like, that's so funny. I don't wear a headband to hide my receding hairline. Absolutely not. I never did this for that reason i have got a receding hairline but i don't wear the headband because of it i wore the headband because i wanted something unique you know about me like you know because i like the whole retro style you know what i used to love but you know the one one uh the one one eight guys in, in the uk those two dudes that used to wear the white vest with the two red stripes on and the running shorts i love that bro I used to love those guys. That's the style I loved. I've loved that ever since I was young. That like fucking retro 80s style moustache looking guy. I've used AI but uh, to make references that then I work from. Yeah, AI is a big help, eh? But still it adds a touch of care to what you do, Dead Oaks, regardless of its AI. Thank you, dude. Yeah, I, like I said, I enjoy doing it. And it, it's cool because my YouTube stream has a, a thumbnail that it that's always going to be there. Where's your boombox? My boombox in my room, bro. I'm going to bring it with tonight. We're going to listen to some sweet tunes. So that explains the headband. I, it's not because of the receding hairline, little ranks. I, I, and I call my receding hairline the Recedes Benz because it's fancy. Because you're a solid snake of South Africa. There we go. That's it keeps the sweat out of my eyes because I'd be sweating in video games all day long. Now your hairline's not that bad to be honest. My mate's hairline started receding when he was like 16. His hair's almost totally gone now. Yeah, no, mine's not bad. It's just, it's just going like, it's doing one of these things, bro. You know, there's a guy from that lawyer show, what's it called again? It was so popular that the princess made this daughter from it. I mean, the one of the women from it. What was that? A widow's peak. But is it? Yeah, it's, I'm getting like a widow. Suits, yes. There's the one guy in suits. He was like, you know, he's got that. He was receding hairline. And he had like a tuft of hair in the front. And then there was like bald hair. And then he had hair here. Like that guy. I'm getting like my hairline is doing what his hair does. I've, lo I've noticed that. I'm like, fuck me. That's what my hair is doing, bro. I'm also going to have a freaking tuft here then like a bald spot here and then here here but hair is overrated <laughs> says peak apex no it is like i i'm not that attached to my hairline I'll, i mess around with it because it's meant to be funny you know like oh my receding hairline but at the end of the day it's not the worst receding hairline and if it goes what can you do about it it goes man the vegeta hairline yeah the Ve yeah yeah i'm getting that little widow's peak you know the the kind of like um, another actor that I, my hairline looks like is uh, Nicolas Cage. I'm getting the Nicolas Cage hairline. Uh, Noxy hairline aside, your beard makes me freaking jealous every time I see it, man. Noxy, how you doing, bud? Welcome in. I appreciate that. Yeah, so if I can't grow a chair, at least I can grow a chair, you know. I've got a beard. 
I mean, you are kind of attached to it. You are. It's sad, like it sucks that I would rather have like a full head of hair, like with that, I mean, again, it's not that I'm not going to cry over it or anything like that. I'm just going to be like, oh, well, I'll just shave my hair off and look like PK Apex or something like that. But Peaky, you got a nice head, bro. You got a very beautiful head for a shaved hair. Like, like The Rock has got a nice head. Joe Rogan's also got a nice shaved head. But then, you know, I don't know what my hair's going to look like shaved. I'm going to have a dumb pull here for my, my headset. I know that. You know the Nazi joke? Knock, knock. Who's there? Slaps the man, yells, We will ask the questions. I have heard the joke before. That's a classic verbal four. I think he means literally attached. No, no, I know. Literally and emotionally, but physically attached to it, yeah. But yeah, the lush beard uh, growing ability is pretty amazing. So it doesn't matter if I shave bald and have a beard. Looks nice. Look like a lumberjack like that. Then I'm going to wear like flannel shirts and I need to get buff. Because I feel like if you can have a big beard and a bald head, you have to be buff. Peak Apex, head and shoulders got too expensive. So I only have to use shoulders now, saving so much money. Pro tip, Peak Apex. That's hilarious, dude. Fuck. Alright. song doesn't sound full artish. Please don't stop following me around and tell me where to go. You guys are dickheads. I don't know how to... <laughs> As if peak showers. Who's been watching, uh, who's watched the new episode of, um, what's that show? Shogun. Anyone watching Shogun? Watch the newest episode. Does this 76 playthrough happen to be inspired by the new show? Absolutely, Nox. I watched the show and I'm, f I had to play, the this is one Fallout I never finished. So I thought it was a good idea to jump back into it. You know, catch Fallout while it's trending right now. You know, and I love it. Bro, I'm so happy I decided to play this because I am... I'm just having too much fun, bro. You a fan of this game, Nox? How's the programming going, dude? Are you still doing um, Roblox uh, games? Cigarette carton. Why did I pick that up? Got a recipe. Power armor's for noobs. I don't have power armor. I also, I never wore power armor. Even in, like, the other Fallout games, I never used to wear it. Like, once or twice, I'll mess around with it. But I always like going without power armor. I'm a no power armor kind of gal. My name's Lucy. Look, Nox, even my character's name is Lucy, bro. 76 is good. I've honestly only heard mixed reviews, but I definitely want to get back into the Fallout game. And yeah, still doing the coding work on a Super Smash Bros. like game at the moment. Hey, that sounds pretty dope, bro. I hope it's popular. I'm sure it will be. And good luck with that. Um, so 76 was mixed reviews when it came out, Nox. But it has been a long time since that. And actually, the Fallout had 76 had its highest player count just the other day. More players played Fallout on the this week than I've ever played it in the history of the game being out. So it's changed a whole lot and it's a lot better. I did my first playthroughs, then I always went bareback. Just felt better. So you played it more than once. You played with using the power armor, then you played again bareback. <laughs> oh, I don't have any nades. Mini gun. Well 
Bingo bongo bongo. Oh, he's alive. She just said, like, everyone's been killed. What is she talking about? She's a liar, bro. Oh, my God. Freaking oaks coming out everywhere here. Yeah. There's another dude. Oh my god, can I hit something? so much for the gifted bro thank you so much kelly i appreciate it man thank you thank you thank you man i'm sure you just said something super important but i got hit with the ad break lol i can't remember if uh sub do i get no ads you you do sorry about the ad break i stay the worst i freaking hate ads just as much as the next person but i appreciate you sticking through with the ads guys it helps support me and what i'm doing here How oh, goes it? Hey, Dan, what's up, bro? Goes well? Wow, Kelly, thank you. Thank you so much, Kelly. All right, so what I was saying, I think what you might have missed, I was just saying the game is a lot different now than it was, Nox, when uh, the reviews were coming out mixed. So, oh, my gosh. I died. It's had its highest player counts. Um, Fallout 76 last week. Well, this week was its highest player count. Do you get a cut of the ad revenue? It must be barely anything right. I do get a cut. Um, I can tell you exactly what I get paid through my adverts. It's about $50, give or take, a month. It's not a lot, but, it, you know, extra $50 adds, you know, it all adds up at the end. Around there, $50. Might be a little bit more some months. And then I also get better than nothing, I guess, yeah. Uh, it's sort of like Edge Runner's effect, like how the show, yeah, 100% bro, because of the series coming out, it actually got the release it should have got. So I'm actually quite happy for Bethesda, you know, and the guys that worked on this game because they worked really hard on it and the game is much better than its initial release. And I feel like they should be, you know, rewarded for that, like extra work that they put in because they didn't stop and be like, okay, we're done with the game. You guys are not happy. We're done. They actually kept at it and fi until it was fixed. They believed in the project and so... It's really good for the for the game, and it's good for the show, and it's good. It's just good for everyone, right? All right, we're going back in. Yeah, CPMs in South Africa would be cuck. Yeah, they are. And there's not. I, I don't. I mostly probably comes from overseas people. Any profit from the ads. But then I also, it's interesting, if you got that Twitch Turbo. So Twitch Turbo that you don't see ads if you got Twitch Turbo. But you and you don't have to sub to the streamer. But I like I've got a separate section on my um, analytics that shows my revenue from Twitch Turbo users. So if someone has Twitch Turbo and they watch my stream, I get paid from the person with Twitch Turbo watching my stream as well. 
Because I was always wondered how Twitch Turbo worked. I'm like, okay, so you pay $10 and then you get to not a watch without ads, which is really a bonus. And, and, and again, it works for everyone. It works for the streamer, works for the person who's got Twitch Turbo. So you, if you watch more than one streamer and you, you can't afford to sub to everyone, which is totally understandable, it's expensive, um, you can get Twitch Turbo and it still benefits, you know, everyone. Yeah, for sure. Well, damn, I have a few friends who are big into the show right now. Maybe we will kick it up and play. You should try that. And the game is free at the moment. If you've got Twitch Prime, you get the game for free. And it's currently on special on Steam and all the other stores where you would normally find the game. So if you want to buy it for Steam, it's, it's pretty cheap right now. It's less than $10, I think. I guess if you watch loads of different streams, it could, yeah, if you watch a whole bunch. Yeah, it's a rogue purchase. Uh, definitely, I think it's beneficial. And you get some other features with Twitch Turbo as well, so it's not just the, the ads that you don't see. Good mornings, Meshi Kuneshi. How are you doing, Meshi? Welcome in. I watch between 100 and 150 streamers. Some are daily, some are only special events. That is a lot of streamers to keep up with. I don't know how you do that, Smurf. But flip, dude. I think you should get Twitch Turbo 100% Smurf. You can't afford, I mean, I not. I don't know if you can afford, but I don't think it would be advisable to <laughs> subscribe to 150 different streamers. That would be like 15,000 Rand a month just on subscribe subscriptions. Most important thing about Turbo is its ability to customize name color. Yeah, name color is the other thing. And if you're a streamer, you get like, instead of your VODs being up for 12, two weeks, they're up for like a month. You get an extra couple of days of mod bro i need to go to a workbench before we continue with this mission wait isn't avo supposed to join us at thrasher as well avo yes oh my god bro Yo, you got a good memory, J Chill. I th yes, I believe so. Can I put up my? How do I put up my first tent? Hey, darkest. Oryx is my only sub. You lie straight to my face, Snakey. I've seen you, bro. You don't think I don't follow you around? I've got you on my chat arena. If someone types Snakey in a stream, it pings. And then I can check where you are and what you're doing, Snakes. I got my fucking eye on you, bro. Nah, that's not a lie. Honestly, my only thing about 76 is that I really love... That I really love that you can mod uh, most Bethesda games into completely different games. And being 76 is a multiplayer live service game, you can't really... But I'm sure the ad, uh, added company makes it worth the trade-off. Dude, absolutely. That's the trade-off, for sure. Is you don't get the modding uh, flexibility as you would have with Fallout 4 and stuff like that. But the trade-off is that you get a fully packed game with so much content, Noxie. Like, the building has got an infinite amount of assets that you can use. Because it's, just, it's been going for a few, like, a couple of years now. So if you're willing to spend money, I mean, even without spending a cent, you get tons and tons of assets, man. But if you want to subscribe to Fallout first, you'll get even more. And yeah, so definitely worth picking up. I has coffee, the coffee machine, tech fix the machines. Let's go. That guy's doing God's work, sir. I hope you gave him a tip, Sumo. The camp community is huge. How do I set up a camp? Because I got first, but I'm sorry, I have no clue what to do. Camps cannot be placed indoors. How did the game know I wanted to put down a camp? Okay, camps cannot be placed indoors. Ah, uh, makes sense. I figured it was going to say something like that.
Mm, you gotta be outside. Is that my temporary camp? When you say the camp community that you see, is that just people that build? Like builders, pretty much. I saw on Twitter the other day, someone built like with the millions and millions of blocks in Minecraft, they literally built an entire city. It looked insane. It didn't look like Minecraft. I don't know if anyone else saw that. Flip, I was impressed. Okay, I can't do it inside. That's what I wanted to find, that juicy. Thank you for that. Okay, just uh, creates that build. All right, I thought I figured it was something like that. What do you mean? I'm, <laughs> I'm coming out of the thing, and he's like, "Cavalry's arrived." Meanwhile, I'm retreating, bro. I'm like, "Cheers, I'm going the other direction." You better find yourself some cover, buddy. Distant Horizons mod is nuts. I'd recommend uh, checking that out if you plan to play Mine Minecraft at. 1.2 I know very little about Minecraft but I, I want to do a little Minecraft building How many have we lost so far? Uh, competition in the coming uh, weeks, months maybe I'm, I don't know when we plan to do it but I do plan to have a Minecraft competition one of these days where we can all build but I'm gonna I don't know how we're gonna do it I'm gonna chat to a few people here in the community to help me I'm thinking about having a section that's like restricted that you, you know, and then that where the competition area and then another section where it's not going to be competition area, it's going to be free build. So you can either compete or you can free build in the game. But I want to have like comp one suburb is going to just be for like the comp. Zeus, how you doing bud? Welcome in. Good to see you Zeus boy. Oh my gosh. I know where there is the loot stuff. It's outside the base. I mean, benches. I got work to do. Snakey is a pro Minecraft. No, he is. I'm going to chat to most probably Snakey to help me. He has a good uh, idea how we can run the server. Because he knows how I want to run it. I feel. Brotherhood wants order in the wasteland. I'll be back shortly. That juicy pickle. I'll see you in a bit, bro. Okay, scrap all junk. Must be a real hard ass to keep all these rough and tumble soldiers in line. Yo, Killing Fields, bro. The place where I'm going in now, you're more than welcome to join me. I'm just slowly taking on this mission. Why do I have this? Just ask Kelly, she gives them out for free. She's such a baller. Can someone trade me a gift sub for a gift sub? What do you... How, Smurf?
So it's... You want someone to give you a sub? I'll give you a sub, bro. Boss Punk, you reckon? We're holding it. For now. No, I like it hard, bro. I do. Uh, Frostpunk 2? No. I've, is it an RTS kind of game, Frostpunk? How you doing, Snowball? Welcome in, bro. Bro? What did I try to say? I don't even know what that word I was trying to use. Kelly, thank you so much for the gift and sub to Smurf. You absolutely didn't need to do that, dude. Well, it was up to you. I mean, Smurf asked, I guess. So it's between you guys, but I don't mind. 46 more to go. To the sweet 100. <clears throat> no, that's too many. You've done enough, Kelly. You've played your part. It's really cool, but it's tough. City Builder Manager. I think I do have the first one, Snakey. I'm sure I feel like I got it for free on maybe um, Epic or something like that. Frost Pump is incredible. The first one is worth a playthrough. How are you, Meshi? I'm doing very well, thank you. How are you doing, Meshi Kuneshi? Isn't she Viper Death Angel? Oh, there we go. Smurf, thank you so much for the gift and sub, bro. Put the kids to work. Thank you guys for the hype train. Epic did give it up for free. Then I do have it, yes. Maybe I'll play that one of these days. Snakes, don't you like rogue games? Like roguelike games? Time wasters, I call them. Not like anything we do is, I mean, we always just, what are we doing on earth? Wasting time until our ultimate demise. Murphy is such a legend. Thank you guys and Kelly. Thank you very much. Giving example of a game. Um, Vampire Survivor. Have you played Vampire Survivor? Or um, there's one that I've been playing recently. It's so good. It's called Ye Just Another uh, Zombie Survivor Game. Oof, bro. Game is such a hoot, man. Hades is a good one. I got Hades. Yeah, Hades is fine. I haven't played enough of it. I want to play more of it. Oh, fuck. I should have just used the minigun. Peak AK picks gifted one tier sub to himself. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Peaky, thank you for the sub, bro. I appreciate it. This gun is shit. Thank you, Peaky. Thank you so much, dude. Wow, that was so. Hey? <laughs> Could have given that one to that juicy pickle but also the lols like i like the lols thank you so much Piki. that's a good gift why not bro Do you need to restart and focus on it? On Hades? Yeah, I also need to. It was gifted to me by a, a person in the community here. Yeah, and I actually didn't play a lot. I played it one time. 
but I enjoyed what I did play of it, and it it seemed like a game that would steal all my time. I need to be careful. Dude, Kelly, thank you so much, bro. I, thank you, thank you, Kelly. But please, Kelly Serenity, stop now. Subscriber. We only do it with followers, Dan. 45. Okay, that's enough, Kelly. I've had enough. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate it, though. Lol rings. Thank you so much for the biddies, lol rings. Thank you, thank you, man. Thank you. I appreciate it so much, everyone. Really, I do. Thank you, thank you. It really goes a long way. Every single bitty, every single cent. Massive. Huge. Why can't I go in to here? Oh, placing bombs. Alright. We're gonna blow this place up. We're gonna blow the smithereens. Oh, I can't open the safe. I'm not skilled enough. Everyone should be sub now. I think everyone is sub. Thank you. Dude, Kelly is too much. Bless. Are we planting bombs over here? Mm, 20 biddies for the hype. I'd appreciate it so much, dude. Everybody. Planted all the bombs. Let's blow this place to smithereens. So I can get someone to give me a tier 3 and then pay them via PayPal. Interesting. Get them cheap African subs. Stand back. You can totally do that, Snakey. I mean, I'll even do that. I will gift you a tier 3 sub, Snakey. The then you can buy me a game or something with... No. Then it's... Uh, you need... You need to buy the game through, um, no Oryx, why? Don't tell me how to live my life, keep out of this. Bro, it's a huge saving, eh? Let's, let's... <laughs> let the adults talk. Sorry, sir. I'll stay at the kids' table here playing my video games. Wait, where am I going? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm lost. My memory just jumped. Um, I believe I'm meant to go this way. Hello, beautiful people. Firstly, how you doing, bud? Welcome in. How you doing, bro? You don't get pe- Oh. For a get- Oh. That's, that's true. You're right. They clever twitch, bro. You don't get the pee pee. Mm. They're too smart, these twitch people, bro. Shut up. Let's blow this. I want to blow this place up, man. That's what I want to do. Speak to the Brotherhood upstairs. All right. I can do that. Too 
Can we test and try kill the quest giver? We can't. You can't. I don't think you, I, I, I don't think I've ever tried. What will happen if I shoot the quest giver NPCs? I sent Peak fifty dollars so he would buy a shit Cape Town Guinness once for fifty bucks. You know what? Do you get Kill Kenny still in the UK for a snakey? We don't get that beer in South Africa, the Kill Kenny. And you know what? I don't understand why. It's like such a good beer. I thought it was super popular. Lolrex, do the kids' table get crayons? Asking for a friend. It would be weird if the kids' table didn't have crayons. Even the adult table should have crayons, bro. Uh, lots of times I go out and then adults order the crayons at the kids' ta uh, at the table and they just draw. Kelly did it the other day, even. I love it. I think they should always give out the crayons. You bought a few shots for us as well that night for that 50. I promise, yeah, probably peak. 50 is a lot, bro. Thousand Rand. Give me a chance. Speak to the Brotherhood upstairs. Are you smoking something? Where's the bro? Huh? No, oh, back then it was like 8 Rand. If I recall. Okay, oh, then it was a little bit. Yeah, dude, it's like flipping 19 rand to the dollar almost now. I don't know. Uh, that's the last time I checked. It was crazy like that. Stella, how you doing, Stella? Welcome in. How was the rest of your evening yesterday, Stella? You have a good one? You work hard? I Back then, I was also so broke and had never been unemployed. Before. Glory days. I wasn't broke. You weren't broke. Mission was a success, and Fort Atlas is safe. But you employed now. Decisive action drove the enemy from our home, as it has in the past, and will in the future. Maybe now you see the merit of my command, Initiate. Act together without hesitation, and we can win any battle. We survive. Oh yeah, thank you for the hype train. Sorry I missed that. Thank you everyone. Uh, Lol rings. Kelly Serenity. PK Pigs. Smurf. And Kelly Serenity again. Thank you guys for that hype train. Romani destroyed the transmitter. Romani doomed our brotherhood to isolation. Now, Follow up. I destroyed the transmitter. Are blind to WD40 smells nice. <laughs> you only did this to Where do people come up with these names, bro? WD40 smells nice. Does it smell nice? Double D40. I don't know if I like the smell of it. It's just got that oil smell, you know? But I mean, hey, if you like it, you like it. It is good. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not the Enjoy worst smell ever, WD-40. I like the smell of gasoline. When you go to the petrol station, I always fill up my car and top up a little mug for myself. No, I'm just kidding. I don't do that. Don't do that. But I love the smell of gasoline. I don't know what to say. Paladin Romani has always butted heads with the elders, but cutting ourselves off entirely? And I've never seen Nightshin behave that way toward a superior officer. His rage has taken You're so lol rings. I heard that in Australia that the, the gasoline doesn't smell like you can't get high off the fumes. It doesn't have the same smell that the gasoline does in South Africa and not, like in the US and stuff. Is that true? The elders found the brotherhood, but they but we can't stay shackled to the past. Maybe Romani was right after all. Shin is right to be upset. The Brotherhood needs its structure. Rami crossed the line. Yeah, they're both nuts. I'm speechless too. I don't know what to say. Paladin Romani has always butted heads with the Elders, but cutting ourselves off entirely, and I've never seen Night Shin behave the way towards a superior officer. His rage has taken complete control of his senses. I agree. Yeah, they're both nuts. I'm speechless too. They each have beliefs so strong they die for them. 
their passions drive them forward, but leave no room. I'm just checking if they're next to us. I'm like, we're talking about these people Clear quite hectically. Heal easily. There's too much animosity between those two now. I still believe that maybe we need to kill them both. Follow her. I plan to do everything I can to make that happen. We've been through a lot. Until next time. Oh. Well, WVG40 smells nice. Welcome in. My name is Dead Oryx. Pleased to meet you. Where are you from? And also another follow Slayer. Thank you so much for the follow, Slayer. Welcome in. My name be Dead Oryx. You get the bit emotes forever. If you take a deep whiff of it, it still makes you lightheaded. Oh, is it? But that smell, that's the good stuff. Have a power uh, suit yet? I do have a power suit. But Tony, how are you doing? Hello there, welcome in. I do have a power suit. Um, I use it a little bit, but I'm, I'm, I'm going to do most of this playthrough without the power suit. You can drink petrol, but only once. Bro, when I was a kid, siphoning petrol out of the tin for your motorbike i remember i was like i don't even think i was 10 years old bro and i was trying to siphon from the the, the can into my bike and i was sitting there trying to suck it and put it in my bike suck put it in my bike and the next minute i hear fucking bees like flying around and i'm like I remember like being little and being like, why is there bees? I don't see. And I was like scared of bees, bro. But meanwhile, I was starting to get high off the gasoline. And I was like, my, my hearing was like, ooh, 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 you know, and everything was like, whoop, 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 whoop. I was like seven years old and I was like trying to siphon the, I'm sure it has some long-term effect. That's why I am the man I am today. Half brained. Be careful of gasoline peeps. I was doing it without adult supervision. Spent a lot of my early years without adult supervision. But that's how we learn, eh? You don't need to pa you don't need a parachute to skydive, you need a parachute to skydive more than once. That's hilarious, bro. Absolute truth. Check in check in with Russell Dorsey. Fair enough, don't want to be OP, yeah, I don't want to be OP. You can carry a lot more, there are good instances to use it, I'm not saying I won't ever use it, but for the most part I'm not going to use it, Brettoni, if ever. Derox, please explain how you do that again. Oh my god. I realize what I did now, PK, I'm not doing it again, sir. Fuck. Uh, diesel permanent marker and burnt rubber are my kryptonite. Do you like the smell of burnt rubber? Permanent marker is a good one though too. I also like the smell of a permanent marker. I don't like the smell of burnt rubber though. That's interesting that you like that smell. I do like the smell of diesel. I like the smell of diesel when it's coming out the back of a vehicle. Like diesel doesn't have to say it's got like a sweet smell when it's coming out the back of a car. Uh, Bretoni, I drank bleach the other day. Someone put it in the fridge in a damn water jug. Dude, Bretoni, that is... You should have gone to the doctor, bro. Like that is so know. dangerous, man. Jeez, please. I hope you told the person that did this to please label the bottles. That is awful. I've done that with vodka. Thought it was water. But that's different. You get drunk. Unless you're that chick from A Thousand Ways to Die, whose parachute didn't work and she survived. There have been cases where people have fallen from extraordinary heights and they have survived. There's also a case in the 1960s or the early 70s, there was an aerostess that uh, got flown out, there was a bomb on the aeroplane or something and it exploded and the aerostess got like flown out of the aeroplane thousands of feet into the air and she landed in like the forest somewhere she survived. It's, a, it's like a famous story. You can also Google that. That's weird, eh? How some people can fall. Humans have fallen from massive heights and have survived. More than one occasion. It's been several before. 
So if you fall out of an airplane, there's still a chance. Very slim. But there's a chance that you could survive even. How crazy. My mom kept hemp oil in a 500 milliliter Coke bottle in the fridge. I chugged it and almost threw up. Did, it, did you get high? Did you get from that? Pine size Pam. Hi, hi, everyone. Hello, Pam. How are you doing, Pam? Who are you causing Don't trouble for today, Pam? Lies. Don't tell me. This time it was Charles. I missed a thousand ways today. I remember I watched it one or two episodes and it used to be in like with the Discovery Channel, the History Channel or something. <clears throat> Kelly unvip'd me. Kelly unvip'd me. How? Oh, you still got your you still got your VIP there. If I'm going to be a veggie, I'd rather die. Really, Twacky? I don't think it's the... You know, it's not nice, obviously. No one wants to be in that state, but... Yeah, it would be tough. Twacky would be tough. Tough. Like, you mean you, you can't... Your entire body cannot move? Hmm. But, you know, with Neuralink, maybe they can put you in a video game or something, and you can live in that. Walk around in Fallout 76. Good, thanks. I'm a little anxious today. What's brought on the anxiety, Pint Size Pam? It's normal to be anxious. It's like a normal human emotion. We got to live through it, though. I'm sorry to hear that. I was listening to Rob Dahl, actually. There's. Can I give you a podcast episode to listen to, Pine Size Pam? That it really is. It's so good. And it's only like 10 minutes long. But it's all about this, like, anxiety. And it, it could maybe help you. The job. Okay. Can I send you this podcast? It's literally about what you are the 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 job hunt anxiety thing also herdies pine size pam we've got a section in the discord called networking take a look there but the thing coming out and telling people um this is a good idea tell people that you're looking for work you know you got to spread the news the only way we know that you're looking for work is by spreading the good word that you are you're fun employed Pine size Pam. I mean, try this episode of. I listened to this the other day, and he was literally talking about like being overwhelmed and like trying to do like set up your um, your plan for the future. Like, would be he even mentions like looking for a job and the, how overwhelming it can be. And he's got some really good tips. If you want to, just a suggestion. There's the link there. I'm posted in chat. Um, it's have a listen to it when you got ten minutes. Just have like a pen and paper in front of you, put the podcast in, block everything else, and then just listen to this podcast and then continue with your day. Uh, if you want to, of course, obviously, just a suggestion. How do I join the server? Exclamation mark Discord. There is the link. You can click it there. It should uh, bring you into the server. Pro Snakey, I drank bleach once, but only a small bit, and I was fine. Yeah, but I think like do you, I don't think a huge amount would be very healthy or like continued amount. I don't know, but I just I know that bleach is can't fuck bro it's so dangerous and we keep this stuff inside our kitchen we are you have to be so careful kids bro yeah i wouldn't want to die yeah <laughs> i think it would be an awful experience and i don't think like until you die i think it's going to be very uncomfortable uh derox i think dan is my friend now be careful strawberry stella dan's a sneaky one he crawls right into your heart and then you can't get him out and he lives there, deep inside your heart for years and years and years. Old Dan, Dan, the American man. A, ma a friend of mine drank something like paint thinners while sleepwalking. And he had to be hospitalized because his whole esophagus was burnt. Luckily, he fully recovered. Dude, that's insane. From sleepwalking. You dr Fuck. That is so hectic, bro. Oh, game server. Sorry, Aura. Uh, just add me, Dead Oryx Without Spaces, and then um, jump into my game. And then I'll add you onto my party if you want to join the party as well. You don't have to join the party. You can go and do your own missions. But if you're in the party, we I think we share XP. The worst thing I ever drank was straw rum. Straw rum is lovely, bro. I mean, it's not lovely. I lie. But it's, it's not the worst. 
No, Dan. Stay here. But I did it knowingly for losing a drinking game. How much was it? For like backpack code, if anyone wants. Peak Apex throwing away gold like that. There's a, there's a backpack for anyone if they want it. There's the code for the backpack. Grab it. You have to put that code into Bethesda, by the way. So you have to open up Bethesda's website. You go in there. It says redeem a code. Put the code in. You get the backpack. You just restart. Even for PS. Yes, Bravo Alpha. It works for PS. You got to go to Bethesda, though. The website. Take the code. Plant it in. And you'll get it for PS. It's the same. You're not excluded from this, Bravo Alpha. You are included. I don't have the luxury of friends. Okay, back to chill vibes. How are the games? Always chill vibes, Pam. Always chill vibes. Just click now, we'll listen after your stream. I'm only ending my stream this evening. But if you want to wait till the end of the stream, in your own time. But I would like it if you listen to it. And listen to more of Rob Dial's stuff. Neither. Carnage, the sweet man. Just a couple of overseas outsiders. Dude, Carnage, you... More than welcome to come visit me anytime, bro. You know you got a you got a room. You got a cold beer waiting for you over here. And maybe even a back massage. I'm not I'm not so bad with these fingers. Not so bad at all. How you doing, Carnage? Take it quick. You know me, I need to jump off to do the job search thing. No, you must, absolutely. And work. That I have to do? Absolutely. I know you pun size Pam. We here for you, dude. For some reason, my Spotify keeps bugging out. Can I get a balm massage? That's supposed to save back. Well, either one, bro. Either one. I'm happy to do that. All's all back. I can't remember my password on Bethesda. Then reset your password and it'll go to your email, bravo. Come, bravo. Yesterday, Silent Storm asked me to put the volume, how to put the volume up on the TV remotes. The guy's 27 year old. I promise you he's an old man trapped in a young man's body. My dad won't even ask me how to put the volume up on the remote. How do you put the volume up on the TV remote control, dead Oryx? Hey, hey, I've met your mom, spoken to your sister. I'm pretty well from f pretty well family now. So get the fuck over here and play Monopoly with me. <laughs> There's always a space at the Monopoly table for me, hey, Carnage. No, you are part of the family. Absolutely you are, bro. I do need to come over soon. If, to, if this year I wasn't so keen on doing the TwitchCon thing, I would have 100% gone to Oz. I just need to wait for one of my sister's daughters to turn 18 so she can leave the house so I've got a room to stream from. Keep this as has she left the house yet. Stop or silence is a baby. No, he's not a baby, he's 27 years old. He doesn't have a driver's license and he doesn't know how to put the volume up on the TV remote control. I'm worried about silence storm. <laughs> no, I love him to bits. The silence my favorite little sweetie but they invited you my sister yeah no she has she really wants me to come to australia she asks me almost every time i speak to her actually every time i speak to her she'll tell me like when are you coming to australia you know i'll do anything in my power for you to stay here you can use my setup, you're gronk. I'll just play board games in the background. Oh, thank you, Carnage. You know, underpants, bro. IRL Monopoly stream, we're gonna do it. I haven't played Monopoly in the longest time. I miss it, actually. I managed to type up my name perfect. Wait, let me finish this mission so I can accept you. Gosh, just give me a minute. I'm still not done compiling the last report. What are you talking about? You mean you haven't heard? The super mutants didn't just hit Fort Atlas. I'm getting reports from all over. Even Foundation. Damn. <gasps> Hold on. If you haven't heard, the Knight and Paladin might not have either. Oh, no. I'm so busy receiving the reports that I... Anyway... Bro, foundation. 
I took all the weapons from Foundation literally just before they attacked. So if I left the weapons with them, they probably would have been able to defend themselves in Foundation. But now they were left without any weapons because I took all their weapons. Oh no. Joining from my coffee shop office of the day. Hope everyone is well. Are you at the coffee shop today? Doing very well. Just playing Jimmy. Welcome in, bro. Sometimes it's nice to just get out of the house and go and work from another office. No. Lol Rinks, so Carnage is also, he's from Brisbane, he's another Aussie here, part of the family. Underpants, are you five? I'm going slug out all day, bro. Okay, sweet. No, I don't wear underpants either. I was just checking. Whew. That was a close call. I'm a free baller, bro. Free ball, Rx. I'll relay the report. Can you tell me more about these attacks? Should I check in on the foundation? Yes. Sounds like foundation has things under control. And they're helping out anyone they can. Oh, sweet. They foundation is good. Phew. All right. I was worried about Foundation because I took all their weapons, but they're fine. I'll re oh, relay the report. Thing. Foundation has been tracking nearby attacks. They think the mutants might be coming from those caverns. Uh, what are they called again? Uh, wacky caverns. Unlikely caverns? Uh, uh, oh, uncanny caverns. That's right. Anyway, thanks for helping out. I've got my hands full here. I need to try to get out of the house a few times a week. Working from home is turning me into a hermit. Yeah, I know, bro. It's good that you do that, Jimmy. It's like, just get out, go try a different restaurant every time or something. Or even go to someone's house, bro. Just, yeah, you can't be in the house all the time. You need to change the scenery. But yeah, a coffee shop is a great idea. All right, let me, um, I got you, Lord Vega. Add friend. That's the only invites I have. Lord Vega boss tickets online. You guys, are you going to join my... Are you in this game already? You must join my uh, server boss tick and um, Vega, I'm joining. Cool. You don't have to be in my party if you don't want to, but then we're in the same map at least. The brotherhood needs good uh, let see. Please do a Dan impression. Yeah, got it. Like Hug me, Oryx. Like my briefs. Not sure if I be Hug me. I Clothes are just extra washing. Exactly, Snakey. Are you naked right now? Who's the other Aussie? No, Lol Rinks is an Aussie. Um, we got Orion's pants here. It's also Aussie. Yeah, Lol Rinks is, Lol Rinks is from Tassie, though. She's a Tassie Aussie. Yo, Storm Chappy. Tasmania, well, well, well. <laughs> we got it. What? Bro, it's so weird. Like, there are three people in my community that are from Tasmania. I found that com so wild. Like, of all the places in the world, Tasmania. What the hell, bro? There's so much to be said here, but I'll refrain and hold judgment. Judgment is not a good thing, Carnage. Rather hold it. Glad we're playing this instead of forced streamer reactions of Jimmy. Was so bleak yesterday, bro. Oh, uh, I was feeling. I was like, I felt bad after a while. I was like, shit. I just want to end this game because Jimmy's getting so upset here, and I just don't want to be here anymore. Whatever it takes. It's a fun game, but it does like I could even see that uh, Katie Rose and Rihanna were even getting a little bit bored of it. it like. Once you hit a point in that game where it's just like, okay, we're kind of doing the same thing over and over. I watched the Fallout series and you were right. It's really good. So good. I decided to start modding Fallout 3 into a 2024 quality game. Firstly, if you do that, please can you um, take a little video of how it looks and put it, send it to me or just put it in the Discord. Because I really, I really enjoy seeing how people mod games to make them, bring them into 2024. Uh, they will all be related. That's why Dead Oryx. I've heard. I've heard that. What's it? There's. What's the. Bogans. They say a lot of Bogans living in Tassie. That's my village, bro. I'm a Bogan. But I'm a Bogan living in South Africa. I should be in Tasmania. Hanging out with my people. Join up. 
Yo, Rocky Vega TV, what's up? Hello, Mr. Oryx. Hello, Rocky Vega TV. Welcome in. Good to see you here. Yes, the game dies at some point. They will need mods for the game to have a long uh, life plan. And even then, it will be one you pay for short periods. Wait, what, what game are we talking about? Hey, Stella? No man, ignore me. You play whatever you want. Thank you, Jimmy. I'm only t but no, you did have an effect on me. I was actually like, no, Jimmy, I, I don't want to. You got into my head, bro. Now I don't want to play the game anymore. It's that easy. But I still want to play PUBG. Can I still buy? Yes, you can. There we go. Kelly Serenity you bought a ticket. Strawberry Stella bought a ticket. You can buy up to two tickets if you want. Citizen Red, you got yourself a ticket. Doing good. Getting a little workout in. Nice, bro. Extra rep for the herd, Rocky Vega. Extra rep for the herd. The herd is you and me and all of us. No, I really want to go to Tasmania, Carnage. I've, it's a little, The only thing I hear from a lot of the Tasmanian devils is that it's colder there in Tassie. Which, I don't know, maybe in summer it's a better thing. Bring the temperature down just a little bit. Just one for me, working towards VIP. Let's go, Kelly. Maybe I should join up. Not me trying to buy four. Four tickets, novel. Cheeky. Absolutely beautiful. I can imagine, eh, lol rings. Oh, you guys are spoiled to live on your own little island, dude. Fucking lucky. Oh, sorry, killing fields. I'm like chatting your ear off here, bro. Report to Paladin Rami and Night Shin. I have returned and welcome back. We have been waiting for your return, Juice Pickle. Give the people what they want. Turn the temp up and take your shirt off. Oh no, not one of those workouts. Lol, mine are a little more niche. Wait, what, what workout are you doing, Rocky Vega? Please expand on that just a little bit. I want to know more. Tickets for what, Mr. Noobel? We do a, a, a Wheel of Anxiety here once a month. Um, so I, I sell tickets for an exorbitant price of 25,000 channel points. It's a way for me to cull all the channel points a little bit out of the herd. Because you guys collect a whole lot. So I want to remove them out of your wallet so I can bring the, you know, restore balance in the community. So I do the Wheel of Anxiety. So I sell the tickets on a Thursday. Then on the Friday, I take all the people who bought tickets. So if you bought two tickets, your name goes into the wheel twice. And then every hour, I spend the, spin the wheel 10 times. And every time it lands on a name, I remove that name out of the wheel. So, and then we wait an hour and we'll do it again. And we wait an hour and do it again. Eventually the wheel gets thinner and thinner. And then we, that's why we call it the wheel of anxiety. So it's best to go out early. So you don't have to sit and, oh, am I still in the wheel and still in the wheel? Anyway, the last person to survive the wheel gets a $50 get Steam voucher to buy, you know, buy a game of Steam for $50. You can get, at least if you wait for a sale or something, you can get more than one game. Or you can maybe buy like a new game if you add some cash to it. Because I, I know that you can't really get a brand new game for $50. But close though. Uh, Trigger ZA Morning Oryx, what's in the wheel of misfortune? Just $50 this time. Sometimes it changes. Like we've had wheels that have got $200, like that was the most we've had in a wheel. We actually split it in two. So it was $100, $100. So if the last two people each got $100. So we got sponsored for that wheel. Uh, oh, no, no. That one is because I, I put the money on that, that fighter. But I lost it again. I was hoping to do another big wheel. But I lost all the I bet on a UFC fight. And I won it, so that's why I took the money from the USC fight and I put some of it into the wheel. That's why I made it so big. But then I took my winnings and I bet on another fight and I lost all my money. So we got just the normal size wheel this time. Um, but if I can win another next fight, I'll place money on. If we win, I'll put that money into the wheel again. Even the fuckers who don't buy tickets get toxic. Like they're not even involved. They're just a spectator in the cheap seats. Yeah, yeah, they do get involved. It's fun for everyone. Even if you don't buy a ticket, it's fun to be here. You didn't mention how everybody gets toxic. Yeah, and everyone gets toxic. It's the one time where they're not the one time. We do get a little toxic here sometimes. That's on me. But we get toxic on the wheel. So it's all fun and games. 
it, we don't mean it but like when the wheel lands on it we'll all shout like get the fuck out you know like get out of here and then people like leave the wheel you know then we have an after party for all the people that didn't win it's a whole fun thing that we do yeah it's make sure you're here tomorrow even if you don't buy a ticket you'll see ladies and gentlemen gambling at its finest yeah i'm no i'm no please don't do what i do do as i say don't gamble your money and then take the winnings and put it in the wheel of anxiety take the 50 dollars and put it 35 on black make it 1800 dollars easy don't tempt me peaky but if you want me to do that with your 50 dollars when you win i'll do it it's up to you what you want to do with your 50 dollars is your choice if you don't even want a steam voucher i'll send you an, an amazon voucher if you want that it doesn't matter if you want a playstation voucher i'll send you a 50 dollar playstation or xbox voucher it doesn't have to be steam and it doesn't have to be a voucher i can send you the cash through paypal if you want it doesn't bother me it's just a little gift from me i sent you users to just get you 20 you know have a little bit of fun and get rid of all your channel points it makes it worth it body hunters welcome in how are you doing today body hunters thinking about you dude who the fuck are you calling a spectator? I'm a former champ, you loser. J Chill did won a wheel. Who else has won a wheel here? J Chill's won. Who else? Any winners? Any other winners hanging out here? Storm Chap, you got yourself a ticket. Trigger got two tickets. You got shots by the door. Yes, you get shots at the door. Exactly. If you don't win in the wheel, you go out to the parking lot party and you get free shooter taco thursday no such thing me i won no you didn't win snakey lack lex won lex didn't you win the big wheel the hundred dollar wheel or was it a fifty dollar wheel i win the hearts of the herdies every time stella oh yes vega also won you also won a didn't you win a hundred dollar wheel as well yeah i won the big boy yeah lack lex won the big boy nice for you and vega won the big boy hundred bucks i won a headband and a steam voucher did you get a headband Twacky, have I sent you your headband, bro? You need to come fetch it from me if I haven't. Tonight, I'll see you at Thrashes. Did I hear free shooter just for you, Genie? Free shooter, sir. I want a headset. Our stockpiles are not oh, yes, I remember that. I got that headset from the same one I've got here. I got it from uh, Eve Tech. That was compliments, Eve Tech. They gave it to me as a gift, and then I, I gave it to you. Did you see my other message? No, I might have missed the Rocky Vega TV. Let's just say his weapon of choice is also mine. Ever seen Bruce Lee films? Oh, you do, uh, what's the martial arts? Hey, Rocky Vega, what martial arts does he do? Hyper Wolf guy, two tickets, bro. Into the wheel you go. We're spinning the wheel tomorrow. But apparently I didn't win it. Oryx just felt bad for me and gave it to me. Yeah, you won it, bravo. No, I don't feel bad. I gave it to you because I love you. And it was a nice little gift. Oh, skate park? Yes, sir. Tonight. How does one search for the server? You just have to add me. You just add me, Dead Oryx, and then join on me, Aura. Coco the Koala. Oops, I shot the guy. Didn't mean to do that. Just add me here, and then I will... You can join. You can join my server. He created his own style called... Shit Kundo. His weapon of choice was. Do you use the nunchucks, bro? No ways. That's so dope. The attack on the substructure may be just the beginning. Nunchucks. When someone can work the nunchucks properly, it's it's very interesting. It's a very cool thing to see. But only if you can do it properly. Yo, he was amazing with the nunchuck. He play. He play table tennis with it. I do, 23 years experience. Bro, you must be then a pro with it. Can you play ping pong with nunchucks, Rocky Vega? Ms. Oryx, where is the still West Virginia? What? Where is this still West Virginia? What do you mean? I don't know what you're talking about then. Nope. Have you tried yet, Rocky Vega? I heard that ping pong video was fake though and not actually him i could believe that you know i've like looked at that video like i've slowed it down and it'd be like is this real can either confirm or deny the map what do you mean are you playing are you playing fallout 76 dan we're 
This game is in like Virginia. It's in Appalachia. We're in Appalachia. Make sure to fill out your I think it's Virginia. Like, because isn't the Virginia Appalachia Falls in Virginia? Virginia is part of the Appalachia. So is like Kentucky and and other places, right? Yeah, West Virginia. It's West Virginia, hey? I know the Appalachia Mountains spread over a few states. It's not just in West Virginia. It obviously takes up a portion of West Virginia. Sport events weren't shot like that back in the day. And they're not using shots like that now either. No, I can believe that, bro. I feel like that didn't look real. It looked very unrealistic. Like, too good to be true, right? I remember owning the game, but I don't remember on what launch I had it. I think we got it for free on Epic at one point, Body Hunters. But you can check Microsoft. You probably have it there if it's not an Epic. Why was that hard to figure out? I wasn't sure what you were talking about, Dan. The way you structured your sentence was confusing. Dead saying words like Appalachia and West Virginia and borders and stuff because he saw them somewhere. No, because I know it does in Kentucky. Not it does. Appalachia is not in Kentucky. New Hampshire to Georgia. Is it not in Kentucky? Literally, I have. There were guys in this community when I first started streaming, and they were in Ken uh, Kentucky, and they, they were like, "Oh no, we live in like the Appalachian Mountains." I was like, "Oh, is it in Kentucky?" He's like, "Yeah, it's part of it is in Kentucky." So I didn't know that. I thought it was. Suburb, thanks for days. Thank you so much for the subscribe. The tier one, thank you, sir. Welcome in, thanks for days. Yeah, lol. All you need is the right tech and filters, and you can make anything look old. Just some filters, right, Rocky Vega? You have to be careful of what you see on the internet. I mean, I that's been the case for a long time. Appalachian Mountains stretch for miles upon you miles. Yeah, they, it's army. huge, huge, huge. It's like, that's where like the Bigfoot and stuff are hiding, bro. Up in those mountains. I'm sure there's some weird and wacky shit happening in the Appalachian Mountains that we know nothing about. Like that place is massive and eerie. I would love to go though. It's been a, it's been definitely one of the my bucket list places, the Appalachia. I need a grandpa. Like a headache grandpa. A headache tablets, grandpa. Or like do you really want an actual grandpa? Please check friend request. I'll gotcha. I trust you're adjusting the service for the Brotherhood. Romani and I were just discussing the patrol schedule. This is far more important than a patrol. We're talking about people's lives. What do you need, Initiate? Initiate Darcy sent me. There have been more super mutant attacks across Appalachia. Time yeah, definitely a cool video either way. Yeah, it's a cool video. I just wish we had a definite answer on if it was real or fake, you know? Because I want to admire someone's skill for their actual skill and not like, you know, have false admiration of something that never happened. Like, it dilutes, like, I just found the answer, it's fake. Okay, there we go. So for the longest time, I was like, thought that was real, bro. Follower, Spitfire314, thank you for the follow, welcome in. Because you know what I'm saying? It dilutes like actual skill. Like you actually working with the ninchucks is going to be like, yeah, that's cool. But you see what Bruce Lee can do, you know? You know what I'm saying? It's like, no, that's fake. So what you can do is actually amazing, you know? Oh my God, Emma's watching Jupiter's Legacy. What's that? Is that a series? Never heard of it. This is the greatest game ever. Spitfire, I'm leaning to agree with you, sir. I love, uh, but I love Fallout and I'm really enjoying 76. I'd take you playing it as well. I wouldn't be surprised if he actually could do it, though. The man was insanely skilled. Yeah, he was skilled, right? He was in incredible. Like, but how much was real? How much was fake? He was a Hollywood star, bro. He was a movie star. Like, he was very good at his martial arts, but he got caught up in the ritz and glitz and glamour of Hollywood. And I think that was his ultimate downfall, you know. 
Yes, sir. Good times, brother. Absolutely, Spitfire. Where are you from, bro? Yeah, this game really has come so far from its initial launch. Dude, seeing all the people come in here and be like, oh, isn't this game like trash? And I, it's sad because I'm like, bro, no, it's amazing. Like, I feel bad for Fallout. Didn't get the release that they wanted to get. But now they they had their redemption arc with this series they got the the the, the launch that they they you know that they, they deserve they had the highest player count this week i saw recent pics of clint eastwood eastwood at age 93 holy shit what a shock what because he's old bro he's ancient dude but he's still grafting he's still making movies he's still out there that man is a machine for the old clint eastwood Missouri, USA, how about you, friend? What level are you? I'm from uh, South Africa. I'm in a town called Pretoria, a city called Pretoria. Um, I'm still early days. I did take the um, little, you know, the start at level 20. I have played this before like three times. And this is a one fallout I never finished, Spitfire. So it was a perfect timing for me to play it again with the release of the show. So I am only on like level 30, 39, maybe follower. Disregarded, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. How you doing, bro? Clint Eastwood, he's 94. I sent you a pic of him earlier. You did? But he looks good for his age, I thought, you know. Dan, you can get a South African passport if you can get a green card. If I can get a green card from you, lol. Swap a South African passport for a green card. Marry that man, Dan. You want to get yourself a South African passport. Like I said, you can go to Botswana without a visa if you have a South African passport. It's really cool. Don't fall for his tricks. Follow up. Hey, Spitfire. Let's go, bro. The man learns quickly, dude. Uh, okay, very nice. Glad you're enjoying the game. Thank you, bro. I'm glad you're also having fun. If you ever want to come and jam with me, I'm live for mostly nine hours a day early i know it's super late for the peeps in the usa but if you do sleep now i will be here when you wake up you're doing the bos line huh uh yes i am but i was told berserker that it doesn't matter the which line you take you can still go and do the other line they kind of cross over each other is that true gonna get to it though we'll try to pop back in after a bit rocky vega thank you so much for popping in dude it really means a lot man thank you so much uh enjoy the workouts and don't knock yourself in the balls yeah it's really cool you're really cool yes unlike the old games yeah yeah all right good yeah no because that's what i was worried about like i always get so nervous in fallout choosing a line because i don't want to i want to I'd be able to absorb everything but i guess that's why you do several playthroughs of fallout 4. nearly 5 a.m only up because this game is unfairly addicting it, it dude i played this game for, i've been playing this game this whole week some i've been streaming like up to 12 hours just playing this game console no i'm using a, a xbox remote but i'm on my pc because this game just works so much better with a remote control i don't know what it is but i feel like the mouse and keyboard's a little bit clanky so if you are playing the game and you have a controller, I uh, definitely recommend doing it that way. Never have, probably never will at this point. Well, if you never have, then you never will at this point, for sure, Rocky Vega. Jeez, I feel like if I had to do that, it would be the thing. I would either hit myself in the head or in the nuts. Uh, Berserker, follower. Thank you so much for the follow, bro. Welcome in. Welcome to the herd. Welcome to the community. I have to do the same thing. Wish I could just use my mouse and keyboard, though. Would you... I, like i use both inputs bro some games i play mouse and keyboard some games i play controller that's why i always if you're a gamer if you're a pc gamer a controller needs to be a part of your arsenal everyone needs a controller you don't need anything like fancy just get an xbox controller or playstation 5 controller foundation thinks the mutants are coming from uncanny caverns paladin rahmani is right people need help wait and where do you plan to look? Spending time on the meaningless chase will leave countless homesteads unprotected against mutants. Foundation thinks mutants are coming from Uncanny Valley. And that's where we're headed. Uncanny Caverns. Isn't that exactly what you wanted to avoid? So long as the rest of the initiates stay here, Fort Atlas will be well defended. It takes two to create a conflict for Lonnie. 
gonna have to make some compromises from now on. We don't have any more time to waste. Initiate. I need you to brief initiates Norland and Houston. Come along on this mission. I played this game yesterday and reached level 10 now. Hey, GG, bro. At least you started from zero. Like, I've started on level 20 with this playthrough. But I've done my up to level 20 playthrough like three times. I just never finished it. Mason, Dead Oaks and Gang, what's good, fam? All good, bro. How you doing, man? Welcome in. Having a splendid Thursday morning. Kicking off the day with Fortnite. What needs to be part of my ass? Excuse me. Oh, your arsenal is a, is a controller. Yeah. And <laughs> your arsenal. Sorry, did it cut out when I was trying to say arse. Arsenal. I like both. Depends on how. Yeah, exactly. I also like both, bro. And, and that's I like why I suggest have both inputs. Because some games better with controllers. Some games better with mouse and keyboard. Unless you're one of those weird oaks that play racing games on your keyboard. Sis. No. Shouldn't be done like that. M. Guten Tag, mein Herr. How you doing, M? Welcome in. Got you, daddy. You got me. And for a second, I was like, your ass. And then I realized it was Arsenal. You'll be a good example to other initiates. Let's show them how the Brotherhood handles threats. We don't have any more time to waste. Initiate, I need you to brief initiates Norland and Husen to come along on this mission. You're coming to. I'll brief the initiates. Yeah, the initiates. They should be here in four hours. Keep the Darzo, sis. How you doing, Darzo? Welcome in. I love my stream deck. Oh, Berserker, now you're just flexing. You have a steam deck. I really want a steam deck. That's a toy that I really, really want. I'm jealous. Just letting you know. Dead yesterday I said, I have an Elgato stream deck and a green screen that I don't use. If you want it. Are you serious, bro? I'll buy it from you, Kelly. I got a green screen. But I think the Elgato one is... This one's big. This is three meters of green screen. But, yeah. I'll... I mean, if you're not using it. But I'll, I'll buy it from you. No, I have all. Yeah, I know you do, Mr. Noogle. Didn't we used to play like Fretz on Fire on keyboard before Guitar Hero? Guitars came out. Yeah, we did. Can we really judge? No, but that's fine. Racing games, you can't get those inch movements with racing games. You know, you just left. You have to like tap it, you know, around the track, which is, you can do it. It's like I've done it before. I played many racing games on my keyboard growing up. But controller is just better to have that slight movement. You know, you can inch. Elf. Hello, man. So, how you doing, Alf? Welcome in, bro. Good to see you. Firstly, I want a Steam Deck too, but I never leave my freaking house. But I would never leave my freaking I never leave my freaking house, so it would be a waste on me. That's the thing is, if you do get a Steam Deck, then you can leave your house, firstly. Now you've got an excuse. You can go in the garden and play Call of Duty under a tree. You know? You can play outside for the first time. It's Steam Deck is like Switch for Steam, yeah. But only some, yeah, only some games are stream, uh, Steam Deck compatible. I know that. You're limited in your choices. But that, which is still fine, like, because there's a lot you can still do. Follower, uh, Balaka71, thank you for the follow. Welcome in, Balaka. Thank you for that follow. Uh, do you know why they call Darth Vader Lord Vader? The Stormtroopers kept giggling when they called him Master Vader. Uh... Master Vader. No, I don't get it. Please explain to me. No, I'm just kidding. I knew it would happen eventually. So soon. Speak to initiate Hewson. Do I need to call a seminar on this? Yeah, okay. No, I know you got a stream deck. No, I know. Not a steam thing. <laughs> Yo, Malaka, thank you for the sub, dude. I appreciate that. You get only one Prime sub and you gave it to me. That is very, very... Wow. Thank you so much, Malaka. In your general chat, I posted a pic of my Steam Deck. Malaka, thank you so much. 
Oh my gosh, and it's in my color, bro. This guy's trolling me. Bro, that looks absolutely delicious. How cool is that thing? What do you pay for that stream deck in the US? In South Africa, it's like... It's about $900 for the entry level one, I think. Or about $1,000 almost. Between $900 and $1,000 for the entry level. Getting cake, be right back. Get for the whole class now, Kelly. You gotta buy it off... Uh, you gotta buy it from Incredible Connection. What if she abandoned me? $300 for 64 gig. $399. Bro, I don't have any proof, but it's like uh, twice the price in our country. She probably just It'll be cheaper for me to buy a plane ticket, go to California, pick up the Steam Deck myself and fly back. I'll probably be the same price and I get a and I get a flight to California, spend a weekend there. I'll be around if you need anything. This is I think you mean incredible corruption. Sorry, yes, incredible corruption, because it's double the price. I upgraded mine to one terabyte. Uh, get 64 gig and upgrade to two. Yeah, I think I feel like the 64 is quite small. Like it's not much. That's why it's definitely. I want, dude. Oh, dude, did you see Berserkers? That thing is so smexy, bro. In that color. And my colors are purple. Love that color. Get it and get the SSD. I don't think I'll get it anytime soon, Berserker. I'd love to though. If I come to America, I'll buy one. Because then it's cheaper. Want to see a video? A video on your... I mean, post it in the Discord. I'll check it out for sure, man. I wish Dead would drink water and eat food in the game before he becomes a moist corpse. Follower! The Blacksmith, thank you so much for the follow. Well, <laughs> can't English. The Blacksmith, thank you for the follow. Welcome in, bro. Uh, I w yeah, I need to drink water. In game and in real life. This is taking me a long time. I'm gonna check it out. It looks rad. it is rad, bro. It's literally a powerhouse computer in your comfort of your hands. I was tempted to get the four terabyte external SSD for three hundred, but figured I can wait. Fourteen terabyte, bro. Oh god, don't sneak up on me like that. Initiate Houston. Prepare your arms. You have been called to the field of duty. My arms? You mean like a gun? A real one? Issue is tax, import tax, and there's no official distributor for there's Stream Decks. No yeah. Yeah. I figured that's it. Yeah. Import tax on electronics is so expensive. That's why it's just better if you can buy it yourself and ship it here. Yeah. Do you think you buy it off Amazon and get it shipped to South Africa? And Nintendo Switch is also quite expensive in South Africa, but it's there's a distributor here, so it's not that difference in price. It's actually quite similar to the US price, a little bit more expensive than the States. Of course, but not like, like because Steam Deck, like uh, Peak says, there's no distributor here. If you are initiated Houston, then you need to meet us at Uncanny Caverns. Oh my God, I'm not ready for this. There's no way I'm ready for this. Can I stay in the infirmary, infirmary? Please let me stay in the infirmary. Shame. Hey, don't worry. There's no need to be so nervous. Let me right. no calm her nerves it. first. I'm just being called in for my first ever field mission. By Night Shin, and I don't know what I'm doing, and I won't know what I'm doing in front of him. So not only am I probably going to die, but I'll look stupid doing it, and I should stop. Yeah, no need to be nervous. Nope, no reason at all. How did you even become a Brotherhood Initiate? Me? Oh, good question. I mean, I was um, helping Dr. Hardy when Dr. Hardy got recruited. And I, I guess he oh, recommended me. I'm good at medical things. Really? Well, I think I am. I mean, we saved a lot of people back then. And just forget I said any of that. I don't know. Really, I'm, I'm just trying my best. This can't be real. Okay, I'm 
I'm gonna puke. No, no, wait. I, I have to get my gun. I've never used it, like, outside of the firing range. First time for everything. She's right? a skatey okay. cats. Um, I'll be there. At Victorium. I would just find someone in the US and ship it I'm to you personally. Yeah, that's another way to do it. I, de I, I mean, I could ask one of my friends in the States. I've got, a, I've got fortunate to have one or two good friends over there that could do that for me. I've, I've thought about that option too, Berserker. It's definitely the way to do it. Sending it from the States to South Africa is going to cost about 50 or maybe $100. So even with that price, it's still going to be cheaper, which is crazy. But I, I do plan to go to the States at some point. Again, hopefully this year, I want to try and go to TwitchCon in San Diego. Uh, it's not a certain thing, but I definitely would like to try. I don't sleep the voice doesn't match the facial expressions? No, it doesn't. Okay, now I'll speak to initiate Nor... Norland. <laughs> got it. Ticket! Snowball Ninja, you got yourself to... You don't have to do that, Snowball. Will you get a free ticket? I'll just put all the mods in anyway. By the way, Connor18644, how you doing, Connor? Welcome in. Thank you so very much for the follow. Refund Snowball. I would have someone mod it. Mod, uh, what? Steam Deck? No ways. I wouldn't touch that thing. I'll leave it pristine vanilla. Yeah, yeah, Steam Moister. Worms. Thanky. Join Z. Y'all want to get tripped this weekend? Wait, what? The Steam Deck just SD. Oh, yeah, I'll do that for sure. That's an upgrade, definitely. I will do. Uh, Phoenix Derox, hello, sir. How you doing, Phoenix? Welcome in. I would have to ask Snowball how to <laughs> Snowball knows how to do it. Uh, Night Shin is sending us on a mission to track down the super mutants. Meet us at the Uncanny Caverns. Add Victorium, initiate. What can I do for you? Well, no need to be so formal. Please to, make, please to meet your acquaintance, initiate. Do you mind introducing yourself? What do you know about initiate Houston? Let's ask it's about that. It's not my place to give an opinion on the other recruits. I trust the judgment of Paladin, Romani, and Night Shin. This guy is a stiff. Said, I hope initiate Houston is getting the support she needs to succeed here. She's not militarily inclined. She isn't. She's more medical. So. You can count on me. I'll report there immediately. This guy's good soldier, man. I like him. Up and at him. But it's that Houston I'm worried about. She don't look like she know what she doing. Why did I, say that? I don't want her out in the battlefield. She can work the mid bay. Berserk, I changed uh, my intro screen and seep screen into Pit Boys, same as my UI. That is, see, that is so dope, bro. Now you make me want one even more. Stop it, Berserk. Are you selling these things or something, bro? Because I want one more and more. Derox, may I recommend something? Maybe do a Kukuru or comp connecting to whatever you're playing every Wednesday. For extra entries, tickets into the wheel. This will open the chance for newbies to enter since the herd is growing so rapidly. So we did do a marble race before, uh, Strawberry Stella. And to, buy it, to get into the race. So you had to win a marble race, right? And the person, we had someone enter that like it's luckily is a part of this community and does pop in all the time but i was thinking maybe it's imagine it's one of these people that enter that's never going to be coming back you know anyway that person won the marble race out of like 50 people on the track then he was put into the ticket he won the wheel of anxiety from not buying a ticket he won a marble race and he won the anxiety wheel the chances of him winning that was like zero to none but it actually gave me a bit of a fright because i'm like oh no the whole point of this is to to get rid of the channel points and and give the hoodies an opportunity to win you know the people that are here are dedicated and so i took that element out because of that but that's what made it so cool it just i would struggle to like some person that just like popped in to be like Book you hoodies and taking your gift away from you. I don't like that idea at 
feels a little bit but yeah they're gonna be new people but i want the new people to stay with us and to build up those channel points so we can build a relationship and then we can use that what a legend you're a legend but i understand i, I like the idea it's a cool idea like if we that's why I, I thought if we do something like that it would be like you have to pay an entry to the mob race of five thousand channel points you know what i'm saying so i don't mind doing that or uh, Kukuru, but we have to make it that and I don't know how to do that part. I don't know how to attach The purchasing process to entering the video game Because then we could do it for cheaper like 5,000 channel points. I like your backpack. Thank you. I Like your backpack That juicy pickle don't burn the bucks bro save those bucks But also thank you for burning the bucks. I really appreciate it, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's a waste of bucks, but I'll take it. I'll take what I can get out here. I'm joining the Brotherhood. How about some ticket bundle discounts? 25k for one ticket, 45k for two tickets. The problem with that is. Hey, about joining up. It's a complication with how the ticketing process works. Because then someone would be able to buy one ticket and two tickets. Because then I have to. Twitch doesn't allow me to. Pro, when it be, that's why it's, you, you're very limited in how you can do the ticket pricing and stuff to doing one ticket for a discounted price. I don't know how we would do that. But I like that idea. And I think it could be cool to implement something like that. Lol, should I? Should I? Should, shouldn't I? You should. It's up to you. Like I said, the. If you burn bucks, it's cool because it helps with my channel's growth. And um, so it's like a little, like, hey, I'm supporting the stream and I'm, I'm throwing some bucks down. So it does help me. But at the same time, you know, if you save up those channel points, you can use it to buy a ticket. And if you got too much extra, then you can burn some bucks. Like, like Alex. Thank you for the bucks, bro. Thank you, Lex. There you go. I'm teasing, by the way, but yeah. I hadn't thought about that. No, yeah, even teasing or not, it's still a, it's a good uh, question to ask, bro. Because, you know, I would like to do these sorts of things. And, yeah. And maybe if I didn't know, I would learn something new. JP, you got yourself a ticket, bro. Two tickets, JP. Okay, the uncanny caverns is what we got to do next. We're going over here. We should join up. Like the bad guys. Make a difference. Or whose camps? Bostick's camp. And Killingfield's camp. Hey, Vegas there by his camp. I came All right. too this far game is so freaking cool. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna fast travel so I can do my quest now. What is this? Event guided meditation. Interesting. Okay, uncanny. Let's go. I'm gonna go to Charleston Capital Building, and I'll walk from there. Why does my I'm getting so annoyed? Do you think I need to shut down my uh, Spotify? It stops playing. Coffee? I've had a cup of coffee and it's so hot. Maybe I'll turn the AC on and grab another one. One sec, I'm gonna turn the AC on.
Why don't you do it right like some other men do? I want coffee fair now. Are you going to get a coffee fair? All right, let me finish this quest. Yay. My friends own my game with me. Makes me happy. Is the music too loud? Are you hot teddy? Like super hot? Making me hot now? I'm getting cold now. AC is kicking in. You know what I mean? I know what she means, dude. You're flirting with me, bro. Stop it. Making me all hot and bothered, bro. You're not helping the situation, stew baby. I'd kill for Juliet Harding. Who's that? Who's Juliet Harding? Good luck. Thank you, Bravo. I don't need it, though. Check this, Bravo. Do you have first? Can you do this? Survival tent? Huh? Can you do that, Bravo? Check this. Transfer scrap box. I don't understand this. So all my scrap goes in a scrap box now. But then what about this box? This place should come with a little weapons section, man. Cooking station. Let's go. No. Good luck, the band puppies, poopies. What? I'm confused. But I'm always confused. But I can't, Daddy. I haven't got Dan to compete with for your attention. There was never a competition between you and Dan. It was always used to. There was a local girl punk band that did an awesome version of this song. Can't remember the band's name now though. A local girl... Dude, I would love... Oh, is that the... Is the band called Good Luck? You're answering Jonesy. Juliet Harding is the lead singer of a band. Oh, okay. Fuck. Thank you for clearing it up. I was all over the show there, Strawberry Stella. The band is Good Luck. I'm getting confused with Jonesy and you and... I'm just waiting for Stella to carry me in ranked. Local punk band. Probably Japan and I. If you do find that, Jonesy, please let me know. Because I do want to listen to that uh, rendition of the song. The fact finder.
Bro, this fact finder is so strong. Fuck, I need food. Oh, I need to cook food, bro. I've got no... Nothing. Everything's spoilt. I need a hunt. Okay, my concerts are kicking in. Our works. Good luck with the works, dude. I can carry folks in Battlefield 2042 if need. I want us to do Aura. I'll, at some point, I'd love us to do a, get a whole bunch of herdies together and we play some Battlefield, man. Raging, thank you for 12 months, one year, bro. Started my character last night. I was in your stream. You were playing um, Rainbow Six Siege, though. Did you play? Did you start with uh, Fallout, or did you end with Fallout? Because I just left you on. I went to bed. I was just watching you play Siege. That's what the this part of the stream I caught. But raging, thank you so much, bro. I appreciate that sub. Dude, your streams are doing so well, raging. Yeah, I just see you growing more and more every single day. It's so lovely, dude. Guys, if you love FPS shooters and good vibes, go and give this human being a follow. You will not be disappointed. He's just awesome. Check out that freaking gorgeous photo over there. So handsome. Hey? I'm in a tent and the rain is going through it. You're in a tent, a physical tent now, Aura. Why are you in a tent? Are you camping? You're on a camping vacation. I need meat. Lucy is hungry. I'm glad you missed the drunk content warning with Titfi. I missed that, yeah. Making me blush, homie. Appreciate it a ton, of course, bro. Appreciate you. Always, dude. Thank you. Ooh, what's up here? I'm gonna go investigate. That's what I love about this game, bro. It's a whole world of just awesome shit you can just investigate, explore. Good afternoon, Senor Oryx. Good afternoon, JP. How you doing, bud? Welcome in. <coughs> just FYI, JP. Tickets are on sale today if you haven't purchased one yet. Blood Eagle. This guy's the worst.
Fuck this guy, bro. Oh my god. You can collect so much more if you got this first camp. Because I just think now, just whenever I want, I just stop and flip and throw everything in my camp. Widow's perch. Yep. Goddamn blood eagles. Oh, I'm gonna kill. Damn it. Oh, it's a Wendigo. I just got killed by a Wendigo. Is game start off, Craig? No, it's not off. I think it might be just a bit soft. Ki yeah, let's check now. Tell me if this is better. It's soft, not off. Windigos are tough. Yeah, they are. They're scary buggers as well, eh? Let me know. I just want to balance the audio right. I also need to get food, bro. I haven't got any food. Maybe I'll just go back to my camp and come. Figure this out later. I oh, know. Why am I shooting these? Glowing Windigo as well. Here we go, I got some Cajun beans. Ooh. And we got a crafting bench. Perfect. Makeshift battery. Does it make makeshift battery is it good? I just feel like it would be good. To carry around. Thank goodness we've got some food. Let's have a purified water. And let's have a Cajun rice beans. Thank you for the boss check and the water redemption. Is that better? Can you hear the game? Can you hear the game? Can you hear me? Can you hear the music? Okay, computer terminal time. Access instructions. Access to Baishiko. Assaultron recall technology is highly restricted and requires authorization by way of the Baishi Co. Issued Assaultron recall card, this last resort technology to be used only in extreme circumstances. Therefore, these key cards are a one-time use only. These apply for new key cards through the prop please apply for new key cards through the proper channels. Uh, unlock recall system. Capture procedure. 
This is Wolf, about to attempt recall and capture of AWOL unit as noted earlier. This is a very dangerous operation, leaving a log of the procedure in case attempt is a failure. I'm going to dispense with the brevity here. This is important. The unit is equipped with shielding technology that protects it from all manner of weapons. To disable the shield, agents will have to use the pylons I acquired. Activating a pylon makes it makes its user a conduit channeling a high voltage through the user to the target. Only all three pylons combined have enough voltage to disable the target's shield. It, this is very stressful on the body, painful, but it's the only way. If I don't make it, good luck to the next of you wolf outs. Hey wolf, they're talking about you Wookie Maseret. See you also got caught by the fallout bandwagon. Bought a bunch of steam sale as well. Good man. You're digging it so far. My book. Loving it, bro. Uh, this is one of the fallouts I never finished. So it was I found it was like I wasn't planning on playing it. And then legit on the weekend I watched the show, bro. And I was like, no ways. Uh, it's bringing back all that fallout nostalgia and I was uh, I started getting obsessed, bro. I went Fallout before. But yeah, loving it. I'm like absorbing everything. I'm reading all the computers, like all the information I find. I'm, I'm taking it seriously. Are you going to, which, what did you buy? Did you buy Fallout 4, right? I, I might do that as well. I see the entire Fallout 4 and all the DLCs are available on Steam. The only reason it's stopping me from buying it is because I've got it all on the Xbox Game Pass, which is a, just a subscription that goes off my account every month, which I might even stop because I haven't played an Xbox Game Pass game in months, bro. Months and months, but I pay for the subscription. I just like having that there, that at any point I can just open up and I've got a library of hundreds of games at my fingertips. And there's a lot of good games. Unlocking the system requires an Assaultron recall keycard. Keycards are one-time use and cannot be returned. Once unlocked, the system remains accessible for a limited period of time during which preparations may be made. It is the user's responsibility to initiate a Saltron recall during this time. Use keycard. So I access denied. Required a Saltron keycard. Ah. Uh, I don't have a keycard for this machine then. Okay, fair enough. Tinned coffee. I'll take what I can get. I'm going to close Spotify and reopen it. Something is drastically wrong with this app. Um, anyway, so I was just adding more songs to my list. Lagalex, thank you for the lurk, buddy. Muchas gracias. I love how quickly this Mac charges up. Macs are amazing, though. I wish Mac made a computer that you could game on. I'd, oh, and stream on. I feel like I would definitely have that. I could buy that thing. Yo, the song is... I can listen to the song over and over again. Why is it so good? I'm suffering from rad worms. There's nothing rad about worms, bro. What are you talking about? Okay, we gotta get... Ugh. Disease cure. I guess.
Okay, let's get rid of those rad worms. And let's head towards Uncanny. OMC, Jonesy is my people. Jonesy is, uh, yeah, Jonesy is. Jonesy is an awesome human being, bro. He is really cool to hang out with. I'm glad we get to hang out together here and stream. You can't hear it. Can you not hear the music? Can you guys hear the music? No, you and everybody. Listen to this song. From Shine to Douglas. I'm chilling in a lighthouse. Are you in uh, are you in my my survey, Aura? I could hear it before but not now. Can you you not hear the music now? I'll put it up even. There's Lord Vega. That's killing fields. Where's the lighthouse? This map is so big, I've lost. Where's Lord Vega going? Stella, can you hear the music? It's playing. Yes, no, okay, nice. Is it, is it good though? The level's good, so I can leave it here. So this is uh, Coulter Wall. This is such a good singer, bro. How nice is his voice? And it's so weird when you see the guy doesn't look like he sounds like an old man but he's like in his 20s or something so young Let me say, Pless, we are yet to hear you. But I want some music in the background for you. The music is soft, but why you want it louder? No, that's fine. It's, it just needs to be in the background. You must just be able to hear it. That's the that's the the gold standard, I believe. But I could be wrong. Okay, turn stream to 20%. Now all sounds good. Okay. So 20, was that turning it up? Then. Music can go up 5%. I'll put it up a smidgen. I think peeps with normal headsets won't hear the music. Yeah, it's a lot better. It's not loud, just lacquer. Pry, pray, tell, please tell me what a normal headset is. Bro, mole rats. Yo, this guy. 
Sheesh. Not a logic astro. I don't know. Like, are you thinking of those like shitty 50 rand headsets? You know the worst headsets ever? hate those headsets that are just like two little cushions you know that you put it and then you put against ears and then they're like they're kind of like articulate they can move on their um gyro and then it's like thin at the top you like the first xbox 360 ones it had a left earpiece like that god there's nothing worse bro it sits like on your ear so softly i've had oryx on about 15 percent volume and i can hear the music there are nut cases with volume at 70% volume and Windows plus proud volume 100 out there. How are the levels for you, Stucker? Is, is this a good volume? Can you hear the music, hear the game, and then hear my voice? The classic 80s portable cassette player. Yes, those ones. Those are the worst, bro. Exactly that. Yeah, me too. And then you had those disc scratch. That's a good volume. That juicy pickle. How cool is this song, bro? Look, it's badass, eh? Welcome as a new member of the Uncanny Caverns family. Part of your job will be to give multiple guided tours a day. Our motto is to give tour guests an uncanny experience. What does this mean to you? Number one, Night Kid is real. Seriously. You have to truly believe this to sell it to others. 75% of our vacation traffic comes from nationwide, comes nationwide from those who have read about Night Kid in the tabloids. And our job is to sell that to them. He was born here and he remains to this day. We have plenty of literature for you to absorb on the subject before you start leading tours alone. Number two, upsell, upsell, upsell. We've gotten a lot of complaints that our wild cave and extreme adventures tours are underwhelming. But that means the guides aren't doing their job. People can go anywhere for a natural cavern. They come here for the spooky atmosphere and the night kid mythos. It's your job to give them that. Give that to them. Number three, we've gotten reports of some tour guides allowing some really inappropriate things to happen during the lights out portion of our tour. Don't let this be you. Use your common sense and best judgment when it comes to how you conduct yourself. Keep these in mind and you'll have no doubt and you will no doubt be an upstanding employee. Have an uncanny day. Fallout songs are amazing. They are absolutely amazing, bro. Oh, I love them. And also I've been adding some extras to that, like the one that's going to play next. I don't know why. Uh, I just don't know why my um, my Spotify keeps pausing, bro. Wookie, why does my Spotify just keep pausing randomly? It's never done this before. Ever. Ever, ever. Today it's happening. I'm just about to start my first playthrough. Should I start from level 0 or go with level 20 option at the start of the game? Shardazar, I'm going to, from my opinion, I started from level 20. But I've played the game from... 
to getting to level 20 more than once. It's a little bit of a grind to get to level 20, but I 100% think that you should start from level zero just to get the full experience. It's going to be a little tougher um, in the beginning, but it's a lot more fun and, and, and you need to learn some extra things. So just start your join, journey on level zero. It's totally up to you at the end of the day. Um, yeah, you'll get up quickly. <laughs> That's, that's my opinion. And also, Shadazar, you're on PC. Because if you're on PC, you went level 20. Yeah, that's fine. There's no wrong answer with it. There's no wrong answer. Uh, if you're on PC, just join on me. We'll be in the same server. You do, and we don't have, if you need help with anything, I can help you. Okay, let me unlock this PC. Soldier, zero likeliness. Got it. Monthly transaction revenue. Base administrator. Adults fourteen dollars. Children seven dollars. Small children free. Ages five and under. Okay, unlocked safety controls. This song always reminds me of that movie with Angelina Jolie and um, that other woman, that actress. What was her name? She was lovely and she, she's passed away. I can't. Sh shit, man. Ark's the sort of guy to read all the information on the computers. Snakey. I'm reading the prices of things here. I need to understand what shit costs. Hey, you look like Lucy also. Are we two Lucy's? Let's go. I started my Fallout 76 in Venture on level 1. But for some reason, the part where you get your backpack glitched out for me. So I had to finish the Tadpole Scout quest line to get the bag. So I was level 50 when I got my bag. What bag? Let's see your bag. Well, this is a nice backpack, Killing Fields, but it's not the Bolt 33 backpack. Initiate Hooson. Initiate Norland. Ad Victorium, Initiate. Now that everyone's here, let's go over the plan. Foundation reported super mutant attacks potentially originating from this location. We're here to determine if those claims are founded. And if so, eliminate the threat. We'll advance information. Immediately report anything you see out of place. Are we understood? Should we leave Initiate Houston at the entrance? Don't disrespect your fellow Initiates. What? Initiate Houston is a skilled medic with a tireless work ethic. When you're bleeding out, you'll be happy to have her along. You actually noticed that? Wow, I... Thank you, um, Knight. I won't tolerate any more insults. Stay focused. I wasn't insulting, I was like, for to be nice, because I know she's not a skilled soldier, and she was Ready scared. I'll ever be. So I just thought for her safety that she'd stay behind. Stop here. Don't waste my time. That could have been cleaner. It is what it is. Oh, there's a quantum in here. Let's go, baby. Sweet new Coca-Cola quantum.
Did you get that Killing Fields? Did you also get the new Kukolia Quantum in here, or was it just me that saw it? Some Only you. Oh. Seems like the super Did you see it in there? That out. I agree, maybe we had a false lead on the super mutants. Uh, it's too early to judge. We barely breached the entrance. Uh, there's definitely super mutants. Uh, I agree. Maybe it's false lead on. It's a possibility, but we need to explore a bit further before we can make that call. Agreed. Hey, look. Hey, Emma. What's we up? Take a How you doing? Photo. Thank you for the look, Emma. The Fort Atlas Appreciate the it. Lunkers, ready for action. <laughs> huh. Stay focused, Yusin. This is no time for jokes. Initiate Norland is right. Follow his lead. Right. Sorry. I just... never mind. Focus on the mission. We follow Night Shin. This Night Shin guy is such a shit. I really don't like his attitude at all and he's got a mur... Mach. No, I know, he chesuch. He does have a murmi chesuch. Uh, I also am not like the greatest the fan of him, but he also he's loyal, and that's got to count for something, darkest. His loyalty. As expected. I like that about him. Let's regroup here. And I sided with him over the, you know, paladin. I thought the Paladin was way out of line. Oh, I went down. Shit. Oh god, sorry man, she logged on your YouTube. Wait, what? He's loyal to the brother Brotherhood. You're just a minion under him. But he could be nice. He could be nicer. He could be nicer. Agreed. But the man's all about business. He's the Brotherhood of Steel uh, with the rank. He has to show a little bit of, uh, you know, grit. Man, I get so laggy in this game, even using optimal setting. Does anyone have, uh, they have the same problem? Because I'm watching your stream, it's so smooth. Crazy. What PC do you have uh, Verbal for? Let's start with what graphics card do you have, bro? This appears to be a dead end. There's some gore here. I'd say the mutants have left their mark. Initiate, what's your read on this location? Most floaters we fought are mutant too. They're often found with super mutants. This place is crawling with super mutants, we just haven't found them yet. So it's likely there are still super mutants nearby. Good call, Initiate. Let's do a thorough sweep of the room. There may still be a way forward. Roger, I'll take the far side. Excellent initiative, Norland. The remaining two of you, stick together and cover this area. Be sure not to miss anything. Effective reconnaissance can mean the difference between life and death. Verbal, right. I seem to have an issue when best. I use my mouse and keyboard. I mean, I'm getting a solid 100 thorough. frames right. on the game, yet sometimes it feels like it's touching, but when you use a controller, I don't see an issue. Bro, I was gonna say that Legion 5 laptop using an RTX 3070, basically most games, good, so... Yeah, okay, yeah, they, they, we know that's not a problem then. I was gonna say the next thing. I feel like, like I said this earlier, the game just works better on a controller for some reason. Like, it just feels janky. I, was, I said it earlier on, on mouse really and keyboard. In here. But I don't know if that's the problem. I hope that doesn't happen to us. Huh. Someone left their shovel behind. Could prove useful. Look, there's a break in the wall over there. There's a narrow opening in the rock. Someone without armor could squeeze through here. Not me.
Some collapsed rocks blocked the way. They look like they could be dislodged with the right tools. A killing field straight into it. <laughs> oh, but we did that at the same time. Yeah. Here we go. I think that's better. I'm gonna look for So I said there was a shovel here somewhere. Anything to report. If we clear the rocks up ahead, we should be able to proceed along the path. There's a crevice in the wall over there. Someone with power armor could without a power armor could squeeze through. I see. In that case, I might send the others to scout ahead. I suspect there's still more to see here. Did you find anything else? We should take a cautious approach to that. One wrong move, and we could all get trapped inside. That was everything I found. Understood. Everyone, we need to cover as much ground as possible, and the threat level so far has been minimal. Initiates Norland and Houston. See if you can squeeze through that crevice and report what's on the other side. Initiate Norland, you take point. I'm on keyboard and mouse. Yeah, it shouldn't be like terrible on keyboard and mouse, but I just noticed with me it was a little bit smoother with controller. For me, I'd recommend any PlayStation or Xbox, just as long as you get original PS or Xbox. You're getting a really good controller for a good price. Got it. I mean, yes, sir. You'll stay with me and find a way to clear the cave in. But yeah, um, hope you're having fun. Did you having lots of fun, Bob Death Angel? Navigating the game is done better with directional keys over using the mouse, in my opinion. Yeah, Reeves, we got tickets for sale. All right, I'll go and move those rocks. Any ideas on how to clear the way? I'd look around for some kind of tool, preferably not the destructive kind. If we're lucky. The rocks may even be loose enough to dig out by hand. Ticket. Yes, Reeves, you got a ticket. You can buy two if you have the cash. Just letting you know. Don't do anything reckless. I need all of us to get out of here in one piece. And it's got two tickets. Before you is the entrance to the Night Kid room, where the mysterious half man, Ooh. half bat was first discovered. Half man, half bat. Oh, there's a cooking station. My boss has given us the afternoon off. I have a meeting at 2, so going to head home now. Dude, Kelly, that's I'm so happy for you, bro. The rocks come loose, but the other surrounding it holds fast. It would seem that luck doesn't favor you today. Try as you might, the wall of rocks cannot be bested. Each stone is replaced by another. Soon your hands are bleeding. You could paint a cave mural with all the blood. Maybe you should stop and look around for a tool. Avenge Bus. Avenge Bus 65. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in, follower. Kelly drive safe, man. That is awesome, dude. You deserve it, man. Now oh, you need to go to gym today because you didn't go yesterday. We need to get a two. 
Yes, the shovel. Before you leave the royalty room, we'd like you to experience what's PDP controller. Some say if you're quiet enough at the right time of day, you can hear night kids scurry around the dark recesses of the cave ceiling. Now, everybody in the tour group, take a brief moment of silence, if you dare. When you're done, head down the stairs to continue the tour. Please watch it's your It's a similar controller to I have, what I have, Snowball. Bro, but these PDP controllers are cheaper than the Xbox ones and looks exactly the same. Uh, you save my... Uh, uh, surely. Uh, I've never seen these before. Thursday... Oh, CrossFit already booked and I can't do early class. So I have the evenings. Oh, all right. Cool, cool, cool. Roy Retro, you got yourself a ticket. Leechy, what's up, bro? What's up, Roy? Welcome in, guys. Uh, Dead Rocks might be the meds talking, but you have the most luck... Luscious beard apart from Sansa. I'll take what I can get, Last Phoenix. It, I think it's the meds talking. Bro, these controllers are so cool, and they. I just don't like the asymmetric design, although I've got one like that. I prefer the PS ones. Yeah, me too, Snowball. I was about to say, Lurky, thank you, Lychee. Always, bro. Loving the music, man. L Glad you're loving the music, bro. I got two tickets. You do indeed, Roy. We're spinning the wheel tomorrow, sir. Meant luxurious. But luscious works too. Oh, I, just, well, I wasn't sure if you're going for luxurious there. Or lashes, um, but both work. I'll take it, bro. Thank you, man. Always. Um, do you get the PDP and PlayStation configuration? No, it doesn't look like they sell them on take a lot. Only Xbox ones. Strength. Dig through the wall with your shovel. Look at us go. Hold your position. Pros. It sounds like there's activity inside. Check out these super mutants, bro. This oaks are crazy. The victory for the scrolls. Those mutants. They came flooding out. This could be bad. Ew. These are like some culty type of uh, mutants. Oh, what was that? Traps. Ow.
Hey, mental QB, have you done events yet? No, not yet. I haven't done any events. I've literally been just playing the storyline. I haven't even been building, eh? I'm doing very, like, linear approach to the game. Like, I might just jump into building at some point and just, like, go for a day where I just build. Uh, but I'm, I'm like, kind of try, trying to stay focused on the story because I'm really enjoying where the story is taking me. All the little side quests, everything, bro. All in. Oh, oh, there was a trap. Sheesh. There's a hidden cave there. He remained in captivity for a decade before he was freed under mysterious circumstances. I swear the 8 bit do controllers, they even sell spare parts like buttons and analog sticks so you can repair. Yes, that controller. I want one of those ones actually. Snow, search on macro for dual shock for wireless controller for PlayStation 4 generic blue, uh, berry blue. It's 450 rand. The only gripe I have with the PS4 controller is just... Sorry, Killing Fields. That I think we got to go this way. I'm just like going back and forth. Speak to... Okay, we speak to Night Chin first. Sorry. Follower. I don't know. Kfater. I don't, how do I pronounce your name? Kfater, is that right? Welcome in, Kfater. How are you doing? Follower. Those mutants must have gotten trapped inside sometime after the attacks. If this passage wraps around, initiates Norland and Houston could be in trouble. I trust your leadership, Knight. We could have known this would happen. Follower. Let's go find the other initiates. Why do you care so much? There are plenty of other initiates. Let's go find the I made a premature assumption that the area was safe. We have to do everything we can to make sure the initiates don't pay for it. Hold on. I'm receiving a message. We have to find them. Move out! Oh shit. I didn't No. He was such a good soldier. This this shouldn't have happened. Norland was confident. I want a nice wireless controller for PC. Yeah, orders, any of the PlayStation Xbox ones. Or the one that Stucker's is talking about. I like those ones. Those eight bit do controllers, they're really cool. You must get a controller for PC. I always say, if you're a PC gamer, you should always a controller should be part of your arsenal. Just like you have a mouse and keyboard, you should also have a controller for your PC. There's so many games that just work better on a controller. Are you okay? Norlin was a soldier. These things happen. I swore to myself I'd never let this happen again. After you Classic put your faith in Arix. me at the transmitter, Shameless I wouldn't plug. be able to fault you for doubting me now. But I'm not important right now. We have to find Initiate Houston. That is so cool, man. Shop. They even got like old school looking keyboards. But I think like we don't have a Reese. We have to buy off like take lot here. And they're also well priced, these 8 bit 2 controllers. They're not very expensive. What do you mean you wouldn't let this happen again? Back when we fought those raiders on the expedition route. When we lost Knight Connors and so many others. My decisions played a part in what happened that day. I swore to never make a mistake like that again. 
to never lose lives like that again. Well, I'm off to my nest, Mr. Nubel. Thank you for hanging with us today. I hope you have a good evening. Like ER, right, Dedorix? That Nintendo looking keyboard is what I need. <laughs> Are you teasing me, Zuma? If he was such a good soldier, he wouldn't be chilling on the floor with holes in him and dead. Jesus, darkest. The Nintendo looking keyboard, yeah. As right i just need a new keyboard my keyboard sucks you know what keyboards look like that jonesy look at dragon dragon's got some keyboards that look really cool old school vibe very nice and they they're also pretty cheap all right let's keep moving Initiate houston can't be far search for a trail i'm worried about houston i told him to uh, be careful about houston she's not a fighting soldier she's a medic she should have stayed by the door i was right you're an idiot bro Oh yeah, we have to head, head through the trail. Cool, cool, cool. The old master, what did he say? This? We'll check them out. Of course, I'm teasing you, Derox. I want you to be able to get your ER character ready for the DLC dropping on the 20th of June, just over two months away now. Two months, it's not far away, bro. I'll play it again. For sure. Initiate Houston. There she is. Wait, She's on a landmine. I, I, I triggered some kind of trap. If, if I move, then just, just get away from here. I, I can't let anyone else. My armor can take the blast. Cover your head. What? No, don't. What's he doing? <laughs> Fuck. I Uh, I uh, won't run away anymore. I won't. It's okay if there are more mutants. The mutants are coming. Oh no. And our man is down. He's gonna be okay. He'll be fine. No, I'm trying to heal up. Oh, that hurts. Brand new. Medic. Damn it. She picked me up. On, She's fighting the uh, cough up, give up. I don't think she's going to raise. Yeah, just give up. I like my keyboard because it gives me the backslash button next to Z between the Z and left shift. Yeah, mine's on the other side. Leave her to die? No. No, no. 
We don't need her to die. I want her to live. She's taking a lot of strain, yeah? Bring it. Uh, is Fallout getting a new DLC? Fallout 4. I don't know. There was... Uh, I saw a video or I heard... I saw a video with Todd Howard saying some like updated content will be coming to Fallout 4. There's already some... Like you get a backpack in 76 and 76 has always got new content coming up because you know it's a continuous game. But yeah. I'm not 100% sure what's coming to Fallout 4. If anyone knows, I feel like Zumo would know the answer to this question. Zumo? What is the deal with the content coming to Fallout 4? Fallout 4 is getting free DLC on the 25th of April. Thanks to the series release. Let's go. You see, I told you Zumo would know. Can't wait for the Elden Ring DLC. Uh, Snakey? Do you play Elden Ring? Oh, you're just excited because Zuma's excited. Now you're excited also. I just picked up spoiled meat. Shame. Is it Brahmin? Why oh, they cooked this guy? Dude, this guy was a vault dweller. Okay, you're suffering from freaking bone webs. Don't worry about me. The power armor isn't just for show. You're still badly injured. Without the power armor, you'd be dead. I I'm, I'm. It is a so texture sorry. remaster, Forza, etc. They're for doing a uh, Skyrim SE Put and AE thing. Creation Club patch. Right. Uh, if you want You're to right. mod Fallout 4, now is the bias. time as it hits April 25th, 26. Well, is it a texture pack? So it's going to make the game look a lot better. It's a great game. Well, I believe you, Snakey, that it's a great game for sure. I suspect we haven't killed our last mutants yet. They're bringing the Enclave into Fallout 4 with free DLC f for it on the 25th. Apparently it's going to be at least 2 to 3 hours additional content to Fallout 4. I want to play Fallout 4 now, after this. Okay, wait. While Initiate Houston is busy, you'll need to search the area. Find out if this is truly the source of the attacks. I suspect... We haven't killed our last mutants yet. I'll search the area. Be thorough. All this gore can easily cover up something important. You can get pro. Can I show you guys something quickly? After, let me finish this mission. I'll go make a coffee and then I'll show you what I saw on the internet. Burlock meat. Just like a dude that did all these textures and stuff for Fallout 4. It's really cool. Bro, I saw like Sky. Someone modded Skyrim. Um. I know that a lot of people mod it, and it's like famous to be being modded, but someone in the community modded their Skyrim, bro. It looks insane. It looks like the game was made in 2025, never mind this year. Zuma is so excited about a game release. He is, he always gets excited. I love it. 
will be like a completely uh, complete different experience well with the texture pack I mean that I look forward to that I like when games get a graphical upgrade that's why I like looking at videos with people that have got mods on their games love seeing that shit seeing what they can do with it Oh yeah, we go pit boy. What have you found? I found this pit boy. A pit boy. Maybe the mutants ate a vault dweller. Uh, I actually sorry. do some basic that mod patching if you do. I'm glad it wasn't you. Hmm, 100%. I want to well do that acceptable. That's why I want to show you this boy. video of how this guy changed his Fallout 4. Wow, it the looks vault. so different. Go ahead and take the Pip Boy tour. Initiate Houston will patch me up here before we return to Fort Atlas. And we'll give Initiate Norland a proper burial. All right, sure. Good work. Fort Atlas. We fought in honorable service to the Brotherhood. We did. All of us. Couldn't agree Ad more. Victorium. Ad Victorium. Let's go, Lucy. Other Lucy, my twin sister. Mason, thank you for the water redemption. I'm going to go grab a coffee. And we'll play some of that Kukuru game. Give uh, Stucco a chance to redeem himself. old world has so much to teach us Why didn't snakey you, you like fallout music listen to this song bro this is such a tune eh this is called to wall kind of fits in with the whole fallout vibe Hope the game doesn't DC me. I'll be back killing fields. I'm just going to quickly grab a cup of coffee. Wait, wait, Red, we coming. Aren't you playing this game, Red? Come join, bro. God, you're so difficult, Red. Now you can do it! Exclamation mark! Kukuru. Viper Death Angel.
Ojitsu. Hey, what's up, bro? <clears throat> Good day, hoodies. Puff, how you doing, bud? Yo, Viper Death Angel got three kills. When are we going to court? Oh yeah, I forgot about courty case. I still need to send... Uh, I keep forgetting to send Tato the list of crimes. But those crimes aren't even the greatest. We need to get some new ones, Stella. When you've got a gap, and if you're feeling up to it, Stella, make some crimes for us. You know what I did? You know those crimes? I asked ChatGPT to make Twitch like affiliated crimes you snaky with the 95 stream streak you can't see but i'm blushing you're a crime i know you're a crime too the, all that time you didn't say anything snaky you're always watching over me like my angel Me too? Yeah. Yeah, you too, Peek. Fucking clown. <laughs> yeah, always popped in. But yeah, I know you were there. I appreciate it so much, Snakes. It meant a lot to me, dude. Always there, always naked. Let's go. Who's holding the record on this round? Lack of Lex was six. Let's go, Lex. Could you make it to the top three, sir? I think you're already on the top three. You just need to get first place. You second. Let me get into this fight. Let me show you how it's done. Your 10 kills. You're going to push Stucker into third place. Oh no, bot, you died to a freaking bot. I'm taking the bots out. Oh no, sorry Lex. Oh no, Judith the bot is going to kill us all. Oh, thank goodness. Yeah, the whole thing is rough. It doesn't let you heal every time, right? Vince, you can beat a bot, bro. Let's go, Benjamin Franklin. Let's go, Dead Oryx. Hey, I catch you. Let's go, Peaky. Oh, get out of here, Peaky. You can yell every time, but typing the command in back. Oh, shit, can you? No.
You must have the command ready to go, bro. Have heals set in your... And then... Terox only mods the VIPs can spam and it Oh my gosh. One day statue, I think so too. But no gold deals off the table, Snakey. We've already sold all of our things. For gold deer. But let me see what I can do. So not even five hundred dollars? No wait, 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 wait. Not five. Hmm. Verbal 4, I'm going to post this in the um, Discord in the section for uh, Fallout, just in case someone else needs to use it. Because um, people might miss it here. But thanks for that, bro. Hey, Daddy Lucy, let's go. Who did this? Yeah, posted. It's really good thing. Now it's good. Is it good, bro? Okay. If anyone else have any problems with their fallout, post that. Use that little bit of code. Ooh, I don't know where you do that. Follow the instructions that Verbal Force set up. Derok Snakes can pay the remainder of his wedding venue and take my gold. Yeah, give me five hundred dollars. Does it come with an invite? Yeah, it does. You have to, Stella. It's fine. We level up together, bro. Do you want bots that collects to keep this going? That's the nice thing, Stella. You can invite all the people from overseas to your wedding. He'll lick. Sixteen kills. The man's going for the top spot. 17. You see, you spam a lot. Hey, Lekalex found out the secret, bro. No, I'll be there, Stella. I'm go I already told Furious that he's going with me. Have you got bridesmaids, Stella? I oh, will. I've got a. I've booked an appointment for my visa. Lex is killing everyone. Please, guys, you got to take him out. 
Let's send some bots in. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's booked. I'm going next month. Single bridesmaids or are you asking for a dress? <laughs> Single bridesmaids. And maybe I'm also asking about the dress. No, I didn't book it. Um, crap booked it for me. But Corey didn't stand a chance. I want to get uh, one of these Herdy PA systems. Mommy crap, bro. Pro Snakey, you can get an assistant from India and you can pay them like, they'll be like, do everything for you. Be, I've, one, there was a stage in my life where I wanted to get that, like one of those PAs. I've thought about it, but then I met Peaky. There's a lady at the wedding I wanted to introduce to you about a year back, but you missed the meetup. She is like you, but female, and is a real job. She's got a real job, so she can support me. What? She looks like me. Wait, what? She doesn't look like me, does she? Like me in what sense, bro? Okay, good. She has big boobs and a pretty smile. I'm listening. <laughs> and plays games. Ozzy Ant. What's up, Ozzy Ant? How are you doing, bro? Welcome. Yo, Thad. How are you, brother? Dad, you've been so quiet lately. Not a lot. I'm doing good. How are you? Yeah, very well, thank you, bro. Playing Fallout 76, just vibing over here. Having a good day, though. Thank you for asking. Is she super old and rambles on about fake war stories and jobs abroad? Yeah, she worked in the UK and is Oryx's age. Oh, uh, Oryx's age? Oh, uh, she's old, bro. Oh, she has an Italian passport. Okay, she redeemed herself again. <laughs> Must be ancient then. Arcs after that maroon passport. Yeah, I wouldn't mind. Go live in Italy. Mentioning Oryx's age should be a timeout. <laughs> Yo. But I agree. I'm 29. Yeah. I'm still a spring chicken. We know you're a cuckold like me. Yeah, 29, bro. It's 
It's like a hundred in Hollywood years. Oaks looks young for 29. Thank you, Savage. Where's your VIP badge? Let me sort that out for you, sir. <laughs> With that kind of attitude, Raging Savage. My dog just stole chicken breast, bastard, and ran away with a smile. Oh, man. He reaches everything. And now you can't do anything about it but pet him and be like, well done. Oaks looks good for a 27-year-old. Oh, Peaky, stop it. Silly geese. I'm trying to save for it. Lol, let's go. Did you buy tickets for the wheel? Savage. <laughs> but I keep buying tickets. Yeah, no, tickets are better, bro. Cash money. Viper Dench, Death Angel is... Uh... Rx is a face for radio. Thank you. No, I know. You jinxed me, dead. I'm sorry, Viper Death Angel. You're doing so well, bro. Okay. You can enter now. I'm going to stop respawning. No one can respawn now. Okay, try again, Peaky. Okay, if you want to respawn now and play the last round, you can jump in. I'm going to cancel respawns in 10 seconds. So make sure you jump in, exclamation mark kukuru, last chances now. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And respawns have been disabled. You can't re-enter the match. Too late, Lord Walper. You just lost, lost, missed out. Oh no, Viper Death Angel. Do you want me to bring in people for you to fight then? Okay, let me bring people in for your fights. If anyone wants to fight Viper Death Angel, you can. The first person to kill him, then we'll end the game. So he'll be the last one. So as soon as someone kills Viper Death Angel, then we can, uh, we'll end. So this is the last game. Kill Viper Death Angel, and we end it. So first person to kill him. Then I'm ending. How do you play? Exclamation mark kukuru. I want to destroy him so I can get back to my fallout.
All right. Well done. That's the end of it. Thank you. We'll play again a little bit later. Kelly Serenity is still in the lead with 31. Lacalex is just behind with 30. Then Viper Death Angel is 21. Chase, how are you doing, bro? Welcome in. GG. That's a skill, right? GG's, everyone. Verbal 4, will I be able to join your Fallout? Just need to add you and add me. Well, it was a long time ago I played it, Fallout 4. But it's 76 different. Yeah, you can add me. Um, just add my name, Dead Oryx, no spaces. Let me know when you've added uh, Verbal 4. How's everyone on this? And the mods? Everyone's doing fantastic, bro. Mods, you guys good? Mods are good. Free Chase. Chase. Justice for Chase. Justice for Chase. Dead Oryx, no space. <laughs> Just ice for Chase. Tighten that. I'm glad you're with us, Initiate. Hey, have you seen Marsha around? Girl with black hair and the spirit of youthful rebellion? Never mind that. Night Shin wants you to find the origin of his pit boy. Her little brother was asking about it too. <coughs> Knight's orders. I'll prioritize it, but we really should have someone out looking for Marsha. You know what? You're right here. If you don't have another assignment for Who's Shin, then I could really use your attention on this. I'm going to run a diagnostic on this pip boy. Talk to me as soon as you're available. I'm pretty worried. Cool, cool. What's the word from the wasteland? Are you available now to look for Marsha? She could be in trouble. She was supposed to make a trip to Foundation, but a group of initiates recently returned from there and nobody remembers seeing her. Is Marta? Says Caps. She was supposed to make a trip to Foundation, but a group of initiates recently returned from there and nobody remembers seeing her. What do you need me to do? Foundation? Could she be missing from the super mutant attack? I did consider that when I first heard of it. Not gonna lie, I don't think I want to be unbanned. Grey area better. is becoming my home. It's nice in the grey area, eh, Chase? I did consider that when I first heard of it, but I'd rather remain hopeful and investigate further. Who is uh, Marcia again? Marcia is the eldest of the two siblings that we encountered on our journey to Appalachia. There was an incident that resulted in the death of their mother. Paladin Romani decided that we should bring them along with us instead of leaving them alone. First, start by what talking to, me to younger do? brother Max. He might have an idea where she's gone. Yeah, I'm you learned to really love it. That something didn't happen to her or I appreciate you, Chase. If something did happen while she was in our care, let's not worry about that. Are you having yet. a good Thursday, Chase? The enclave is where it's at. So they say. Yes, thanks. For asking and you, I'm How doing very well. Thank up and you, take bro. on the wasteland. Having a good Thursday. Thank you also for asking. What? Scientist soldier. What's this? Find the kids in Fort Atlas. Wait, hold up. So I have to go back in here and look for these kids. Well, they're inside this building. Okay. I 
Oh, yes, one of them. Maximo. Are you here to help me find my sister? Uh, yes, I'm. When did you last see your sister? Well, the last time I saw Marsha was when she told me she was going to Foundation for some things. I think that something bad happened to her. It, it was just supposed to be a quick trip to Foundation, but she hasn't come back yet. I just know she would never leave me on purpose. Yeah, inside the building. I remember this mission. Did she talk? Thanks, Brew. Did she talk about anything before she left? Vic Adorium? No. Good but going. when she said goodbye, she was acting right really weird. She was like, you know I'll always love you, right? She never says stuff like that. It's usually, learn to behave, Max. Or, can you be quiet, Max? Her best friend, Luis Ramirez, might know something. He's an initiate, too. Ramirez. What was I doing? Oh, right. We're here to stay. As Houston, what a legend. I'm glad she's doing well. She ditched you, Max. Accept it. I want to go with Poor desolator. Max. I hope my next mission is soon. I'm tired of being stuck in Fort Atlas. Courage is our chance to learn from the mistakes of the past. We'll build something better for everyone. Hello. Doing great. Ramirez. I wanted to talk to you about Marcia Leon. What has Marcia done this time? Marcia is believed to be missing. This time, does she normally cause trouble? It's been really hard for her to adjust to living in Fort Atlas after losing her mother. She spends most of her time worrying about taking care of Max, but none of it worrying about herself. Missing. Uh, <laughs> no, she's uh, she's just running an errand to Foundation. Yeah, she'll be back any minute. An attack on Fort Atlas? Scribe Valdez thinks she should be back already. I'm sure she's fine. She probably just took the 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 long scenic route or something. If you don't tell me what's going on, I'll report you to Shin. Fine, I. I think Marsha will forgive me eventually. She knows how I feel about getting scolded by Night Shin. I can't be sure, but I think she may be with the Raider War Oh, party. God. Okay, I need to talk to the Raider War Party then. Why would she leave to join the Raiders? She told me once that she stayed as long as she could for Max's sake, but being here was like an I open wound I'd for her. Would she really abandon her brother? Abandon? No, of course not. We were talking, and I assured her that I would never let anything happen to Max. I, I, I guess I told her exactly what she needed to hear. Okay, I need to talk to the Raider War Party. Good luck. Then. And, and please bring her back. Okay, I'm gonna go to the Raiders. So in Fallout, uh, that juicy pickle. I don't know how good your Fallout uh, knowledge is with the law and everything, but Some sort of joke? so essentially, uh, what I'm picking up. Everyone went into the vaults after the bombs drop in 2070, whatever. In the the twenty seventies. Twenty. When did the bombs fall originally? Like 2076. Let's just say, for instance, sake. Then, everyone stayed inside the um, vaults 
and for 200 years 2077 okay so that's when the bomb bombs fall 2077 okay thank you thank you guys i knew it was somewhere around there so then everyone went into the vaults right and they stayed there for 200 years until reclamation day to be released out of the vaults but so is it so civilization kind of rebuilt itself after the bombs dropped and then there was a second war is that right a second bombs dropped so the people that sat in the vaults like missed the um kind of reclamation already of earth like does that make sense don't make sense dread varesta afternoon uh, dead lucy how you doing dready welcome in so they were so if the people in the vaults missed the rebuilding of america and then it got destroyed again with the second war depends on the vaults some were holding people for a couple of years as far as i know that's what i also picked up like each vault okay i also was that was my next question so each vault has a different uh time span to to for reclamation day yeah every vault and every vault has a different purpose i understand that too so um okay so no it's just because of the series some things in the series that have been said it seems like and also from the game it's like the war happened but civilization rebuilt itself and then another war happened is that true? There are two wars. Two times the bombs dropped. Reclamation Day only happened with uh, Vault 76. No, no, it's not just Vault 76 though, that juicy pickle. Because each vault is a Reclamation Day though, right? <laughs> to reclaim America. The Enclave was also doing weird stuff and the vaults with their experiments. <laughs> the story of Fallout is so complicated. That's why I'm like reading as much as I can because I want to try and understand everything because it's actually only 76 had so it was only 76 but but in vaults uh, in the series they talk about reclamation day indeed several vaults were just experiments yeah um right fallout is very complex and well thought out thoughts experiment based on the idea that silicone computing chip was never invented in fallout everyone looks like sci-fi world conceived in the midst of the 50s america interesting 76 was one of the few actual vaults yeah their reclamation days were staggered yes i get that but everyone had a reclamation day everyone had a day that they would reclaim america but they were staggered each one was different i i, I totally get that but were there two wars the war of 77 and then another war later on like there were two bomb dropped scenarios like civilization built itself up and then there was another um dropping of bombs and destroyed the earth again so if you stayed in the vault for 200 years you you, you missed the build-up of america and you came out when america was destroyed again so when you came out the vault you were thinking oh it's just the fallout from the initial war of 77 do you know what i'm saying does that make sense i believe the bombs dropped then it was free for all with the factions made the original bomb dropping of 77 because that's when the brotherhood came about you don't think they were, because in this <clears throat> i don't want to spoil anything i don't know if i should say this but in the series when Lucy speaks to her okay let me finish the series it's will it help sew a lot of stuff together let me not talk about it. I don't want to I don't want to spoil it for anyone who hasn't seen up to episode five I'm only on episode five I think there was only one great war with the bombs that dropped dead oaks there after for 200 years it's been chaos okay all right some stuff Okay, let me watch, let me finish the series and let me play this game and read all the things so that I don't miss anything. I'm just trying to build the picture up in my head as best I can. Like, I love the story. It's like you say, it's a well thought out thought experiment. It totally is. Do you know, I listened to us, this was a few, like in the New California Republic and Brotherhood had a few. Because the new California Republic was set up after the initial bomb drop of 77. Because it was California, then the bombs dropped, and then they set up the NCR. Derek's series being canon, uh, the last episode reveals a lot. I figured it would. Damn it, this flippin' story is so good. So I'll tell you something. I listened to a psychologist 
speaking on a podcast about fallout and she had some interesting facts about it she said yeah these are some notable battle wars in three and you see it was so long ago playing three and new vegas like i can't remember i can't stitch it all together so i'd like i feel like after 76 i would like to maybe play fallout 4 and then from there maybe other i keep playing or or stop i've fallen asleep many times with fallout law playing in the background surprise i can even remember dude i i also i've listened to lots of fallout law anyway this psychologist had an interesting take on fallout she said that the reason why everything looks like it's in the 50s is she said because um during like the cold war and when any country is under the threat of war they start working on technology over aesthetic so art takes seconds uh, uh, uh art slows down so people will create less music and less styles of art because more effort in the country is put put towards technology improvements to fight the war and which is an actual thing in uh, like psychology art yeah art takes a back seat so she said that's why everything because it's a dystopia right it's as if the cold war kind of carried on going and all we did is uh, like all the americans did is try and um, improve their technology so in technology improved where style stayed 50s so that's why everything looks heavily advanced technologically but the art and style remained do- stagnant in the 60s it's got because of the threat of war so she's like that's the dystopia of and the psychology behind well her opinion on the psychology behind fallout and it was quite interesting to listen to the psychologist talking about um how they believe the world remained in the 60s in this dystopia there's some notable uh, that's a good way of looking at it i also thought so i thought it was quite an interesting outlook at it um yeah the greatest uh, leaps in technology often occur during yeah for sure during war which essentially means that all effort is put towards technology and not towards creating new music and new art styles because you're trying to survive it's the same as like i even think about it in south africa like we do less like creation of art because we more concentrating on like political problems that we have in south africa takes a front seat you know in countries where they don't have less war threats and less like political problems art is you know takes priority and people make music and people draw and because there's more time for that you know anyway interesting uh interesting nonetheless right it's because they're harnessed and went full into nuclear power crazy peeps using nuclear uh, power in- yeah exactly so like what bravo said fallout is a very complex and well thought out thought experiment based on the idea that the silicone computer chip was never invented in in fallout everything looks like sci-fi world conceived in the midst of 50s america so cool so essentially the silicon chip wasn't invented we need to do something about them I'll go. It's my fault anyway. I know you're eager to help, but Sheena and Burke are the best there is. Dude, here's the chick. She's a freaking raider. What are you doing here? Oh, I'm gonna kick your ass, woman. Can't believe you left the brotherhood and left your brother. Okay, let's talk about this. You have some nerve showing up here. Yeah, whatever, Pierce. I'll let Marcia speak for herself. But I'm pretty sure she's not interested in going back. Hell no, I'm not. How about you don't waste everyone's time and just leave? What were uh, just what were you just talking about? How do you know I worked with Sheena? You're coming back to the Brotherhood with me now, Marsha. I'm glad you asked. Well, it just so happens we're planning a dinner party. The Brotherhood will be our distinguished guests. We'd like to deliver a special thank you for showing up in Appalachia without even needing an invitation and laying down the law on this filthy, treacherous wasting. Lose the attitude, maybe I can help. You're welcome, civilian. <clears throat> ah, so gracious, too. 
How did we ever get so lucky to have such benevolent overlords? If we stand by and do nothing, then they will be dead. Sheena and Burke went to AMS headquarters to retrieve something for us and haven't returned yet. Marsha. Damn it. Well, it wasn't my plan for you to know about this, but now that you do, I guess there's no way around it. Marsha is not going back with you. She's going after Sheena and Burke. She's been bossed around by the Brotherhood enough in her life. Why don't you do something for her for a change and help out? Me up for Marsha. Not to do your bidding. I'm not <coughs> going back to Fort Atlas. No one gave you the right to make my life decisions for me, and the Brotherhood doesn't own me. Alright, fine. We'll go to AMS and find Sheena and Burke. I feel better having one of us there instead of blindly trusting the Brotherhood. Make sure someone is focused on saving Sheena and Burke. One of us? You really mean it? I'll prove to you, Pierce, that I belong here. I'll undo what I've done. You being willing to put your life on the line for us is indication enough that you belong in this family. Bring my people back alive and in one piece. I'll meet you at AMS. I'm not coming back with you after, though. I have a new family now. All right. <clears throat> True, actually, they had circuit oh, boards, but they were outdated. Uh, Brotherhood is a cult. Uh, yeah. I, uh, uh, you know, right? Kind of does feel like a cult. Absolutely fascinating, Oryx. Don't you think so, Snakey? Isn't it just so fascinating? Pierce needs a clap? No, he does. And I'm gonna clap him. These are raiders, bro. Pfft, they're nothing to me. I'm Brotherhood of Steel. They don't know who they're messing with. Okay, where's this chick? She gonna meet me at my next location. Lord Vegas all the way up there. Okay, you're, I'm moving to a part of the map I haven't been to. Exciting. Let's go to the Kerwood Mines. We'll travel from there. <clears throat> you know, the thing is with the Brotherhood is like they're trying to establish order in the wasteland, you know? They, they're kind of an authority. Like, it's either the, you know, Brotherhood. You got the new California, but that's only in California. No, I think you guys can make anything boring. A real talent, but each your own. <laughs> Yo, let's go. I'll try my best, Snakes. Okay, when you start the main brother admission, Diddy, it explains more. Awesome. Red. Yo. What are all these ditches from? Bottles of South Africa. Bro, this, I mean, this is a <coughs> wasteland, but it looks pretty much like Johannesburg. They could shoot the Fallout movie. They could shoot the Fallout series in Joburg, bro. Tread carefully. Noted.
Oh. Wait, what? Attention, citizens. Watoga is under a state of emergency and evacuation order. Do not attempt to enter the city limits. Uh. And for God's sake, get out if you're still here. Unless you are military uh, this way. or roboticist. In that case, if you can do so safely, make your way to the mayor's office in the municipal center. Some scenes were shot in Namibia, so maybe Jobo got some love too. Oh, really? Were some of the scenes shot in Namibia? I thought most of the desert scenes would be shot in California. Like, it's perfect out there for... I mean, there's lots of space to shoot this movie in Cali, and there's a lot of, like, areas out there that look like a post-apocalyptic world. Oh, I'm busy cooking while Oaks are fighting. I'm just going to cook up a quick ribeye. No, exit. God damn it. I'm gonna die. <clears throat> God. There is day and night cycles. I mean, are there day and night cycles in this game? I feel like there are. Classic Oryx. Thank you, thank you so much. Why is this thing not showing its health? I'm coming, I'm coming. Okay, check the... Okay, so day is longer. Much longer. Oh okay, yeah, it's st still early morning. Yeah, I watched uh, Elle's interview with Jimmy Fallon. The scene after she leaves the vault, she walks by a boat in the desert, which is in Namibia. That is so cool, bro. Yeah, I haven't watched any interviews because I'm afraid of spoilers. The fact that Dead sh stood there getting slapped in the face with bullets was like, this is fine. What well, I understand there, that thing was just not having a damage count anymore. Anyway, it's gone now. I think it was bugged. But I, oh, sorry, I actually did kind of stand there. I'm gonna get shot. I'm down, but I'm up at the top. Yo, for real, says, how you doing, man? Chuchulian! What's up, bro? Welcome in, dude. Good to see you. How is the story so far? Do you enjoy it? Bro, Chuchulian, I love it, man. I'm really enjoying it, sir. How's your day going? I'm off to work. Have a great rest of day, OMC and chat. Stucker, thank you so much, bro. You too, buddy. Be safe out there. I'm okay, and you, bro? I'm doing very well. Thank you for asking, sir. Yeah, I'm gonna respawn. I'm a coming. The missile launcher pull Q combo is legit such a bish move. Uh, the blood eagles are little douche ca canoes. They are douche canoes, bro. Who takes a rocket launcher, man? That thing's so lame. Alright. But now we loot up. Spoils of war. Do the Blood Eagles get along with the Raiders? 
Or they at each other's throats. Ooh, we got a computer here. Lego. What? We need to get to that killing fields. There's a turret through there. I think I can uh, hack the turrets over here. Where wants my help? Turret control. Deactivate. Okay, I've deactivated the turrets. Let's go, bro. Done. Guess I'm Floyd's errand boy too, not far long. No, uh, not for long. Earl wants my help. Earl says it's time to get Floyd out of the way. No need for two leaders around here, apparently. I guess it means one less person when the loot goes around. I'm supposed to help him lure Floyd out into a field and let him die to something out there. Only problem is what happens it, when this goes wrong and I'm shot dead for my part in this little plan. Turns out Floyd has a similar idea to Earl. I gotta say, they make some fine points and are starting to give me ideas. Who needs either of them? I'm thinking there might be a boss in town. There might be a new boss in town, sorry. Now that the tide control is rooted to my console, this should be easy. Yeah, new bed, new chair, the spoils of war. I can taste it already. Okay, so there's some internal politics happening here at the Blood Eagles, it seems. Coming right there, right, Sikin? You hacking the mainframe? Did you manage to... What is this for? Take Floyd's best stuff again. Got back from the raid today, and what do you know? Comes time to divvy up the loot, and Floyd picks the choiciest bits again. I had two of my guns hauled back this big comfy chair. Wait, I had two of my gun hauled back this big comfy chair, and this guy just marches right up, acting all entitled. Says he wants something more comfortable to sit on while he's up in that tower all day. Imagine that complaining about sitting around. Imagine that complaining about sitting around. Meanwhile, I got back pain every night when I go to bed. Got my chair back. What a character. Today this guy takes this nice soft footstool to go with his chair. Well, that chair ain't his. It's mine. And it's sitting next to my bed right now. Right where it belongs. These guys fighting over a chair. Okay, okay, Floyd stole, Floyd stole my chair. Here we go again. Stay calm, Earl. Stay calm. Maintain composure. I'm gonna kill him. I like how these guys to uh, like write out their emotions. Meeting is done. I'm home and I get to watch this banana. This is the life. Welcome back, Kelly. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it so much, dude. I need to start doing my um, leveling up here because you have unopened perk pack. Would you like to open it? Yes. Plus. Derox Kelly Serenity sent you all a smile for the day. M, you know I love it, bro. Thank you so much. What do you call a boomerang that doesn't come back? A stick. Long. Okay, let me go to intelligence. Okay, no. Let's see what we got here. Pack rat. Scatter shot.
Oh, I can scrap some of these things. I can scrap the shotgunner because I've already got that up to... Nice. Flip, I feel like with the perk cards, you actually got to like spend a lot of time there with that. He's adorable, eh, Kelly? That baby is this freaking cute baby. Kitties are really nice. Kitties? Dead, when you're done with your yeah, perky nips, <laughs> keep it, it's yours. Can you please open your menu option there where it says socials, season challenges, and go to seasons. You'll probably have some golden tickets to spend in there. It's basically your battle pass. Now that you've typed, now that I've typed this out, you'll probably already know about it. No, I don't know about it. Ghouls have. Ghouls have pistols now? What? They do. They have pistols. Wait, how do I get there? Social ch oh, challenges up here. Oh, what is this? Do I have anything? How many tickets do I have? How do you see? Oh, I get more perk cards. Yes, I want to claim that. Oh, bottom right. Oh, shit. So I have a decent amount. So this is my battle pass. So I actually need to unlock all of this, eh? Must uh, unlock everything. Mr. Gamer Cubed. Thank you for the water redemption, bro. I appreciate that, man. How you doing, Gamer Cubed? Now, you don't have to unlock it all. It's based on the rank. Would you see on the top right? You currently rank 6 out of 100. Will I... Okay, will I have enough tickets playing the game to unlock everything? If I keep playing, like, I want to unlock everything, you know. You can't progress to the next page if you don't, though. So. Cyber Void, dude, thank you so much for the two gifted subs, bro. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Every time I get home and you have, uh, have you on my screen, my boyfriend says, Ah, oh, your Twitch boyfriend. <laughs> I'm the Twitch boyfriend. I'll take the title. Thank you so much, Sub Void. What a legend. Dude, and another gifted sub. That clip should be a redeem. Which clip? Enjoying the small joy of discovering a band. I don't know. Good times. As hey, always fun. Always fun. I also enjoy finding a good band. And you're like, yes. And you listen to them until it's all, it's all fucking finished. Like the other day, bro. I've 
I listened for the first time I found I mean I knew about them but I didn't like I didn't listen to all of their songs what's the name of the band I think he's so good bro his music is amazing I don't well you know Labyrinth you know Labyrinth what's the name of the band that you found like I don't know La I mean I heard of Labyrinth but I only like one or two of their songs and I've been listening to them they're really good don't worry I won the 900 pots at the pokies let's go cyber void freaking awesome bro I'm glad to hear that thank you so much though I appreciate it still means a lot alt f4 no thank you that clip oh shit that was horrible i never want to go through that ever again Yeah, let's get back to this. Tala, bird heavy tunes. I'm gonna just check him out. I'll listen to I'll favorite it and give him a listen, Jimmy. See if it's my cup of tea. Tala, cool. I'm following him. Thank you, Jimmy. I'll check it out. The clips makes my day the realization of what you had just been caught by a con bro the thing is is like people do it all the time like for freaking years people have been hitting me with that alt f4 and i've never ever fallen for it i just don't do it but that's well i don't know i got duped bro badly cyber void but how you doing buddy it's good to see you yeah let's use this computer Earl uh, brought back a nice chair today, just for me. Earl was uh, whining and wouldn't stop yammering on after the raid today, because I took his chair. That mangy mongrel has the nicest bed out of all of us. If I'm going to be sitting around all day while they go raiding, I'm going to be comfortable while, while doing it. Goodbye, Earl. Well, well, I get back to my post tonight after dinner and my chair is gone. I guess it's decided to get up and walk to Earl's room all on his all on its own i took back what was rightfully mine and now it's time to claim his life too it's time to put an end to this tomfoolery randy would handle leading the raids better anyway Yeah, been a while. Sorry being uh, busy with the course. You never have to apologize for not being here, bro. What course are you doing? And GG on doing a course, bro. It's always good to upskill yourself. Randy's terminal. Earl wants my help. Earl says it's time to get Floyd out of the way. No need for two leaders around here, apparently. I guess it means one less person when loot goes around. Alright. Oh, whoops. Turret control. But I think we've destroyed these turrets already. Oh no, oh, it's the same PC. Interesting. But what? Was I here? No, I wasn't. This is a different room. I don't know what I'm doing here, but... Meet Marcy at AMS headquarters. Marcy. Oh, whose head is this? Oh, 
I don't understand. Oh, yeah. Flip, we still got a way to go. This was just another base that was in our way. Flip, I thought we had to be here. I'm doing health and well-being. Uh, it's a social working course. Nice, bro. Are you enjoying it? Are you doing it for a specific reason? I played Dead so many bands, but he hates my music with the passion. No, I didn't. Not with the passion. You're making that up. I'm not the biggest fan of the music that you play. But some songs you have sent me, I have enjoyed, for sure. But I don't hate any music. Even the shit music, I don't hate it, I just don't listen to it. It's art. It comes with age, Ari. I like more chilled music. That's my vibe. I'm more of a relaxing music guy. But I do like the odd like. You know, I love house music too. I like rap. I, I prefer the old school rap. I listen to like the stuff from like the 2000s and the 90s if I listen to rap. Like Wu-Tang Clan. I want to be a social worker and help people. Dude, that is awesome, man. Selfless. What a legend. I used to be a music snob, but now I say whatever gets the hairs on my back of my neck to stand up bro yeah I, like i don't have a specific genre either if i like the song i like it there are some bands that'll oh there'll be one song that i enjoy everything else i don't like i want to be a simba chippy you gotta grow a little more kiki teammate completed a quest let's go i dig that we're in a party and we just get xp while all the people complete me, uh, quests grow a little more so we can rip you out of the ground dice and fry you man that ad was messed up <laughs> remember that ad bro pretty much but it's an honor it's an honor to be a super chippy bro Bro, that Welcome sheesh. to Wachoga, City of the Future. This area Hi there. Clear. Welcome to Proceeding the City of Wachoga. Search protocol. Greetings, visitor. You have arrived at the City of the Future. This is Wachoga, City of the Future. Toga. Dude! The car just exploded, man. I just watched one hour long sewing tutorial, tutorial and now I'm more confused than what, what I, what, when I was before I watched it. What do you want to sew, GT? If you want hair on the back of your neck to stand up, Jimmy, just imagine someone standing behind you right now breathing on your neck. Don't keep shame. Yeah, I'm respawning. It's for co what cosplay? Are you gonna sew me a onesie? Please, GT. A vault suit. City of Watoga.
But when she started doing math in inches, my brain bugged out. Yeah, inches. Me, I don't know. What's the handy? Bro, this... Sheesh. Oh yeah, I need help. Jeez, that shit's powerful, bro. Watch out, something's gonna explode. Dude. Bro, Soltrons are hectic, man. This is my first Soltron I've seen in this game. Oh my gosh. Wow, look at my health. Onesies seem simple enough, right? They are simple, dude. I want to cosplay this year at Comic Con because I haven't done, uh, haven't done fan con. What? I haven't done fan con, but yes, this I think I'm going to need to hire someone. No, do it. You got some time. Do it yourself. It'll be worth it. But yeah. Okay, you haven't since fan con. What? I don't even know what fan con is. I love cosplay though. Yeah, right. I know, but it's never a bad idea to offer some help. Yeah, right. You didn't stand a chance without me. You know anything about this Hellcat group? I've never heard of them before. They seem like some sort of mercenary creeps. I don't care what they call themselves. I won't let them get in our way. Now that we have a moment, can we talk? Look, I'd rather focus on finding Sheena and Burke. But if it'll get you moving, then say what you want to. What about the people you left behind at Fort Atlas, like I'll your brother? Miss them, but I need to start living my life for myself instead of others. I never asked to be taken to Fort Atlas. That decision was made for me. Being around the Brotherhood and watching them take charge is a constant reminder of how my mother died. I can't keep watching them do that to others. I never wanted to be the sole caregiver of Max either. He's happier staying at Fort Atlas with Night Shin. And I can't be a good guardian for him in a place that causes me so much pain. I'm finally taking charge of my own life and doing what I need to do for myself. Why join the Raiders? The Raiders are the only ones standing up to the Brotherhood and making their own choices about how to live. Listen, I'm not naive. I know that Raider life is dangerous and filled with stealing and murder. But Pierce and the others, they're different. They just want to live their lives free from the oppression of the Brotherhood. This chick's irritating me. Can, can we kill that. her yet? Okay, never mind. Okay. I've had to be the one who takes care of Max and me. And Hello, I come back help. meeting with a client. So, I had to dress like an actual human professional for the first time in forever. Any trace of Sheena or Burke. Did you I enjoy it, Smarty? Welcome back, bro. Me and didn't find anything. Let's try looking upstairs. Uh, 
Haven't had a good firefight in a while. Boom in the back of the head. I heard something. No, most people suck at the best of times. <laughs> yeah, multi the Northman dude, quietly lurking in the back there, collecting that 70s stream streak. Bro, I appreciate it so much, multi. Welcome in, dude. Thank you, thank you. Oh my God, I knew her voice is Kate uh, Makuchi. What? Yo, that auntie took that bullet like a champ. Hey, wonderful daddy and wonderful hoodies. How are you doing, Maltzy? Oh, wait, I just did worry it didn't work. There's one. Okay, security turrets are required to equip live fire automated weaponry. Connect to GWBBS. Hey, stranger. To Osman T from Mustafa R. It was great to run into you at the time you at the music festival. How long has it been since college? Nearly 10 years. I think Bobby was just born last time we had a chance to spend some time together. I know my family was looking forward to meeting up soon. I'm sure Bobby and Willie will grow as close as commies if we get them together over some board games. If we can get Willy to put the Gorn Gorknack comics down for a whole game. Anyway, she's obsessed lately. Anyway, let me know when your schedule's free and we can get something going. Please select the board to view community announcements. Riley, you forgot to come to the morning status meeting again. Too busy reading all those Gornak comics, huh? We need to talk about moving the dates on some of your tasks to a bit to meet with the new deadlines proposed in yesterday's meeting. Let's catch up in office later. Let me just help this fight. Sorry. <laughs> Doing all right, how about you? Yeah, doing fantastic, bro. Still enjoying this game so very much. She plays that girl that stands up, Rog in The Big Bang, or Ted's girlfriend in Scrubs. I... Let me just Google that name. I think I know who you're talking about. Dude, oh yes, this chick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I didn't think it was this chick you were talking about. So she's a voice. You recognized her voice? Whose voice is it? The voice of uh, the, this chick, right? This one, yeah, that's with me. Let's keep going. Bro, it does sound like her voice. Yeah, Denny reading a novel while World War is happening in the back. Yeah, Killing Fields has my back, bro. I'm reading, I'm reading a novel, yeah. Follow her. Brazuka. What's up, Brazuka? Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Howdy. Let's grab a buff out. Bro, I'd sit and read all these PCs. All the things in this game. I enjoy it. Dread Veresta, you got a ticket, bro. Into the Wheel of Anxiety. First try. Yep, 
Yeah, it's boss, yeah. It was scratching my brain. Well done on spotting that, bro. I wouldn't have I wouldn't have noticed. I don't know that well. I mean, I, I've watched too much movies with her in it. But I know I recognize her 100%. Yeah, I remember her from Big Bang. But I've seen her in obviously other things too. That necklace. I know that necklace. Did you Google it to make sure, eh, Modest? I'd recognize that necklace anywhere. That's Burke's necklace. I've never seen them without it. My mom had a similar necklace that she always wore. Never took that thing off. I still regret not being able to retrieve it. Her body. Necklace or no, her memory will live on in you. Yeah, I had to, but I recognized uh, the voice. Did you know... You're right. Max and I will keep her memory alive. Maybe I can tell you about her sometime. If you want. At least we know that Burke and Sheena made it to AMS. Let's keep looking. Um, do you know in Fallout New Vegas, what's the, ma the main bad guy's name with the, the suit jacket, the white suit jacket? Do you know he's voiced by um, Matthew Perry in Fallout New Vegas? And he was, you know, Matthew Perry got the job because he was just such a big fan of Fallout. He went on um, Ellen DeGeneres' show with a, a copy of Fallout 3 on Xbox 360, and he signed it, and he gave it to Ellen, and she's like, what? And he's like, this is the best game I've ever played. He's like, I'm signed this copy to m make people think that I was part of the development team, but I had no, I had no input in this game. It was just quite funny. And then after that, they actually saw that, Bethesda, they saw that um, obviously on Ellen DeGeneres and they called him in for a part in the actual game. How cool is that? You know you can play with keyboard and roller at the same time? Yeah, if you put, what, right hand with the controller? I've seen people do that. Not for me. I, I think I've even done four with like Apex. I tried it with Apex or something. Yeah, it was Apex I did it with. Matthew Perry did a good job with a Benny. What a legend. Was it Benny, eh? The main bad guy. No, you just press Alt plus spacebar and C. I'm scared to do anything like that now. Because I feel like it's going like, to close my computer or something. Yeah, I didn't know Matthew Perry was in that, Lichi. I was falling asleep to one of those videos, a hundred facts about Fallout. And that was one of the facts that I remembered. It's very cool. Like, I didn't realize how much Fallout do pop culture references. The thing is full of pop culture references. Are you talking to me? Chase, are you there? Uh, when do you think we'll do, do Power Wall again? Build the base. Um, Automated mining services. Well, you, you have to create a little. So, if you, I don't know if you're on controller, but Welcome. like you got to open up your pit boy, and then you see at the bottom of my screen on the left, it says a move camp. Thank you, for visiting. you need to place down a camp thing there, and then from there you access oh, okay, your camp. Yeah. Why Chase not in Twitch? You have to ask Snowball that. That is none of my Automated business. Mining services. I still got to go back up. Find clues where raiders are. Visitors, oh. please see our Sorry, reception. Killing Fields. Bro, if I'm annoying you and while well, you're following me around, just you can leave at any point. You don't have to hang with me. Blood hunt. Are you doing bad? You got yourself a ticket, sir? Is Noble the leader of this channel? No, but if you want, you can unban him if you want, GT. It's totally up to you. He's not the leader, but he is the one that implemented the ban. So all I was saying is, if he put it on, he must lift it. 
Oh, hello. Alright. Should we send Snowball some coffee? I mean, if you really want to. I'm um, yeah, hello all. Hey! What's up, Mr. Green? Defense, right off the back. Safe controls. Disengage lock. And then... Play a holotape. This is Hank Madigan. Message any fire breathers running through here after me. Had to dodge more robots and turrets than I can count, but I found what we're looking for. Atomic mining services were barons of Ultrasite. Had a lab right here in this office. I think they might have found a way to help us out. Even if they didn't know it. Turns out, once all the fuel is spent, there's a hunk of material left behind. This depleted ultrasite doesn't play nice with the normal stuff. Turns corrosive. AMS is taking disposal. GG, thank you so much for the gifted sub. Scorched, walk around, chunks of ultrasite. What's a kick? Will yellow no on yuck? See if that makes those Next. assholes melt. I'm just, I'm just chilling here. I'm here for the games, that's all for it. How's your day going, Bora? Mr. Green, I see you there, buddy. And pizza? Well, you can. Rather send me the pizza, though. Send him the coffee, I'll take the pizza. He doesn't even drink coffee. Uh, Vegas is greeting Mr. Oryx in chat. How's stream going today? Vegas is going very well, thank you for asking. How's your day going, Vegas? It's good to see you. Welcome in. That was awkward. <laughs> Please re reassure all guests that use the pneumatic elevator system is completely safe. Yes, they may experience some slight discomfort and vertigo as the elevator runs through a particularly stubborn part of the tube, but insist that it all serves the purpose of getting them to their meeting that much faster. Michael. Michael from finance and another incident, I mean, hasn't he learned his lesson? It's like he's doing it on purpose. Oh, do you think that's a possibility? We should let him go before this becomes a true liability. I'll have HR draw up termination papers, better safe than sorry. Cool. Ticket. Lord Walper. Welcome in, bro. You got yourself a ticket. Two tickets, sir. I find I'm finding a lot of shotgun shells in this game and I'm carrying mainly a shotgun is that the reason why I'm finding shotgun shells I feel like it is if I'd have changed the pistol would I find more ammo for the weapon that I'm carrying Weblin hello herdies how you doing Weblin welcome in bro good to see you what are the tickets used for so once a month we do a thing called the wheel of anxiety Pegasus. Um it's just a it's a kind of a way for me to take everyone's channel points because you guys are saving up a lot of channel points i stream a, a long hours so it's a way for me to kind of recycle some channel points well not recycle to burn all your channel points so what i do is once a month uh, we'll have the the purchasing day which is the thursday uh today 
and everyone buys the ticket, 25,000 channel points. The ticket, anyone, you can buy two tickets. When you buy a ticket, your name goes into a wheel. And then on Friday, tomorrow, if you're here, you'll see what we do. We put all the names in one wheel, and then every hour we spin the wheel and remove names out of it. So if your name gets removed out of the wheel, you're done. But anyway, the wheel gets smaller and smaller, as you can imagine, as there's less and less people. The last person standing wins a $50, 1,000 Rand Steam card voucher. So just a little way that we can... I can do something for you guys, for your, all your lurks and all the channel points that you save up here. There we go, Multi, you got yourself two tickets. Good afternoon, Dedarox Heard. How are you all today? Doing very well, thank you. How are you doing, bro? GJ Slamo, thank you for the look, bud. I hope you're well, dude. Rihanna, you got yourself two tickets, sir. Let's go, Rihanna. Thank you, bud. Fora is a Saudi prince in this channel. <laughs> Fora is a Saudi prince. <laughs> la 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 la. Fora a millionaire on Obux. That's the thing. So I want to do an Obux thing for mods only. Because you guys have got lots of Obux. Because you actually don't have anything to spend your channel points on, right? So I'm going to do an exclusive mod draw. And it's going to be like 50,000 channel points for a ticket. But only for mods. And then we'll spin the wheel and then the mods can win something. Just so I can get your channel points out of your wallet, man. you got way too many, man. Way too many. Wablin, you got another ticket, sir. To the next mayor since this mayor is an idiot. Bitches. Okay. Well, this is not going to tell me anything about the... The Raiders. How did you get up a level, bro? No, that's for the lobby. Killing Fields, how did you get up there? Wow. Stairs. Where am I missing these stairs? I'm not going blind, bro. Oh, here they are. Fork. Thank you, dude. The body of a dead raider appears to have died within the last couple of days. Who is this? That's one of the raiders that went with Sheena and Burke. I hope they're still okay. I'm so tired of all the blood and death. I'm tired of losing everyone that I care about. Shut First up. my mother's death, and now this. We don't know for sure yet if they're dead. Death is a reality of life in the wasteland. Aren't you just a ray of sunshine? Maybe if you cared about anyone else but yourself, you'd know what it's like to lose someone. Uh, this is offensive. On, we've got to hurry and find them. Flip. I want to kill this chick, bro. Yeah, chill, bro. This chick, dude, it's too much. Singularity, excuse me. I spent over 1 million Obux last year. That's where my Twitch recap said. I feel scammed. What did you spend the Obux on? Well, if you've got Obux, I want to try and get... I want to give you a reason to spend it. That's all. I'm not saying... I didn't say... What did I say, Sing?
I'm I'm saying you guys not spending because uh you, you don't have anything to spend on, right? Because you I give you guys free tickets for the wheel. So I just wanna make something for you to spend your channel points on and give you a prize or something. I don't know. Specimens in my clean lab again. New deadlines. Remote door. Just kidding, Derex. I have plenty to see. That's what I want. I want to get them from you. Otherwise, you're just stuck with mods. It's pointless having channel points. You're just stuck with millions of channel points. So I'm going to... I was thinking of buying a... A little gift for you guys. And then you can use your channel points to get it. Okay. I'll sit and read all this stuff, bro. We'll be here for take me a million years to finish this game. Have you ever played Sing? Have you ever played uh, Fallout? Sing mit die Swart. Is that a deal, OMC? OMC, if you would. Were the onesies I sent you? Would you wear the onesie I sent you? But an RX one. Does it have to be so, like, not short like that, hey? Not so skimpy, though. Or skimpy. more skimpy it needs to be skimpy plus oh man Snake, I'm waiting for you in Yu-Gi-Oh. Are you also a Yu-Gi-Oh game, eh, Stella? On your subathon day? Alright, well then no one's going to see the bottom half, so you can totally give it to me. Yes, I'll wear it. So when I win the draw, the drawing tomorrow, can I trade my voucher for Oryx merch? Yeah, of course you can. Winter's coming, we need our hoodies. Yeah, for sure. If you want to do that when you win just a reminder that i'd like to catch up with all of you about the new deadline stop by my office whenever the door is open thanks this all is a year before the bombs dropped uh, cool sorry i have to check all these things out I'm very nosy. Wait, what is... Oh, down here. Find clues where the raiders are. What does that note say? Hell, we're overrun. Gotta surrender. Only way to make it alive. Please find us. Sheena. Ooh, it's from Sheena, bro. A note from Sheena. I can't believe they surrendered. Hopefully that means they were taken alive. The raiders. They really are like a family. The kind that I want to be a part of. What about Max and Ramirez? Aren't they your family? Of course. They'll always be my family. I just couldn't stand staying in that place anymore with the Brotherhood. One day, they'll understand. Hell, maybe they'll even join me. We're almost to the top of AMS. We must be getting close. Let's hurry. They're not going to join you? Because I'm going to kill you after this is done. I don't take kindly to raiders. She even admitted, she's like, yeah, I know raiders are all about Shit. pillaging, Shit. ravaging, and robbing people. But it's a family. No. Hellcat eyes only. Don't go opening up these doors, this door, unless you have an appointment to see Sergeant Kit. Oh. Open door.
Dirks, I've not played Fallout Nope, but I did watch the first episode of the series last night. Hey, what did you think? Dude, I feel like you'd enjoy Fallout. Work life is the good life. Damn, they're gone. Found you. I'm hit. I'm hit. Help me. You can't kill us all. Yes, it is, Weblin. I can't believe you recognized the two. Modest also recognized it. You are spot on, dude. I sent you a prop one. That's, yes. Yeah, I'd love that. Bliff. Yeah, she's great. Is this the boat from Far Harbor? Fallout 4, Far, Far Harbor, bro. That's yeah, the boat. I never played the Far Harbor DLC. No, it's it's not your type of game, eh? Sing. You like Barbies and Apex. Robco continues to be excited about Watoga. We're footing the bulk of the cost, but are recommending to the board that we continue to approve expenses no matter how high they get. Having the Rob Cop, the Robco name attached to us in any way has proved invaluable when dealing with the politicians. We're also seeing the benefits of having a high profile effort that deflects attention away from our other operations. Hornwright Industrial continues to revolutionize its product lines and we're going to be purchasing their auto miners as fast as they can produce them. I know some members of the board are still upset that our joint efforts with Robco did not produce our own versions of an automated mining robot, but Hornwright's experience with drilling applications proved to be the key linchpin. They're just cheaper and faster to make than we were ever capable of doing ourselves. Penny Hornwright also the history with our company and I want to again emphasize that she did not steal anything during her internship here. On the contrary, on the contrary, all of our licensing agreements with Hornwright Industries were signed thanks to her instances. We're all benefiting from this partnership so I need everyone to embrace the Hornwright Auto Miner as our solution moving forward. Depleted ultrasite disposal continues to be a problem. Contact the non-depleted ultrasite. Contact with the non-depleted ultrasite causes a corrosive reaction that melts both materials. Care has been taken to contain all depleted ultrasite materials after use to avoid contamination.
All right. Find kits. It'll take me a million years. Really? Oh. You and that little girl. Ooh, the ones let's go. Check. That's the receding control. hairline I'm talking the about, bro. That's gonna be me in five years' time. In the way of us or our caps. This ends now. Um. Are you serious? What was that? Got more. Bring it on. Safe in bathroom. Yeah, where's this? Oh, we're gonna be fighting it. Oh my gosh, look at this, bro. Sheesh. Mm. I need a different gun for this. Shotgun's not working. That is insane, bro. Oh my god, dude. Are you kidding me? Thank you so very much. For the 10 gifted subs. That is massive, bro. Why are you spoiling me so much? Thank you, thank you, dude. Thanks for the gift. Do you, Clay, what's up, Clay? Welcome in, bro. Yeah, thank you so much for coming in and a saying thank you for the gift i appreciate that you're just so handsome bullets and then you hit me with the compliment bro stop i'm gonna give you a kiss if you don't stop dude really no bullet storm that is a lot of money flipping 10 gifted subs thank you so very much bro for supporting me and helping me grow my stream and being a part of this community absolute champ dude thank you for the 10 gifted really oh my god Okay, fine. All right, bro. You asked for it, man. I'm giving you a kiss. Dude, thank you again. Another 10 gifted. That is insane, bro. What the actual WTF? I don't even know what to say. I have no words. I know you work hard for your money. It's not easy to come by the money that you just dropped. So I appreciate every single cent, dude. Thank you so much, bro. Absolutely. I'm fucking lost for words, dude. 20 gifted subs is insane. Bullets want OMC to play PUBG. This is not bullets for days. Bullets storm. Awkward GT. Sis. Everyone wants PUBG players. Film the kiss? No, we're gonna do it in secrets. 
I don't want to make lol rings in it. I want to make everyone else jealous. Sheesh. Derek's felt bad for not being in the stream today, broski. Plus, signed a big contract today, so wanted to share the love. That is awesome, bro. Let's go. You never have to apologize for not being here, dude. I appreciate every minute that you spend with me, bro, and all the support. It means a lot. Thank you so much. Congrats on the big contract. Is it a job? Uh, dude, well done, dude. I want a pug. Uh, you gotta speak to you gotta speak to Zeus. Can't get an animal until you go to Italy, Stella. Otherwise, it's gonna cost you a fortune to send it with you. Oh my word! Why pug when you get a staffy? J Chill is on this. He wants a staffy so bad, J Chill. When are you gonna get your staffy, bro? Well, it's Storm, you gorgeous human being, you. Well, I work for my dad, so we signed a big contract for work. Like, we got commissioned to do an automated system for the mines. Bro, oh, are you getting into the mines? GG, bro. That is fantastic. Blades, babe, welcome in. And you got yourself a ticket. How are you doing? Hi, Daddy and Hoodies. You're home early today, babes. Welcome in, dude. Italy, old news. She's not going to Italy anymore. Hellcat Mercenary. Flip, Bulletstorm. That's awesome news, bro. Well done. And also... Bull of Storm, did you buy a ticket for the Wheel of Anxiety? Did you find out where Sheena and Burke are? Tickets are for sale. This letter implies that Sheena and Burke were captured. Who do you think B is? I have no idea. But that son of a bitch is going to pay for messing with Sheena and Burke. Captured? That's good. That means they were taken alive. We need to figure out where these holding cells are. See if you can find anything else that hints toward their location. Please hurry. Oh no, so I don't know if, you, if you've if you got enough uh, channel points. So there's a, a, a point redemption there, it's 25,000. If you have enough, I just thought. Just wanted to make sure you get your ticket into the wheel. We're spinning the wheel tomorrow for a change, but got some so much work. I'm going to be doing the lurky thing. Hope you're having an amazing day. Babes, I'm having a fantastic day. Thank you so much for asking. And also, I don't know if... Uh, I haven't seen Blades today. Tell him I say what's up and also remind him about the Wheel of Anxiety. We got tickets available. He hasn't bought his ticket yet. I'm not sure if he even wants a ticket, but I'm just not sure if he knows about it. Bro, I want VIP stuff you will. Come on, I'll do so. Thank you. Marmites or Bovrol? Uh. I don't know, actually, Kelly. I don't have a lot of mom out in Bovrol. And when I do, I kind of can't really tell the difference between the two. I'm just like, oh, well, if I have them side by side, I'll be able to tell the difference. But when I have them, I just, they're both like black like tar and they've got a very strong taste. That's all my brain sees or says when I eat Bovrol and Marmite. It, I can't tell the difference because I don't have them close to each other, you know? Like, I'll have Bovrol now. And then in three years' time, I'll have Marmite. I just don't have a lot of it. Not that I don't like it. I actually really enjoy it. It's just... Marmite, yes. Marmite is vegetable, and then Bovril is a beef extract. But they taste so similar. Dead Orcs, I'm going to Italy. You read GT's message, and you thought it was me? No. Because uh, GT said Italy old news. So I'm like, what are you talking about, Italy old news, GT? She's saying that you don't want to go to Italy anymore. I was reading GT's message. Which one do you prefer? Marmite tastes like butthole. I need to taste them like side by side to be able to know which one's which. They probably got a huge difference, but like I said, I don't need a lot of it to know. Marmite is like Vegemite. Sean, hey bro, how you doing? I'm doing very well, thank you, Sean. How you doing, bud? Welcome in. 
uh, tickets on sale today, Sean, if you didn't know. Just FYR. Every now and again, I just throw out a little public service announcement to remind people about the tickets. Lollerings. Yes. What you... What you thinking about there, Lollerings? Haven't tasted them side by side, but you haven't... But you have... Yes, I have tasted both of them. But just like far apart, like I was saying to Kelly, it's just like very black, tar-like looking, salty, very flavorful spread that I have very little bit on. But I love it with cheese. Oh, Vegemite is good as... I've had Vegemite before too. Like, I, like again, Vegemite tastes like... I remember one of my Aussie friends gave me Vegemite once and she was like, here, yeah, Oryx, have this. So then I was eating it and she was like giggling in the corner and I chowed and she's like, did you like it? I'm like, oh, it's, it tastes like Marmite. Is it Marmite? She's like, no, it's Vegemite. Usually people don't like it. I'm like, no, I like it. We eat it a lot in South Africa. Oh God. She was expecting me to be like, oh, gross, you know, what is this? But I knew exactly what it was. Like, the, again, the Marmites and Vegemites, for me, it all tastes the same. But I'm not a connoisseur in these things. I don't know if you can open the safe. Oh, let me come back. How do I go back? Oh, do I go this one? Let me let me go back up, bro. Let me know what's safe in your one opening, dude. Coming. Dude. Okay. come. <laughs> There's Bovril. Marmite is like shitty brown color with shitty brown. Oh, is it? Okay, so then it's Bovril that I've had most of. But Vegemite's, I don't know. Vegemite's delicious. I liked Vegemite that I had. But it was also like, is it like black? I had a peanut P and B sandwich. What's P and B? Bovril is more viscous. Sorry, bro. I'm coming. I'm coming. Bovril is like OXO. Marmite is the one that burns your mouth and makes your lips swell. What? Your lips swell up when you eat Marmite, bro? What are you eating? Like radiated Marmite, bro. All right. We're going to have to do a Marmite, Vegemite, and Bovril test one of these days. This one is more salty and viscous, and this one is a little more bland. Sticky. But that peanut butter and jelly, not P and B. That's P and J. PBJ, sorry, isn't it? Peanut butter and jelly. Oh, bro, I can't... For some reason, I... I Killing fields. I can't open any of these locks unless it's like an ammo box. But PCs, I can hack computers. I've, I've done a lot of work towards my computer hacking. But sorry, yeah, bro. I can't open that. Yeah, when it comes to lock picks, sheesh, I'm so weak. I can't. No. Yeah. Can't open that safe. Shit. What about this computer, bro? Maybe this computer can open safe. No. Okay, there's nothing here that opens up. Okay. Anyway, we move on. We tried. You all are crazy with your Marmite stuff. I'll just stick to peanut butter. Th I love peanut butter. But I have, like I said, I don't need a lot of Marmite, but I do like it. It's just not something I chow very often. Marmite makes me think of what it would be like to lick a buffalo's rim. That's very descriptive. It's like... 
You thought about that when you ate Marmite. Maybe you were eating Marmite and you went on a game drive. I don't know. Sus. Creative though. Nothing wrong with Marmite and Provitos. No, with cheese on top. When it's just Marmite and Provitos, I feel like it sucks all the fucking water out of my mouth, bro. Marmite and Provito. That shit can drive the ball damn. I hate Marmite. Marmite is the, the velvet fruit loop of South African food. I have AMS. thought about it for long. <laughs> why are so funny, man? Jesus. That's why I can... If I ever go to a comedy show, I'm never going to be impressed. Because I'll just be like, no, it hurts funnier. Find the Raiders. I'm sick of it, bro. Where are the Raiders? I'm so sorry, Killing Fields. If you sick and tired of following me up and down this elevator, you should just release yourself of this anguish and pain and go and live your life somewhere far away from me. Like, because why did they find the raiders? Like, didn't we just kill the fucking raiders? And now this is showing a quest. Oh, yes, I need to go to the basement. Sorry, sorry. No, I'm down. I don't know if you're close to me, Killing Field. Probably not. Relieve yourself of your duty, sir. Dude, oh, I've been hell. eating. Biltong is my lifesaver. Legit. Like, I, I've got. We got some biltong here in the cupboard. And it's been helping me with these longer streams, like you cannot believe. Guess it don't matter long as I'm getting paid. Guess it can't escape me. These guys are so strong. I heard something. Cover me. I'm hit. Cover me. I'm hit. No, lucky no, I am. I'm very lucky. I'm gonna buy some more warm bultong and toasty roll with sauce and cheese. Warm bultong? Oh, These are new boots too. I better get paid double. What was that? No, not tonight. Uh, I'm going to end at normal time at 5 o'clock today. But I'm going to stream till 5. I swear and I then I'll hit up. But I'll stream a long one tomorrow. I'll do 12 hours again on Friday. So I'll be up for your whole Friday. Hanging out. Playing games. Simba chippy butter and bread helps you through the last week before payday. <laughs> Bro, that's a that's a nice meal, Peak Apex. I haven't had a, a chip roll in a while, actually, but I freaking do enjoy a chip roll. Oh, there's a holotype.
Test subject 00 has received their first dose. I don't know what's going on with my Spotify. It's actually... It's really getting to me, man. Test subject 00 has received their first dose of heated ultracite standard dosing amount. It appears that the amplified radiation exposure that occurred in our animal test subject also occurs in humans. The test subject symptoms are severe radiation sickness and the experience total hair loss and significant skin damage. Test subject 00 received triple standard dosage today. It appears that all cognitive brain activity has ceased. The test subject's aggression levels have been increased, likely due to the reduced brain function. Caution is advised. Radiation test subject 00 was unable to sustain the amounts of radiation and is now deceased. I eat pizza, please. I will see pizza. Let's talk to me, Burke. And this Sheena, sweet, how do we get these raiders out of here? Novel, thank you so very much for the water redemption. What are you doing here? The snitch? What the hell? And the post check. The Brotherhood check. sent their lackey to try and bring me back. I told them I refused to even consider it until we found you. They're actually not as bad as I thought. And they helped me find you. But anyway, are you two okay? You look pretty beat up. Been better. Good work on giving these mercenaries hell, Marsha. He'll make a great addition to the war party. So, can you get us out of here or not? Let me find out how to let you out. You can rot in there. Here's your necklace back, Burke. Thank you. I won't forget this. Well, I'm gonna probably kill you after this because I hate you. How did you get captured? Sheena made the right choice. Thanks, Burke. There was no way we would have made it out of there alive. And I knew Pierce wouldn't just let us go missing. My quick thinking is what kept us alive. Not everything can be won with a fight. Okay. Appreciate your help. Don't That's worry, you two. Wit. We'll get you out soon. Leave the raiders. So I failed that quest because I decided to go with opening the cage. Fuck. I don't know if I'm doing the right thing here now. Open the cage and then kill them? I don't know. Sold all control. Hey. Helping raiders, man. Convince Marcia to, to the, uh, return to the Brotherhood of Steel, or convince Mars Marsha, sorry, to stay with the Raiders. Hey. Okay, now that we found Sheena and Burke, we can talk. What's up? Can we talk about you coming back to the Brotherhood? Can you tell me about what happened to your mother from your perspective? It's Let's hear her out. out. But you've been so patient with me. I've really ever only talked about it with Ramirez, but all right. The town that Max and I were living in with our mother was being threatened by a group of raiders. When the Brotherhood came into town, they decided to be saviors. They actually thought it would be a good idea to arm a bunch of ordinary people with high-tech weaponry. When the raiders came, they took the weapons 
and slaughtered our people. If we hadn't tried to fight back, my mother would still be alive. The Brotherhood still did the best that they could. Maybe you're right. I don't know. I'm just filled with so much anger and hurt. Can we talk about you coming back to the Brotherhood? Sure. I'll hear what you've got to say. Come back with me to the Brotherhood. You, Ramirez, Odessa, you've all shown me that maybe all Brotherhood members aren't the same. But I can't just leave the war party. We're family now. You have family at Fort Atlas too. Max needs you to not end up a bootlicker. What would your mother think if you left Max? That's a Mom? good one. You're right. She would be rolling in her grave right now if she knew I left Max in the care of someone else. She always told us to stick together. Marsha, no. Why would you go back to them? The Brotherhood are our enemies. I'm not joining the Brotherhood. But I can't just abandon everyone at Fort Atlas. Their initiate helped me see that. I'm sorry. I really am. I'll never forget the way that you all accepted me into your family. I hope that one day we'll be able to see each other again. And it won't Peak be on Apex. fighting Apex. This girl time. sounds like the awkward girl from Big Bang Theory. For everything. Rod used to date. I'll see you <laughs> back her. at Fort Atlas. Modest. Also, um, Wablin came in here and he also recognized it. I'm shocked that you guys all recognized the voice. Like, I, like now when she was talking, I was like, okay, I 100% I, I hear her. But... We discussed it earlier, yeah, and literally like five minutes ago, Weblin also came in. And I was like, no, Modest was said the same thing. Is that Oats from Garfunkel and Oats? What? J Chill? Are you talking about the song? Oh, uh, Edith Piaf. The Songbird hey. of France. Such a beautiful voice. All right. We bring a suite. We're done. We can leave. Killing Fields Camp. I'm going to fast travel to your camp. Killing Fields. It annoys me so much. I missed it. Her voice annoys, annoys you. What's up, Killing Fields? How come your camp's so cool? Oh, it's a... You, oh, it's actual... Like, what? It's a mini camp that you built here, dude. How do I take all of this stuff? How do I transfer it from here? Jeez. Oh fuck, I just drank alcohol. God. I'm gonna be drunk. Bone worms. Disease cure. That's one thing I could use more of is uh, disease cure.
Fucking done planting flax. Are you planting flax seed in the garden? I found power armor and it despawned. Oh no, bro. It's fine, you'll find more. There's power armor all over the world. Thank you for letting me use your station, bro. You need to heal up, Killing Fields. Do you have stim packs? I'll see you later. I'm going to go up to Fort Atlas, bro. Good luck. Oh, I find it in my inventory. Okay, so it didn't despawn. You got it. I see you right, Sikin. I try to give you a kiss. Anyone who walked the whole Welcome to Fort the country just to get here has earned my attention. What makes you special? Hope you have been having an amazing day, Daddy. I'm sorry I've not uh, been in lately. I've been crazy at work and I'm just, to be honest, over it. And I need something, I need to find something new. I just want positive vibes. So I will keep lurking as always. Much love to all you amazing herdies. Hope you're all enjoying the, today. We're having so much fun, bro. I'm sorry that you're so busy. I'm missing you too, buddy. But stay positive. Good vibes all around. You got this fight for death angel. Just keep putting yourself out there, man. It's that consistency every day, man. And I promise you, you'll get what you want, dude. These new initiates, I may need another scribe just to keep the scrolls. I'm trying, man. You, you got this, bro. Anyone. Welcome back, initiate. I see that Marcia has returned and in brighter spirits than before. I don't know how you managed it, but. Great work. Did you discover anything else on your mission? There was this letter from someone named B. Hmm. This letter is concerning. While Marsha wasn't missing, it seems that these Hellcat mercenaries and the Blue Ridge Caravan Company are both involved in the other disappearances. Please, take this to Romani as soon as you can. She'll want to hear about this.
Come to help out in the shop? Do you sell any of your stuff, right, Sikkim? Have you been selling? Like, I haven't sold anything. I literally store everything and... Maybe the... When I have a chat with Darkest, he'll help me with my inventory sorting one of these days. Yo, check out this. I want access to this room, bro. Doesn't even have a name on it. Unless you carrying parts separately. Yeah, I don't know where the shops are. Neither do I. Yeah, I'm not even there yet. Like, I'm just collecting. And then I'll do a building time. Where one of these days I'll just build a camp. Spend like a stream building an awesome camp. And then... Yeah, I'll take it from there. Probably we survivors can help you to build it also, no? For sure. We work together. I, wonder what I need to buy meds. Lol, I'll like stay low on meds and gotta eat food while fighting. No, yeah, the meds are a problem. That's why they say like you gotta. I mean, I think you can build a camp to get a, to a point where like you get ammo, meds, clean water, hey, everything. Whose accent was that? Uh, that's Rixmas in chat, yeah. but that's verbal it. four in um, yeah. in st stream. Twitch. So hey, so lovely. I agree. Yeah, just me too. Just I, you know what I have done, right, Sikin? Which everyone can is you can have an underground vault. If you had a, if you built that, like everyone can. I just built that because then everything is just in like one little place underground. I can, it just like it's for a temporary, temporary home. And then when I want to build a camp, then I'll take everything and build above ground. Maybe build next to a river or a lake where I can get some water. Underground vault with the outside defense. I understand your frustration. Um, Finding everyone that has gone missing is my top priority. Is that what you're looking at now? I, I, I don't know if uh, the one I built had uh, defenses. It was just literally a, a hole in the ground. But very cool. If you want me, I can. If you go to my camp, you can have a look at it. You have been to my camp, though. All right, you saw it. Yeah, that's cool. Just for a temporary place. Oh yeah, how did you get that underground vault? I was trying to do it last night, but couldn't figure it out. It's just a building um, asset that you've. I think we've all got it. Mr. Knapp here has come to I'll show you another missing persons case. My niece Cassie, Cassie Holloway. She paid some caravan and folk to help her travel here from out west. Sent me some letters just before she set out. The letters arrived just fine, but she didn't. I went and spoke with them caravanners, and they tell me that my Cassie never set out with them at all. Those, uh, Blue Mountain Woodsons. Uh... The Blue Ridge Caravan Company. Blue Ridge, I found a letter saying that mercenaries would acquire people from them. So down a second, what's the full situation? I went to and spoke to the caravanners, and they tell me that Cassie never set out with them at all. Those are Blue Mountain What's It. Really? This letter said they would acquire more people from Blue Ridge? Interesting. This is the first real lead we found, and it connects directly with what Mr. Knapp is reporting. <laughs> I actually had my own suspicions about the organization, but this information certainly tips the scales. Hmm, I 
Black Man I've made several attempts Blue to contact Caravan. the Blue Ridge Caravan Company in hopes of trading supplies. They turn me down. Every time. I understand that the Brotherhood can be an intimidating presence. And the West Virginia chapter didn't exactly leave behind a shining legacy. But I think we've shown we have Appalachia safety and security at heart. Yet, they remain unwilling to even speak. Hmm. I find it suspicious. During our travels, we found that a caravan group was just as often a cover for slavers and raiders. The friendly guys for rolling through towns. Hmm. I didn't suspect Blue Ridge of such a first. But their repeated refusal to talk, Mr. Knapp's story, and this letter are simply too much to ignore. Okay, what's next? We need to investigate this Blue Ridge Caravan Company immediately. And they have an office at the west end of the Big Bend Tunnel. Initiate! I'd like you to meet me there. But try not to attract too much attention either. They realize we're in the Brotherhood, they make clam up. And I'll see you there. I don't take orders from you, Romani. Remember. Wait, you're joining me on this mission. That's right. Fort Atlas is secure for the time being, and with Shin out of commission, I'd like to step in and do my part. This is our strongest lead by far. The two of us need to act quickly if we hope to safely return those that went missing. Fine, I'll see Thank you there. Thank you, Initiate. At Victorian. I thought she didn't dig me after I tried to stop her. Went against her. Find the kids of Fort Atlas. Thanks, man. Thanks. I'm going to hop on now. I've finished my work. Now I just want to finish messing around with this AI image gen. It's fun, eh? Okay, I'll show you quickly, Lex, if you're still there. What is going on here? You see, that's what's nice about this place, bro. Is you don't need defenses. No one can get into this vault. You're not going to get attacked. All good. So you just go to build. And then it is. Oh, I need to set this up. And I need to set that up. In shelters, you see you got... Bro, you can have your own vault even. That's so cool. But it's this one. Bro, it's just that. Check. Boom. You plonk this down, then it gives you that, that thing. I mean, so did you see that? Loving this music from Fallout. I'm glad you're enjoying it. I've been throwing in some other music every now and again. Like I'll, that, that follows the kind of trend of Fallout's music. Like I was playing Edith PF earlier and I was playing some Colter Wall. Really good music and it uh, fits the profile very well. Oh, I need to bring that. Uh, hmm. Oh, you... So when you want to build here, obviously you're building things, you go here. Scrap all. Okay. 
go. Put this guy. And we put this guy. Workbench repair. I don't have springs. Are you kidding me? I feel like all I do is loot in this place, killing fields, and I'm missing springs, bro. What the hell? I'm getting ripped off here. How's the grind, dude? Vamp, it's going well, bro. What level you on now in Fallout? Bingo, bongo, bango. Gosh. I've returned. Welcome back, Huntress. Probably will lose my watch streak next week. I'm going to be streaming long hours next week, Huntress. Try and do like, you know, 11 hours, 12 hours, maybe some days. I think I'm level 27, that's the last. So are you still enjoying it, Bamp? Pino test the grape out on a date. Grape says you are nuts. <laughs> uh, sorry, say that again. Uh, Peanut asks a grape out on a date. Grape says you are nuts. <laughs> Where'd you find that? Uh, it's in your cards right here from the uh, on follow-up <laughs> uh, i get those jokes from the opening up the card packs yes yeah is. yeah <laughs> they're so funny i'm leaving for the funeral either saturday or sunday shame dude it's so awful huntress so sorry 
I'm going to quickly go get something to drink. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Boo, boo.
I'm enjoying the game besides a uh, little bit of server issues. Yeah, it's good fun, eh? I'm glad you're enjoying it, fam. Does anyone know Drowsy Druzy? Yeah, I do. Well, she's raided me before. I've been in her stream. She's cool. Content creator. Yeah, can you ask her Ask her to do a roly-poly or jumping jack? <laughs> she's officially banned me from asking, so I want to know if she, if she was biased. <laughs> My actual base is opposite your base, if you go across the river. I can see it, yeah. I see it's right there. I think this is... A, are you building your base here for sure? I am online. Where are you going, Lex? You were just here. I'm relogging. Okay, sweet. Baba T, afternoon, herding. Herdies. Adult team has taken most of my day away. It happens, Papa T. It happens, bro. Are you having a good day though, Papa T? Everything going well? Don't forget to buy a ticket, guys. If you've got 25,000 channel points to drop on the Wheel of Anxiety. There's been... More you, you what? You just did? <laughs> I just bent it and got more excited. <laughs> You got to, you got to do some saving, bro. A day being good, we got a fresh cut. Hey, nice. Took my wife for lunch and enrolling my oldest into pre-primary school for next year. A very busy day. Sounds like a good day though, bro. How old is your oldest, Papa? Oh, your old yeah, so that's your old you got four kids and that's your oldest. So how old is your oldest? If it's pre-primary, is so it 5 years old? 3 years old. Still says I'm offline for some reason. Does... What? I see you in the main menu. I can join like Charade. I can join Tread Veresta. But you are like not... What? That's so weird, Lex. What the hell? Oh, he's 25 this year. Okay, sweet. Uh, peak OMC, put your face back on my screen. Yeah, I don't know what's happening, Lex. But it was, yeah, it was not majestic. Oh, stop it, Peaky. Let me leave my vault. I don't think it'll make a difference, though. Ball scratching must be done on screen. Yes, sir.
Now I can join you. Lex, can you join me? Maybe it was because I was in that... Try join me now, Lex. <clears throat> okay, meet Roma Romani at the Blue Ridge Ca Cavern Company office. Okay. I'll go to the uncanny uncanny cabins and make my way down. Yes. Still says you're offline my side. I can see Darkest online though. What? Darkest? I don't know if he's in... I don't know if you can hear me, Darkest. Can't you join on my game? So that Lex can join on you. And then we can all be in the same server. Ooh, right skin is dead. Yeah, it says... Uh, Dead's offline for me too. What? Is it a glitch, do you think, Darkest? Must I exit and come back into the game? Raw, raw, daddy's dead. I'm alive. And kicking. What stock is playing on? PC. Yeah, relog. Don't you hout. Don't you what? What me? I can't join you either, dead. You have to send us invites. But like, I can join people. Okay, uh, Riskmas, uh, Killing Fields. I'm gonna relog and I'll re invite you guys. Sure, sure. As I said, uh, uh, g oh, game, oh, you mean on that game pass, alright. As I said earlier, I've enjoyed the game besides server issues, yeah. Little server issues are, they're niggly little things. They're not, at least they're not game breaking, you know. Better have that guy with a nice accent in your game again, mister. Yes, I will. I'll re invite him, don't worry. You have joined a team. Play with team. It just put me back into the team. <laughs> no, I'm not in his session, Kelly. But I can send a voice note if you like. Little shits. I can see you now. Awesome. Shit, I'm not even in the game yet. I don't have an accent, but I've had people tell me my voice is unfortunate.
Searching for world, please stand by. Why is it taking so long? I've heard his voice, Kelly. He's got a lovely voice. Why is this not working? Ek ook a goes goes stem hu hu goer ek opho hu beter beter lame piki I read that terribly but I understood all of it Dead's lying. Dead has such a sultry voice. It's like warm butter to my eardrums. That's a lie. Speak like a five-year-old. But thank you, Darkest. Why well, the shit do you want warm, warm butter in your ears? Don't you want warm butter in your ears, Kelly? Sounds delicious. I'm certain if you had to read something to me, I'd get all sleepy. Really? Make me blush. It's an expression, Kelly. Shit, you are blonde. Flip sakes, woman. The sky is an emotional roller coaster, Kelly. Oh my. How are you doing, Lol Rings? Are you tired? Are you sleepy yet? Okay, what's going on? Why is my game not going in? Do I have to exit again and relog? Bruh. Shame you are. How's your mouth, lol rings? Dead, you see, she bullies me on the WhatsApp even. Oh, no. Kelly bullies you, bro. Just chilling. Curled up in bed. Not sleepy yet. You're going to tell us all a story? A uh, story, hey? bedtime story let me tell you about fallout in the wasteland comedians in chat many zero many many I'm so blessed to be surrounded by all these legends Oh no, my game. Press any button to start signing in. If this doesn't work, I'm going to leave the team and try again. It's definitely bully, Kelly. I was even using my indicators as you sent that. I promise I was using them to cut off an idiot Hyundai driver driving 40 in a 60 zone like Pliss. 
take your license back to Pep. I managed to have soup, so I'm doing alright. Okay, awesome, yeah. Shame. Man, I'm drooling for a peanut butter and syrup sandwich, but who can take their eyes off of Dead Rocks for one minute? Stop it, Zero. Go make yourself a peanut butter syrup sandwich. I'll be right here when you get back. Alright, let me let me leave this team. Okay, I'll reinvite you, guys. Here we go. Now I'm going in. See, game was glitching. Yo, where's Lycan? Lycan and Shmami have been AFK the whole day. I think Lycan's upset with me. Shmami is busy uh, booking appointments. What's shoulder laid? Booking appointments, huh? I've heard that term in a movie or two. The shoulder lane, that's the lane uh, on the other side of the yellow line. So you get the yellow line in that little lane on the left of the yellow line. That's the shoulder lane. Isn't it? Is that what you mean by shoulder lane? Darkest. Oh, like Alex, I'll see you, bro. Let's freaking go. Huh. I'm on my way. Cool, cool. I'm going to create a new team. Marco. Polo. Hey, what's up, bro? Let's go, Chet. You're looking handsome, Chet. What's up, what's up gang? What's up, what's up? My name's Lucy. Lucy. Yeah. Lucy, Juicy Lucy, bro. You check these running animations, I swear I could give Usain a run for his money. Yo, bro, you are fast, dude. Sheesh. I've got new shoes, I can run real fast. Fast fuck we. Zoom. Hey Diddy, how would I join in on this fun? Have you got the game, bro? First step, get hey, the bro. game. Second step, Those add me, Dead Oryx, without any spaces. And then, yeah, you can join on. You, uh, I've got a full team right now, but you can still be in the same server as me. And you can follow us around, but you're just not officially in the team. Because it's a four squad, but it's nice just being in the same server, you know? I do have the game from Prime. Let's go, bro. Then just add me. Yay, yeah, nuclear flood. Turn that jukebox off. I got my own music, thank you. Hey, Paladin. Ah, there you are, Anishi. I mean, friend. Sorry for the informality, but we should keep a low profile. 
Don't want to spook anyone that might be listening in. I'm just busy downloading it right now. Sweet. Yeah, let me know when you're ready. Uh, I'm going to end earlier today at 5 o'clock. But I'll be back on tomorrow. So if we don't get games today in Nuclear Flat, I'll definitely be back tomorrow. And I'll stream uh, 12 hours tomorrow. So I'll be on until 8 in the evening. So we can play all day long. Sure thing, Leela. Can we just get on with this already? Huh. Don't get too used to that. But listen. I won't. I was hoping we could talk for a few minutes before we head upstairs. Let me buy you a drink. What do you say? Sure. I could use a drink. Flirt? Why, Paladin? I did not know you saw me that way. I'm gonna flirt. This is the first time this has come up. You bought your oh, license from breath. Pep? I'm being real here. Pep, eh? We need to hash out. I should come be on, able to join you to tomorrow see. then. Awesome, dude. Yeah, we'll, a lot of exploring tomorrow. Oh, cut the crap. I'm being real here. There's some things we need to hash out. Come on, pull up a stool. Sure, I could use a Great. drink. Take a seat. Sounds like a plan. Oh boy, a customer. <laughs> Look at Lex. What can I get oh, let's go. Thank you for the water redemption. I'm busy drinking some electrolytes, so I'll grab that. Thank you, bro. Whiskey neat, bottle of uh, pickaxe pilsner. Just a new cola, whatever will knock me out the fastest. Let's go for that uh... one. I've got a container of nuclear waste in the back, but you don't look like much of a ghoul to me. So, uh, how about a whiskey for now? Okay, here you go. Enjoy. I'm going to need you to be standing by the end of this, you know. Salomati, my friend. So about you and I, Shin? Oh, I'd rather not ruin this. I just need a brief moment where I'm not a paladin to a headstrong, self-righteous, mutinous knight. What made you join the brother? <laughs> oh god, Lex, it's hilarious. Smudge! How you, bro? Tip for running across country. Make sure it's a small country. How's it all? How you doing, Smudge? Welcome in, bro. Noted. Is that a Capital Craft glass you're drinking from? It is indeed, bro. It's Capital Craft. From the lot. Did you go to the um, beer festival last year, Peaky? Okay, what made you join the Brotherhood? That's interesting phrasing. Oh, I didn't know. Join. Would you be keen to go this year? It's Never quite really a jewel, bro. That way. I was already in the National Guard, helping people, maintaining peace. I went to the Oktoberfest. Damn. Did you go with uh, Dead Reply, eh? I missed that one. Well, like regrouping with I almost people. went. A return to form. Maybe some ranks and verbiage changed, but the heart of it was there. I'm not sure I even gave it a second thought. Sounds like it was a good fit. It was. I'm going to Malkfest next what month. I know now. I, I think no we ideas. are going to Malkfest too, like me and Furious. My comrades. But things changed as time rolled on. Well, as I'm sure you know, the views of the elders and I differed greatly. Sometimes I think. No, I'm certain that I was selected for this mission in order to the remove my The sexiest man on Twitch. How are you doing, bro? The Very well, thank you, Dunks. How you doing, buddy? Welcome in. Never align with their goals. What Good. <laughs> Let's go, Peaky. Uh, why haven't I heard of Malkfest? Ads I'm getting are, are all wrong. To make it here alone. I haven't heard of Malkfest either until literally like Joke two weeks them, ago, bro. Alan Connors. That's right. Dear, dear friend. The two of us were from the same unit in the National Guard. Alan had been my rock through every storm I weathered. We survived Alfred the bombs Khan's together. Alfred Khan's festival, but going to be a jewel. Oh, absolutely, bro. more than my right hand. I believe you. really a lifelong companion. I'd never really considered a world without him. Not just to me, either. To both Valdez and Why does Shane. the song sound familiar? 
He was like a big brother. It's from Fallout. Even a father. Have you ever played Fallout before? He was always there for them. That's the part that gets to me. He was an important person to damn near everyone. It's what makes his absence hurt even more. Seems like he was a great man. Indeed. He was the bedrock of this team. And things were never the same with Shin from then. Yeah, I got this from the beer fest. Mm -hmm. Shin stepped you up have to get a, you buy the glass when you go you get in. And then you have to buy tokens to top up your beer. That must have been a lot to handle. It led him to fall back on what he knows. The rules, the doctrine. He doesn't trust anyone else to help him see beyond that. Not like he trusted Alan. And because of me, because of a call I made, we all lost him. I know Shin will never forgive me for it. Shin told me a bit. Sounds like he was guilty too. No. I was the commanding officer. Blame starts at the top. That's one subject the two of us agree on. Even if he doesn't realize it. Sorry for your loss. Thank you for Tip. hearing me out. It's an honor to pass on his Are story. you drinking a beer over there, Lex? He deserves that and so much more. Let's finish with I the toast. That's a fine right, idea. To whom? <laughs> To the Brotherhood, to Knight Connors. Yes, to Knight Alan Connors. I'm very well, Thank thanks, bro. Started teaching that. prax this week, Miss so Adamanti. made now, busy. On to business. Miss uh, waking up in the mornings and turning, turning you on to you, tu turning on to you. Sorry, I meant pulling you up on Twitch. For potential business. I'm good. I'm glad that you're busy, bro. Are you happy what you're doing? Uh, what you're doing there? And hey, thanks. Are you enjoying it? Oh yeah, I forgot to mention oh, Oryx, no, that key for Fallout 4 was already redeemed, but my friend went and bought... No, he shouldn't have, dude. Isn't I had like feels? several other I mean, keys I could have sent you, that's why I... Let me... Shit. Oh no, I've got like 10 far, keys we could have tried. If you have any, if you want me to send you the keys that I've got, a list of them, you can try all of them, bro. I'm sure more than one of them will work. I don't know why that one didn't work. Uh, it, it should it should have worked, but I've got more. So if you have any other friends, if you want me to send them to you, Pickle, let me know. Like, I had like 10 of them. Sorry that one didn't work. No, that's all right, lol. It's only six Aussie dollars at the moment. Yeah, it, it is cheap, but six Aussie dollars that he could have saved and bought a beer. Could have bought a f himself a Forex. I'm happy to be out of varsity class. I'm sure you are, bro. I'm sure you are. Uh, okay. You see this, uh... Whose arm is Karaoke this? Oh, nice. So you're going to sing us a song? Go for it, bro. Uh, oh, no, it's not maybe working. More. Yeah, we might need a few more. Ask them to turn the machine on, maybe. Herschel, get on that. We'll be back in a few. <laughs> is he? Right, Hirsch. Cheers, yeah, Hirsch. Thank you for the beer, bro. Appreciate it. I mean, the whiskey. Is this your power armor? One beer eh, at a bar is probably like 10 bucks now. I'm not even going to lie. Yeah. Probably. Yeah, don't get one at a bar. So that wasn't yours, Lex? No. Who the hell put the power armor there? Oh, no, wait, I need to still go in there, bro. I haven't finished my, my job in there. Sorry, I'm going back. How many dollars is 10 bucks? Band Slam 33. Hello, hello. How are you doing, Band Slam 33? Welcome in. How are you doing? Oh, have you returned and to looky the there. You've got one of those famous Band Slam, thank you for the follow, bro. Oh, Good. Man, Glad man. to hear that. Where are you from, Band Slam? 10 Aussie dollar, I think it's like, I don't know what the conversion is actually, I, thought, I know it's Aussie dollar is a little bit less than a US dollar, right, so it's probably like $12, I mean, sorry, not to, like $8 US maybe, got home from work, Indonesia, nice bro, how was work, have a good day, 
Been looking into it for a spell now. Okay then, tell us what you know. We have a, we have to act fast. Before that, you should know we have evidence connecting Blue Ridge to all this. We know you're interested in the folk that have gone missing. We are, we are too. Been looking into, looking into it for a spell now. All right, that's fine by me. Right now, the most important thing is finding everyone that has gone missing and returning them home. Being up front with Classic Oryx still alive. Let's go. Yes, sir. Damn, 10 bucks in South Africa is definitely much less than that. They are safe. Slow down, Paladin. This is not an yeah, so or an attempt 123 to Rand for a beer. Isn't that just so you. cheap, eh? We're to a beer here in South Africa, lol ranks. If you go to a pub, you're, you're gonna pay like 50 rand for a draft. So 50 team. rand you're out of luck. for a beer, we have the for same a pint. Goals as you in this. So it's like more than double the price worth, in Australia. Hey, it's cheaper. Eh? People that went missing from your caravan. Better to just let you take a look for yourselves. Aries. There's uh, if you go to the. There's a beer in South Africa called a Line Lager, and it's not a bad beer. It's like, you know, it's like a 4X or anything like that, just like your standard lager that you'll get. And a Line Lager is like 19 Rand for a liter and a half of beer. So that's like just over $1 and a few cents, like $1 and 10 cents for one and a half liters of beer you can get here in South Africa. This guy looks like some kind of god, probably aren't. Don't take your eye off him. Agreed, I got your back. Thanks. It's good to follow your instincts. They rarely steer me wrong. You rang <laughs> But you guys only earn 20 rand a day. That's the thing. That's the thing. Four Aussie dollars for a beer. You really want to go back there? That was exactly yeah, we have crazy tax on alcohol, though. Head on over to that tunnel and show this duo of detectives the scene of the crime. Does that sound amenable to y'all? That is exactly my thinking, Aries. Head over to the tunnel and show this duo of detectives the scene of the crime. Does that sound amendable to y'all? I think we have what we need. Let's go. What are we expecting to find there? All right. Okie dokie. I'll meet you there. Okay, it's okay. a big fancy train tunnel just east of Harper's Ferry. Now, time is money, and I've burned a bottle and plant worth of caps chatting with you two. So if you don't mind, please direct any further inquiries to my masked associate. Fine. But after reviewing the evidence, I plan to revisit Blue Ridge's involvement in this matter. By all means. If you find something that gets us answers, we can talk to the Brahmin come home. Derox, did you see Tino got engaged? What the flip? He did? I didn't see that. I saw a picture on... Oh, I did see a picture, and but I, I just went past it. The man was... Did he upload a picture like on a knee? On Instagram? The man dropped a knee? Shit. He, he operates quickly, eh? Man moves fast. Good for him, dude. Good for him. Seems like it's always cloudy. A pack of cigarettes here is like no ways, bro. Are you kidding me? Is it really 50 Aussie dollars for one Don't pack of smokes? You have to be like super rich if you want to smoke cigarettes. Now the one you saw is the engaged one. Yeah, that's it, right? Let me, let me check Instagram quickly. Looks like it might rain later. Dean. Oh, okay. Sorry, yeah, it wasn't a knee. I don't know. It's this photo. 
I didn't read the caption. Australia is a nanny state. Sheesh. Let me write here. Congrats. Hmm. You piece of shit. I know sh a guy who could fix that. Cool. Oh, that's awesome, bro. I'm happy for the guy. Do you know the little legend? Bro, uh, cigarettes here in South Africa, it's 50 Rand for a box, but that's like your normal brand of mold, bro. You can buy much cheaper cigarettes in South Africa. You, there's cigarettes here for like, what is it? What is our cheap box of cigarettes? Like, you know, those blue 12, 12 what? Yeah, I don't know what it's called. For my friends, is that legal <laughs> cigarettes though? Can you buy that at the spa? Yeah, I know. You can get illegal derby. Are those legal? In Norway, it's Chief. like 18 euros. Ew. So we get illegal cigarettes in South Africa. They're very popular. Like they, you find them all over the place. So if you buy illegal cigarettes, so those are untaxed cigarettes, you're paying like 50 cents, bro, for a box of 20. If you're buying like your normal legal cigarettes, it's 50 rand for a box. So that's like two and a half dollars for a box of cigarettes. Now it's gonna be you guys grow your own? Grow your own what cigarettes? Cigarettes don't grow on trees. They actually do. The paper, the tobacco. I like his, he's got a lovely accent. I also like it. All right. Oh, why are we cooking it? Yeah, let's get out of this place, bro. This looks quite dangerous. I need to go to... Go to the Harpers Ferry train tunnel. Where the sh Where is that? Big Ben tunnel. Sore all over. Building this place up is hard work. No, what? Oh, you're... It's, it's quite far away, Lex. We've got quite a mission. I'm going to go to Kerwood Mine. I'm going to walk from there. If you want to jump onto me. Kerwood Mine. Hmm. Did I actually check. better keep Darker safe? He just helped me out so much. I will do my best, Bulletstorm. I'll keep the man's... Are you in the game, bro? Why don't you invite me, Bulletstorm? Dead Oryx with no spaces. Jump into my server. In the mire. Alright, let's... Let's... Let's trek. Me, no, I'm not in, bro. Don't have the game. Okay, so what did, uh, what did Doc... I thought you was talking about in-game. Is there like a hub where your players can trade, chill, and do stuff? Yeah. all uh, In this game, yeah. All over, bro. I haven't been... Like, you can do it by your bases. I mean... It's anywhere. Two or three death claws in the tunnel? Oh, in tech support, DC. Bro, Darkest is such a champ, bro. He always, like, the first to help people. I will always look after that man. I'll... Always. W Song 2. Yeah. 
Can I play you? I played it yesterday. I don't know if you heard it, Juicy Pickle. Can I play you a cover of the song by Call to Wall? Listen to this version. Oh, you heard that one? Okay, you did hear it. I'm playing it again. I just dig this guy's voice, man. Oh. Darkest is right here. Yeah. Hey, what are you guys doing in the grass, bro? Dodgy mother flippers. <laughs> yeah, boy. As long as you invite me, I don't care what we do. Death Call is my favorite creature in Fallout. Your favorite? I think we're going to need to get you a vault. That's what I've been saying, Snowball. That's what I've been saying, bro. Bro, this is the overseer's journey. Flip. There's actually a mission here for me, a quest to do here. We'll come back to that. We got company. Cultists. Oh shit. This guy's are strong. Holy smokes, and they killed me, bro. No, I'm gonna die. Dude, that was a proper ambush. This is a worthy death. Nice work, gentlemen. Nice work. What item in the wasteland has springs in them? Like, I realized, like, I don't have springs. Is it like alarm clocks or something? I feel like it's clocks. Clipboards, noob. What did you just call me, Snakey? This is not a good idea going through the swamp, but we'll make quick work of it. A lot of radiation in this water. Don't put any of it in your mouth, okay? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes.
Hello, Diddy. Hello, Kylo. How are you, bro? But, but... No, lol, rinks. Don't drink the irradiated water. Sit there. Me. I'll have to post some photos of my camps in the Discord. Yeah, because we can't see them, dude. Please do. It tastes good, though. It's got a prickly taste to it. Drink it all. It'll help with superpowers. I'll turn into a ghoul. Which isn't a bad thing, because you get to live longer if you're a ghoul. There's a ghost. There's a little fire going over here. I think I'm going to call it here before I go into this mine. I mean, flipping sucks. Jeez, right? Can you look so creepy, bro? What are you? Are you even a human being, bro? Did you skip the leg there? Bro, look at this oak. The apple bottom jeans, the boots and the fur. Look at these hoes. <laughs> Yeah, take off your shoes. I want to take a picture of your feet. Oh, take he's got the shoes. power take armor glitch. Oh, what does that give us, bro? Alex? I have no idea. I think it just opens up the party. Oh, I think it trapped me. Also taking my things. A junk or scrap in inventory. Oh, flip scrap kits. Okay, I'll see what that does. It scraps your stuff on the go. Okay, right, skin, you look better, dude. Yeah. You were freaky. You look, look like Slender Man. GT? Oh, jeez. I thought it was GT. Hello, Darkest. <laughs> hey, Johnny Walker. Middag, How are you doing, Johnny? Middag to you too, sir. Not going to lie. I thought that was fixed. Unfortunately not, sir. Eh? But guys, I'm going to call it here. If, if you're going to be back tomorrow for us to do more of these missions, you can keep going through here. I don't know if any of you guys are doing this mission. But I'll definitely be back tomorrow to continue this. If you guys are down. Thank you for the game. Sorry it was so short, Lex, man. Ah, oh, Dread Vares has got a camp here. I was actually thinking it's doing the same thing, Lex. I mean, Dread. No, you chill. We got tomorrow still. Yeah. No, I'm having so much fun. I just don't want the fun to end. But I, I just didn't want to get to the shops. We can have more fun if you close this tent and turn off the lights. We can do that. Get inside, yeah. <laughs> you guys wait outside. It's Darkest's turn. Lucky. Your turn's next, Lex. Hang on, I've got a camera. I want to take pictures. Close the tent. <laughs> They're taking photos. <laughs> hey, hey, can I stop watching? That's 50 bucks, bro. Okay, Dark as your voice is not unfortunate, place man. Hey, yeah. right? He's got such a lovely voice. Isn't it so nice? I don't even want to see what you guys are doing here. What are these guys are doing? Are you doing gin and moose? So lovely to see you, bro. Are you well, my friend? Welcome, welcome. Hey, stop it. I don't want people to see this. Thank you, guys. Beautiful. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Fuck.
Fuck. I feel well rested. Bye bye, you beautiful man. Bye bye. Classic RP. You love it. Don't you? Lovely Mensa of the Herd, people of the Herd. Thank you for the stream today, Teddy. Absolute legend. Dude, lol rings. Thank you guys for hanging with me today and keeping me company. I enjoyed the vibes, the conversation, and everything again, like always. What a freaking awesome Thursday it has been, hanging out with the Herd. We're doing it all over again, though, tomorrow, and we'll do a longer stream tomorrow. I remember when, Ke I remember when Kelly Serenity RP'd for like two days. Oh, I'm sad you only got a few minutes. I'll be back tomorrow, Kylo. Me too. I missed you today, Kylo. I hope you had a good day though, bro. But I'll catch you tomorrow morning. Absolutely. Thank you for the stream, Daddy. Thank you, Dreddy. We'll be back tomorrow. We'll do this all over again. Um, so the person for the raid today, I was thinking we can go and raid uh, Kilani. Remember Kilani hit us with a big raid during the week. Such a legend. So I just want to pay the favor back. Send her a raid and get to meet her in person she's lovely cheers old man snakey cheers brother no half time uh what's part-time streamer have i earned your respect yet snakey tomorrow i'll do a 12 hour stream we are raiding anyone yeah i was thinking to someone that raided us during the week I just want to send the love back and also show you who it was that raided us. He's definitely full time. The HR department gave me a warning. They did. Are you leaving? I'm leaving you, Novel. I'm leaving early today, but tomorrow I'll be back and we'll do a long 14, uh, 12 hour stream. I don't 14, 12 hours. Screams, no, please be quiet. Shh. Novel. I'm so sorry. I'm going to miss you so very much. I'm going to miss you all. Raging. Two days? Yeah, sure. Novel has passed away. <laughs> oh no. Novel, please. Wake up. We know you're faking. You said 30. Us, that's it. Us 12. It's Novel's dinner. Yes, Novel, it's dinner time. You need to go make dinner anyway. So I better leave you early. So that you can go make some dinner. Cheers, Daddy. Enjoy your evening. Nuclear Flood, thank you for hanging with us. You too, buddy. Enjoy your evening, dude. 12 mares, I'll do 24. I want to build up to a nice 24-hour stream. So I, I want to build like a whole thing that we're going to do for the 24-hour to make it like fun. I'm just checking to see if Kalani is not raiding out. I don't think she is. Okay, let's go and hit her up with a, a raid. Can we grab a raid message and blow up the stream and say what's up to him? Us a bliff, guys. Please. I appreciate it so much. Show the love and support back. To this list. Sorry, not joining. Just join in the beginning. And then you can leave if you're not happy. But I promise you... She is a lots of fun. She's a very awesome content creator. Very chill vibes. Very pretty as well. GG, man. Have a good one. You too, uh, Juice Pickle. Anyway, gonna make banana bread. Hey, let's go. Send us pictures in Discord. Bye-bye, novel. Guys, everybody, thank you so very much. I had lots of fun, like I said. And shall see you on the flip. This is a cool song to end stream with. I don't like pretty girls. That's why me and Kelly are friends. Good morning, everyone. Cal girl up. Good morning. We're just about to head out. It's lovely to see you, though. You caught right me right at the end. I hope you're had a, having a good morning. And I hope you have a fantastic day. Bye-bye, Dead Oryx. And you, all you beautiful herdies. Bye. Wake up just in time for the raid. Thank you for joining in on the raid.
I'll see you tomorrow again. Because I'll do a longer stream tomorrow. So I'll see you tomorrow at least. Have an awesome evening further. Deddy and Hurdy saying, you too, bro. I've been lurking all night. Thank you so much, Cowgirl App, for the looks. Appreciate it. You okay, have a great day. Thank you. You too. Cheerio, everyone. Love you lots. Like jelly tots. See you tomorrow. Bye.